I'm guessing that's the true max. I don't know. Maybe the more you progress in the base. Yeah, because in Neo the strong or whatever. Base game, 160 was the max that you could get. Hmm. Outside of the glitch that I told you about, where if you soul match something in a weird way, you could get a level 320 item mm. before Way of the Demon was even released, and you could just walk through the game hitting things for 40,000 damage or so. Wow. What are the chances I get, like, a, a purple, though? I mean, a ethereal. From forging. There's a drop not that high, but you can forge them. <laughs> but, like, it doesn't show a percentage for ethereals. That's I mean, because ethereal when you divines. click on the forge button, you have to press triangle to select how many divine fragments you want to use. Which uh, determines okay. the chance of it being divine. So, wait, we're... What the hell? Where do I go? When you go to click on the forge button, you click triangle instead of oh, X. Okay. And it brings up a little sub-menu that lets you choose how many divine fragments. You can choose, I believe, up to 10, which gives you like an 89% chance to get the divine. But I normally just use one divine fragment and just roll it a couple times. Because you'll... You still have statistically just as likely a chance of getting one in the same amount of fragments. In 10 Divine Fragments with a 50% chance of getting it, you're just as likely to get it as if you use 10 Fragments with an 89% chance. Oh, I see what you mean. Mm-hmm. Just what statistically speaking. Oh, I have 124. Yeah. Nice. Got one. Oh, wait, I already have a freaking... Ah, uh, I forgot that I already had a freaking Yariki divine helmet and I was using that <laughs> and you didn't even know that you could get it divine <laughs> no I I didn't know you can forge it as divine I know you can get it as oh, divine yeah yeah you can also get it from uh, Donjo as divine too Donjo. if you go and buy armor pieces in a slot you want I mean getting Yuriki is obviously gonna be a real low chance but his stuff comes he can give you divines that are green and have plus rarity to them. I got like a plus two weapon from him. Because mm. <laughs> I, I just like hearing his chest piece. voice when you get something good. <laughs> you're icky, you're icky. Uh, one of my, one of the dudes I was playing with yesterday asked me to play again today. Not mm. the. Not the dude that you laughed at because he sounded like a meal or whatever the reason for you yeah, laughing at him Yeah, he was such was. a goober as soon as he joined the party and he just like, I don't know, that guy was just funny. He's a very, uh, how would you say, meme-tastic bro dude. <laughs> he types every second sentence has an emoticon. Emoticon, ew. <laughs> <laughs> That's like one of those like, oh, it's a smiley face, but it's smiling with a tear over one eye to imply like, oh god. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Everything's okay, but it's really not. <laughs> Hide the pain, Harold. <laughs> That's a thing? Have you never seen Hide the Pain, Harold? No, I have not. It's that fucking old ass man that you see in memes with the smile and the coffee cup that kind of looks like he's half hearted smiling. Mm. Mm. If you search Hide the Paint Herald, you'll be like, oh, that guy. He's like a freaking Turkish m uh, model. Hold on, I'll look <laughs> him up. I the pain. Oh, it immediately came up. Oh, that guy. Yeah, exactly. I told you. <laughs> Everyone has seen his face, but no one knows what the meme is called. It's Hide the Pain Harold, even though the guy's name is not Harold. Yeah, it's Andres Arata or some shit. Yeah, because he's Turkish. Mm. He actually did a TED Talks where he sp learned how to speak fluent English just so he could do the TED Talk and speak about it. Hmm, that's crazy. 
because he was like he found it so weird that his random because he he got offered a he got offered money obviously to take stock photos so mm. his stock photos there's no licensing behind them so anyone can use them and do whatever the fuck they want with them because that was the whole point and then people started of course this was he did that and then it was around the time when the internet was kicking off if i remember right when he did that it was like 2007 to 2009 before like memes were really a thing and then the first use of him as a meme was on like twitter and reddit where people would they they'd post something that was like sarcastically funny and you'd see a picture of hide the pain herald with like the coffee cup and the grin because it's supposed a lot of people think that his smile looks half-hearted like it, it's like one of those smiles you make at someone when like your your brother does something you don't approve of but you don't want to get angry because then he'll keep doing it so you just give him like the again that's why it's called hide the pain herald because mm -hmm. it's as if you're hiding the <laughs> the grief or something like that yeah No, this dude is more like Brandon. Don't uh, instantly laugh the second he comes in here. Uh, you right. need to laugh, mute your fucking mic. Mute my mic. He's right. <laughs> so rude. Alright, alright, alright. I got it out. What do you mean he's like Brandon? I'll see, You'll matter of fact. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see, matter of fact. But did he need help or something? No, he just likes to play. Uh, he doesn't necessarily need help. He's out of all the people that I play in co-op with. He's probably the only person that doesn't actually need the help. He just does it to make it easier. Because hmm. I mean, he knows about flexing and like yesterday, I taught him how good yokai abilities can be and shit like that with the whipper snapper. The whip lady? And we? No, no, the whipper snapper, the freaking. The DLC enemies attack where you like do the thing where he shoves the two axes across the ground. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's that's called the whipper snapper. I don't know the names of any of them. I just know where they come from. Where they come from? Mm. There you go. Like the the long neck one is called Rakurakubi, or the the one for the Rakurakubi is called Whiplash. Mm. Whiplash on. I I always make the stupid splish splash when I'm taking a bath song, but I do it whiplash. Oh. I don't know why. So cringe. Exactly. Cringe Lord 9000. Oh yeah, I'm ready for whatever. He has the same icon as you. Oh, okay. It's actually... Yeah, everybody's using these icons now. All the Neo 2 guys. Hell yeah, man. Dude, at least 50% of my friends list is Neo 2 icons now. <laughs> There's like four different people who have the Yokai Shift Feral as their icon, even yeah, though I doubt sucks. most of them use it. <laughs> hey, bud, emoji waving hand with me. How's it going, man? Skin tone. How's it going? What's up? <laughs> Did you just get up? Pull up chat. Hmm. Oh, what up, Jonathan? Yeah, I'm down. Well, Pyro can help as well. Hold on. Give me a sec. Yeah. Pyro can help too. Although we probably don't need <laughs> probably don't need two people way of the strong, but right. he'll just use nerf stuff. Or way of the dream, you mean? No, it's dream of the strong. Oh. It's even more confusing. 
Yeah. Way of the dream. That would have been a cool <laughs> name, to be honest. Yeah. Hmm. Dream of the strong demons. The stronger demons. Oh, oh wait, the fuck. I don't know. I'm not that far in uh, NG plus. I'm not either, so don't worry. Alright. He's not in NG plus yet. Oh, so it's way of the sam or dream of the samurai. There we go. Yeah. yeah so you got me confused when you were saying strong or whatever. Oh yeah. Sorry. Yep. I was just saying that. Someone in the first difficulty probably doesn't exactly need two geared out people, but then again, we normally end up using nerfed weapons anyways, so. Mm. I'm normally put on the crappiest weapon I have. That doesn't affect my set bonuses anyways. <clears throat> Where is this? Just let me, uh... Let me know when you have the cup up. Because I had to take off the password last night. It's. It was. So I could do random co op. Well, there we go. Is it still the old secret word? What is it? <clears throat> Alright, hold on. <coughs> yeah, take your time. A family member of mine just pulled in, so I'll be like five minutes. Sorry. Yep. Did you play Neo 1? How far did you get, or...? Oh, okay. So you did more than me. Hmm. I never did it because I got bored after the hunter floor. The Abyss? I think it's already been confirmed or something. Oh. Like Way of the Neo and stuff? What was the secret word again? No.
clear on this mission, okay. Oh shit. Uh, I forgot that I... I respect and uh... Didn't put all my magic in. There's a different way of filling up though, that's new to Neo too. Alright, sorry. Yep. <coughs> oh shit, everything's already in the slot that it needs to be, what the fuck. There we go. This is a... Uh... I literally dropped 15 courage and I'm down to 2,600 <laughs> HP from 3k. That's crazy. You mean constitution? Uh. Courage no, doesn't mean health. No, no, no. Well, that's the only stat that I dropped, so. <coughs> yeah, it gives you some health. I just stacked over time, I'm guessing. If you leveled up other things, then it would give you the same health. Stamina is the thing that gives you health. Mm. I have stamina even higher now. It's at 37 from 35. That's nothing, dude. What are you talking about? Yeah, but I only need... I only need 37. Level 80 spear hits really hard. What the hell? I don't have any low level weapons. I always save the lowest level one I get from a revenant. Because mm. <clears throat> that's the only place you can get low level ones. Pretty sure your damage only scales in Yokai Realm with a companion. That's what happened with me and the other person I was playing. Even though I had a low level weapon and while being a visitor it still did a lot of damage. Those guys are still really tanky. What's funny... What's funny thing is, is that they... They actually nerfed those guys in the most recent patch. What they do? They nerfed their damage and their HP. Wow. <laughs> and they're still killing people instantly and still take forever to kill. Hmm. Even though they're like basically starter enemies. Oh shit, I went in the wrong. The rat guys need more attacks, to be honest. <clears throat> they have a lot of attacks, they just never use them. Mm. Their, like, likeliness of using half of their attacks is very low. 
they tend to just keep using the freaking two burst moves. Yeah. And then they run away from you. And throw poop, and then they do the burst attack. It's literally either mm -hmm. fucking... That happened to me for like 10 minutes straight. I was just trying to see all the enemies' like attack patterns. Yeah. It's funny because they also have this like handstand whirlwind kind of thing that they do. But they very rarely do it. Mm. I've probably only seen the attack like four or five times. Like. <laughs> I finally got the timing down on that ability, though. On my Iro, because the the freaking ability you get from Toshie. Which one, though? The pokey one, not this one. Because this one's not timing based. The enemy hits you when you're doing the swirly. You always auto parry. Mm. Oh, I didn't even see him. Wait, do I not have my Kodama sense on? Oh no, I didn't. Oops. I'm oh, still using that mind. purple, uh, wise general's pillbox that the guy gave me on that one mission. I need to do that mission again so I can get a divine one. Cause that pillbox is insane. What even pancaked him? The spear's charge attack is probably the worst and longest one. <laughs> the freaking You can just do the Odachi one. I completely forgot that shit even existed. Oh wait, I'm not even using the Odachi. Actually, I think it's the same, hold on. No, yours no, is way faster. No, slightly faster, <laughs> yeah. Yours is way- you started it. your animation yeah. halfway into mine, and finished it at the same time as me. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> and they both do the same thing. If you hit an enemy that's not guarding with it, it makes the enemy roll backwards, and you can hit them again, and then they get tripped on the ground. Mm. Oh yeah, I'm using Brute. I can't counter ranged attacks. I never realized, though, Hyro, at least in Neo 2, how strong some of the life drain effects on weapons are. In Neo, you mean Neo 1 or? No, in Neo 2. Oh yeah, life drain melee attack. Well, currently because I'm using Shinroku, I have. Uh, It gives me life drain strong attack, and my weapon, my, my Kuroka Spear, this weapon, also has life drain strong attack. So I have like a 50 in it, and I heal 100 damage per poke when I do this. Mm -hmm. I have one on my Kusari Gama that's just life drain melee attack or some shit. Oh, the purple one? Yeah. Hmm. That one's good, but it's the lowest number. Yeah. But you'll activate it the most, so it makes up for it. That ability is still fucking scary. And the stupid thing is, is that they actually have two different versions of that freaking spin attack. They can do one that's not a burst attack that you can't counter as well. Mm -hmm. It's even more bullshit.
them young whippersnappers. I also used a wall, because a high level wall is actually very good. Seen the the one from the last boss is pretty nasty, but it's yeah, so inconsistent. It the, yeah, I was gonna say if it wasn't for the fact that you can't guarantee any element of any type on anything when you use it, mm. you're basically just using it as like an artillery barrage. Except for it's even less accurate than an artillery barrage in a shooter, if that's even possible. You, if you hit the head on the ground, they sometimes don't blow up, but in online, it's very inconsistent if it works or not. <clears throat> because sometimes the head will be disappeared, as we've seen, and you still get blown up and launched to the moon. Or are you trying to get that Kodama that's up there? Uh, you have to go to the other side of the wall and then come back. Yeah, you, it's over there. I have to go this way. We have to get over there first. Why are you changed into Tokichiro? Of all the characters. Because he's cool. No, he's not. Probably the most likable character for me. Maybe at the beginning of the game. Hmm. He's also a complete idiot that thinks juicing stuff up with energy is the way to fix everyone's problems. Of course. That's modern medicine. No, modern medicine is not steroids. They're going away from steroids. Because that's what spirit stones basically are. They're just steroids, and once you run out, you're in even worse condition than you were prior how did this guy die oh he died the neck oh I have a divine <coughs> but <Mr>. yeah whiplash <coughs> excuse me I farmed uh, the Tatanashi guy for like two hours straight couldn't get the freaking thing I just gave up you on it. Didn't, you still didn't get the Tatanashi smithing text? Nope. Are you sure you didn't have it already? No, uh, I, I would have already crafted the Tatanashi set. <laughs> yeah, because I got it like my eighth try and I didn't even have the blessing or anything on when I did it. Mm. The RNG is cool, but like it's kind of a little bit too much. Especially with yeah, the but skills. I spent three hours getting the fucking grapple skills from the guy. This guy, when I was helping him the other day, got it his first try. Yeah, he got it. He got the dual sword one first try on the boss. He's amazing. I was like, of course that's how that would be. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but at least you got the ones for the weapons that you were using at the time. <clears throat> oh wait, were you using the, the single sword? Hmm. Did you unlock those antlers, Hyro? No. Or are those just Tokachiros? No, you can just pick them. I haven't seen anyone fucking use them, and it's so sad because they're the best looking ones. Well, I used this one. I can't even see I... it. So. What do you mean? It's like a part of my hat. That's why I picked it. Because it actually looks like it blends in with my character. You what? You can't see I the horns see in my like helmet. I see it like so slightly that it's like almost unnoticeable. 
Especially with you already being yellow. Like. <laughs> yeah, it's just like little spikes coming out of my helmet. No, yeah, I see it, but like. I can change them. On the fly. How? Wap Guardian Spirits. See? Now I have oh. tall horns. I use the frickin' reindeer antlers. Wait, how the- how did- How in the hell did you get up there? There's a ladder. Probably missed this, Kodama. Oh shit, sorry. Isn't that the way you go to get the- No. You have to go to that side and loop and come back around. <laughs> well, this is the same map as the winter map in Neo 1, it's just hard to tell. thing about the guardian spirit swapping that I actually figured out is that if you have different skills equipped on two completely different guardian spirits, anima doesn't change when you swap your guardian spirit and there's no cooldown. So you can immediately swap to a different one, use a different yokai skill and swap back. Yeah. But that's a... Yeah. It does affect it though if you have certain ones with plus animal on them, though. Well, yeah, but not every single person is you, Mister Stack Twenty Anima. <laughs> kind of, not really. Kind of just happened, like. No, he 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 says it kind of just happened, <laughs> Mister. <laughs> Plus anima? Oh, of course. He, nah, yeah. My accessories are plus anima, both of them. Yes. He he specifically stuck with the Japanese scissors that were like level 10 all throughout the base game. Just base so game. Just have 0.7 extra fucking exactly. anima. Exactly. Now I have 0.9 from the 100 and, level 160 Japanese scissors. And I have a writing set that gives me 0.7. Whoa. It stacks. It stacks, you fucking hater. I am all about that. that it's 1.5 extra anima. That anima. That anima. I am all about that anima. Sorry, yeah. I turned completely into Filthy Frank. My L1 button is best up for this controller. So I can't back wave consistently. I'll switch it up. Oh, though. so you, you? What the? I, I can't even do that normally. Regardless. Oh my god, that hurts. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> this is why my controllers are broken. Like. Well, no, Hiro. It's even better when you use the Kusari Gama. Oh, jeez. Hold on, where where's my Kusari Gama in here? Spawn a revenant. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my God, it looks so disgusting. <laughs> I can't even remember. Uh, oh yeah, what place are you for your clan, Dustin? What do you mean? What's your individual rank for the for your clan? 
Oh, I'm a senior. I meant like the number. I don't know what that means. Oh, I'm... I think last time I checked, I was top 300 for my clan and top 3,000 worldwide. Hmm. Pretty good. Also, you didn't want to necessarily blow him up, but luckily you can use a black firebomb. You can just use game. a regular gunpowder bomb, whatever it's called. Well, yeah, but the normal gunpowder bombs are actually worth throwing, so... Mm. Some, Some of them, them, yeah, that are cracked. It's like Legend of Zelda walls. Fucking hate this enemy. I'm just gonna lay here. The trick on this enemy is to just use yokai skills, because the purple shit doesn't do anything to you if you're in a yokai form. Mm. Or if you're in a yokai skill. I still haven't even used all the yokai abilities just because I haven't bothered. Most of them are bad. Yeah. Yeah, this is where you get that Kodama. Down there. Yeah, I wonder if I sit on it, if he'll be able to see it. Got a Kodama in my butt. Freaking weirdo. <laughs> What are you, freaking Rukishi? <laughs> Ew. That's actually <laughs> nasty. <laughs> oh shit, it's Omnio Mage. I need to kill ten of these so I can play one of the submissions still. Oh, you have to do that one. I, unless you don't want to get the trophy. And also, there's like a, a special fight. No, you get... You get it for being in other people's games. As long mean? as you're the person who dealt the killing blow to the Omnium Mage. No, I'm saying there's a, a trophy for getting all the Guardian Spirits that you can only get from doing no, that mission. I know that, dude. Oh. I'm well aware of that. I'm saying that I can't access the mission until I kill ten of those, in which they are the rarest enemy in the entire fucking game. You gotta farm them though in that uh that one mission with the spinny boy. Farm fucking Omnio, Omnio mages. mages. That, that's what it comes to. That's what I did. I was like, fucking, I, I need to get all these How done. Humans? How many Omnio mages have I killed? Eleven. I've killed eleven as well. Yeah. You only need ten though, so you could have already done it by now. Yeah. Nerd. Nerd. I just am I'm not streaming, so Oh I forgot that you get nerfed in visitor, that's why I have less freaking life. That makes sense. Did you get that, Kodama? Yeah. I hate that mission with the uh... I don't know what's the point of transforming in this game when you have a character customization system. Cause who cares? I wanna look different without having to customize my character. So and look like a character. Who, who made a female character. Yeah. You just made a fucking girl female character that you didn't even make unique or anything. Yep. Why would I? You, you want to come back up here, by the way, dude. You want to jump down into the building. Someone shoot the...
so weird having three people, man. I'm so used to planning out what I'm gonna do next, and I'm just here spamming buttons now. You guys might be. I'm always doing stuff with. Those will be useful for a mission. He's I don't know if you've done it. By that mission. Uh oh. The dung ball man. Oh shit, I forgot I rebinded that. kind of weird how I played so much of this game and I still haven't done all the missions just because of the Twilight bullshit. I wish they would change that or at least make it so that Twilight missions can be accessed at any point. I just think they should make them rotate more often. Mm. Every four hours or something? Yeah, that's what I would do. Yeah, six hours would be. Yeah. Oh, wait. This is technically backwards. Yeah, we need to go where the Obsidian Samurai is. Buddha. I find it weird that he's one of the few characters that speaks English, even though his fucking... He, he comes from a country that never spoke English. <laughs> <laughs> they don't speak English by default because they're from Africa, Japan. Shit. Maybe he learned it. I don't know. He learned it from William. Even though... He learned it from... No. That wouldn't make sense time-wise. from Hanzo. But Hanzo is an allegiance to Ieyasu, so... There's no way that he would even meet up with... The Obsidian Samurai. Or Yasuke, as they call him. Hmm. He finally got a name, I'm pretty sure. Unless he did have a name in the first game. In the first game, they never called him what his name was. Hmm. They've referred to him as the Ebony Samurai or the Obsidian Samurai. Or as Hyro used to call, Ebony. Ebony. <laughs> Is that in wall right here? I think, yeah. Yeah. But there's a wall back here that. Go away. Shut up. If you're oh, yeah. playing the English version of the game, does Togetiro use his English voice actor or his Japanese voice actor? I don't know. Because honestly, I feel like his Japanese voice actor has less of a character than his actual English voice actor. When I swapped, I was like, oh yeah, the only cutscene where he has character in Japanese is specifically the one where he dances like a monkey. And then all the other ones, he sounds like a bland asshole. <laughs> and I can't tell if that's intentional or not. I kind of found it weird how the story ended. Do you mind spoilers, uh, Tizzy? No? Um. But yeah, I just found it weird how Tokachiro came back. 
and all of a sudden he was gone he again. He did a Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, exactly. You fucking weird ass bullshit. How he uses there yeah. one second and the next second. Yep, I'm dead. Like <clears throat> so dumb. Well, you're forgetting the part that they basically threw all of Neo One story, like how. In the beginning of Neo 1, and I've explained this too many fucking times in the past, like, two weeks, but... In the beginning of Neo 1, the game establishes the fact that certain characters cannot see spirits. They can- mm -hmm. they do not possess the ability to see spirits. Also, we're going backwards, just so you know. I think there's a hot spring back there in a the chest. Though, so it doesn't really matter. Yep, yeah, I'm just letting you know. And we are going... Did you go? Did you farm y Yoshitatsu yet, Hiro? Who's that? Your brother. Um, or sister, if you're female. No. I've not. I fought That's her the that one you get time. The I don't. I mean, I'd be cool actually for my anima build, but. I don't know. The farming will come later. It works with single sword, dual sword, and no dachi. So. Well, there's three separate skills for them. There's Dragon, Horn, Claw, and whatever the other one is that I can't remember. Hmm. He got the one I found from an Odachi swords. one recently. An Odachi skill? Yeah. From who? Uh, the Ice Boss from Cold and Ice or whatever that mission is called. Oh, yeah. It's like a spin move, right? Yeah. Fire and Use Ice, it. I think it's called. No, I don't. I don't have it. I just found out about it. Oh. I thought you got it. No. Oh, he's gonna shoot his arrow. No! He magnet grabbed me. The person me a one. Bless you. <coughs> Bless you. Thank you. I thought there was gonna be a snake lady here. You see the weird tattoo on his arm? Yeah, I see it. I just say weird in terms of what the texture looks like when it's in the frickin' water. In that case, I did not see it. I, like, she got it her armor. Glowy. When it's not actually glowy. Oh my god, that red one yeah. looks like your arm is, like, burnt. I didn't even know you could put on tattoos. <laughs> I can't do that. Jacob, put your shirt on! I freaking... I'm gonna get carpal tunnel. I'm surprised, like... <laughs> Tear ass. I am the man of the chain levitations. Also, I just realized you need to summon uh, 10 benevolent graves to get a trophy, and it's so stupid. 
Also, here's another wall. Nice. Snipe. What does the blue fire even do? Super. It doesn't do heat. It doesn't do damage to them. And it does a lot of damage to us. Like that. Oh, jeez. Oh, I forgot we're not in summoners. So I can't even revive you. Yeah. This nerd over here only plays in expedition mode. And then wonders why he has trouble with one of the last bosses that are a, is a three-phase boss and not designed to be played in solo expedition mode. It's the only boss I... I mean, I wouldn't even say I struggled in because Ivy didn't like the third try, but like, I was surprised that it took yeah, me three exactly. tries. Entitled. <laughs> it took me 60 tries to beat fucking Nine-Tailed Fox when she came out. Not even comparable, that, ga dude. that video uh, came up on my recommended and I checked it out again. Do you like... <laughs> you were sweating. I could feel the sweat through your controller trying to fucking beat that shit. <laughs> you are doing that cheesy ass build and still almost died. <laughs> yes. I was like, wow. Because it was so overtuned when it came out. It was so... Like, you would hit it for like 4,000 damage and it would just be like... Eh, just a little... <laughs> just a little chunk gone and you you could go into living weapon dump everything you had into living weapon all your buffs weakness everything and it'd be down like a quarter hp and you'd be like what the fuck mm -hmm. yeah living weapon was it's sad how bad it is now to be honest like it's all right not even comparable to what it was though no, even after all the nerfs neo one. living weapon and neo one is an actual usable thing that you can go through a, a good portion of a level with in Neo 1, even still mm -hmm. to this day. Yeah. But in Neo 2, you can yokai shift for about 30 seconds. And if you swing, then that's about five seconds. Yep. <laughs> I was going to say, um, I don't know if that, if you that can, long. No, I said you can run around oh. as <laughs> one, but you can't <laughs> attack. <laughs> you can run around as a demon for 30 seconds, or you can attack and be a demon for 5 seconds and do a mediocre amount of damage compared to what you could have done outside of Yokai Shift in a lot mm -hmm. of cases. I mean, if you. I only use like it now whenever swords. I uh, knock an enemy out of key and they're down on the ground. It's like dual swords. Cherry Blossom will out DPS most of your. Yokai shift anything. The only one that doesn't get out DPS is the the feral one. The feral one has the highest DPS of them all, but honestly, you have to kill an enemy, hold triangle to buff up the daggers into the short swords, and then go crazy on an enemy. You just mashing square, and you just mm -hmm. only mash square, and then you dodge, and then you mash square again. Oh, well, I'm an if elder. You get hit, all your fucking meter goes away. Mm -hmm. Like that. <clears throat> That's why I like using the elephant. The elephant. Is Get hit like two or three times and actually have living weapons still to spend. <laughs> That's why I still use. I use the elephant and the deer. Deer for feral. Or not for feral. Brute. Visitor's amulet? What the fuck? Oh, sorry. Did you put a... You... Alright. Mm. One second. I'm gonna grab a drink while this is loading.
man. Feels like the party is so full with four people, to be honest. I don't know, any more than four people in a party. I mean, five is like the maximum. Yeah. Israeli. That's because Dustin went to the bathroom or something, oh, or went to go get water. I'm here. I'm here. What's up? Pop the sodi pop. Oh, nothing. Emil just said that the party was dry or something. Where the fuck is the thing that makes the... Nope. See, because these enemies can be staggered on every hit. With their exaggerated telegraph grab attacks, you can just smack them out of it. So weird how you said the frickin... I'm still on about how you said that the glass cannon phase was, uh... What that boss is like, and I was like, no. At least not an expedition mode. Like, so it's crazy. People are saying that's like the easiest boss in the game. That's why I told you. It's because you were playing in expedition mode. Because there are no extra summons. He's not tanky, and there are no extra summons. It's just him and his clones, and the clones die in one hit. What? Oh no, that's like, it's not even comparable, what the fuck? <laughs> I yeah, smacked one the of the clones, clones for three hits. Be one hit. Three times and they didn't die, so I just gave well, up on them. Well, it's like one hit if you're not using low stance. Oh. Um, using low stance, it'll take three or four hits. I was using like, medium stance or something. High stance, it should always be one. If it's not one, then you're not, you, you need more damage for that point. <laughs> Nah. Everything's just so tanky. No, not in the fight. Stop playing in expedition mode. It's designed for three players. You don't have a valid opinion on the difficulty of the game. They don't design that mode for balance. They design that mode for three people smacking on the enemy at the same time and the boss going... <laughs> <laughs> my game my tv was on like five volume what's your plus is that uh dustin for my tatanashi stuff everything your weapons and tatanashi well my sword is plus three my helmet's plus two plus two plus two plus two plus one yeah. all but my boots are plus two I think I have a plus four weapon actually. I'm just not using it. Hold on. Holy shit, I do so much damage. What do you mean? Oh yeah, that was just, uh, cause dual swords are busted. In the first game?
What do you mean? Oh, they changed the, uh, yeah, the enemy placement. I see what you mean. Mm. Yeah, that's probably because the higher difficulty versions are what go are going to be what the trial versions were, like I was telling people. It'd be like a mid to late game version of the level. Yeah. Because as they have higher difficulties, even just Dream of the Strong changes the enemy layouts on most of the levels. So, just by going to the second difficulty in this game, and that, that stupid spin attack that those skeletons do is the one reason why you always want to have heavy armor on. Because you cannot block that shit with light armor. I hate that attack so much. Just want 200 toughness. Toughness, tough. Well, having 200 toughness is for super armor. For it actually affecting your key usage, you want as much toughness as you can possibly get. Mm. My Neo one build had 450 toughness or something like that. They nerfed Tatanashi, right? Or no? No, they just nerfed uh, how much it gained from the levels. So it needs to be, like I said, we need a higher level gear in order for it to become what it used to be. Mm. Do the pluses not matter? Does that not increase the, the stats on them? No. Oh, that sucks. Not as far as set bonuses go. Only the actual item level overall. No, get me out of that fire. What has been the, the hardest boss for you, Tizzy? None of them, or...? Sorry, hold on, the game is like super loud. What was that? The one with the dam? Wait... Oh, yeah. Siphon gun. Do you know which one? I know you know which one it is, thus, and can. Yep. Like, which one is it? It's Gyuki. The one you fight after Psycho Magoichi. That doesn't. Whatever. Fuck it. The big fucking thing. Like, what? Like, do you. The need, Minotaur? Need to... There's no minotaur in this game. Or minotaur, whatever the fuck, the 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 minotaur with the spider legs. If yes, you call uh, it yes, that, yes, yes. That a fucking minotaur anime. implies it's half horse, half human. Yeah. What? Do, what do you? Whatever, man. It's a cow fucking head. spidator. Like, what the fuck would I call it? It's a cow, dude. It's not a fucking horse! Oh, I see what you mean. I'm still gonna call it a minotaur though, because I'm just that guy. No, because it's not a tour. It is now. But yeah, I get it's what you mean. It's only got the head of a cow. Mizuki and Gozuki are more of a minotaur, but they're actually- They're actually a horse. Yes! They're the opposite. That's what I'm saying. Instead of a horse body with a human, ha it's a upper half. It's a human body with a horse upper half. Ew! So dirty to think about. That. At least what I would imagine. It look, it'd be like BoJack Horseman. 
Gozuki is Bojack Horseman. There you go, at least one of you got the buff. Are we gonna... We've just been running back and forth in the same part of the level for like the past five minutes, by the way. Yeah, I know. Clearing out all the enemies. Even though we already cleared them. Except we they, know. We know. They we were understand. already cleared out. We understand. I already said we understand. Jeez. No. Whatever. Yep. There's a Kodama here. Oh, I forgot about that little stinker. Is that the last one? I had to look up that one because... You didn't even wait for him to get over here. Why would you pop another one? I was going to buff him. Because you missed the first one. And I popped another one. My magic is higher than you. My magic is higher than yours. I have 30. I have 74. And you don't have the Mystic Art? <laughs> nah, just wait. I have 30. I have 30. I have 30. Exactly. <laughs> Fucking like goober. <laughs> goober. Shut up. Honestly, I just realized it's your character, not mine. That's the first time I've seen that. It's always their character when it's a visitor. Oh, uh, I guess I've just never played visitor like that, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, because you keep playing expedition mode the way the game's not designed <laughs> to be played, you fucker. <laughs> <laughs> yup. And a beard. Only you would point I think that's that out. The weirdest part about this character is that she has a beard. She has fur on her face. Wanting to be whiskers at that point? One time. No, it's not. No, it's not messing up like it normally does. We'll let you know. Oh yeah, no, it was fine. I don't even fucking know. My fucking bicep hurts from that. I don't even know why. <laughs> wow, that's actually good. I like that. I see, you caught me. I was doing that while I was playing Neo. <laughs> Been flexing, flexing the jerkin. You gotta be Adam gotta be Sandler, like... angry masturbation. Ow, my freaking hand hurts from squeezing so hard. It's not the squeezing, it's the... I think it's putting my nail... Like my fingertips. It's not the strength of the motion, it's... Jesus. I would die. <laughs> it's the speed of the drum there, kiddo. <laughs> the <speed. laughs> oh my god. <laughs> You're gonna hurt what? your hands. <laughs> Who's doing that? Who has practiced that hard? I've been practicing all day, all night. I I practice the art of booty slap. 
Shut up. This is the black magic art. <laughs> you must have some fat hands, whoever just clapped. It's Tizzy. Yeah, you must have some big hands. <laughs> oh. You know what they say, big feet, big intellectual brain. Big intellectual property. Mmm, so good and tasty. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You can control it as well. You can? Yeah. Well, I don't know if you can control it fully anymore. Yeah, exactly. You can't. You can't. Yeah, exactly. Shut up. You cannot. <laughs> Salesman. <laughs> <laughs> they assembled it at the yard. Well, I mean, they actually do have to do that, though. Nah, I think they just, like, ship it there or something. Or do they when test they it? When they put a car together, they have to test run it. It's the same thing uh, with all generators and all pumps and everything. That's why. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's just to make sure that all the seals are tight, everything. It's just a basic, like, once over. Mm. They even do it with simple appliances. Oh, that's cool. Like I said, if you get, like, a water pump or something like that, even water pumps are tested before they're shipped out most of the time. That way, if you need to send it back, the company knows if it got damaged in shipping or not. Okay. Because if multiple of that same one got damaged, then, yeah, that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, then a shipping truck fucked it up, or a person who works for that shipping company threw the box that said fragile on it. <laughs> yeah. Imagine how many people have done that with PS4s, and they go to play their PS4 at home, and, oh, it turns out some asshole at the store was just chucking them around for fun one day. Mm, yeah. Fuck that guy. Mm. Yeah, fuck that loser. I need to get something to eat, man. Some booty, of course. <laughs> Alright, enough noises. <laughs> <laughs> So oh, you mean inheritable? No, it's a teacher. Or is it the orange one? You can't get orange ones. What do you until, mean? Until, uh, the new NG. Oh, yeah, you're right. You can't get orange inheritables. That's right. Yep. Yeah, it's just a white icon, right? It's so weird looking at people's freaking colorways. Shut up. <laughs> Down by the cutaway. Now he's referencing something else. <laughs> that was like a machine gun laugh to that that triggered out of me. It was like... <laughs> it was like a fucking... Remember I imagine machine gun, I imagine someone jabbing like 15 times in one second. Oh no, he's gonna do it. You gonna do the thing? What thing? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Machine gun jacker. Jesus Christ. That's fucking Machine Gun Kelly's porn name. That is, uh, Kagan Ashera, right? Oh, never mind. That's Jojo. Mm. <laughs> I thought, because when I said 15 jabs in one second, I was referencing, uh, Kagan. 
lie. The original is Kenshiro. <laughs> Good thing I don't like your mic isn't going through or I would have gotten fucking a strike on my channel already. Who's playing that? <laughs> it's Twig. Or t it's ah, sorry. so loud. Oh, yeah. Jesus, my ears. <laughs> yeah, it's so fucking loud in the mic. Yeah. Yeah. That's... Not good. Your voice is fine. Your The audio is fine. I mean... No, your voice is fine. I was saying the videos. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> no, I always tell you the fucking mics pick up that phone audio like nothing else. I don't know why. Mm, that's why you could hear my fucking iPad when I was uh, watching... Yeah, when you were sitting on your bed watching stuff, and I'm sitting yeah. there on my headset. I had like, it on my chair. Random noise. Yeah. Oh. I had my headset on my chair. That's why I was like, I didn't notice when you joined. I had my TV turned off. Four? <laughs> what? Oh, so core. Cool. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, a car. A car? A car. Score. A score. Let's go. <laughs> you got it right. You got it right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you played that? So weird, hi. It's kind of weird. I put so much time on the freaking trial, Jesus. What do you mean you put way more time on the beta? No, yeah, that's because the beta was longer. That's not comparable, though. I think I made like 10 parts for like the Neo 2 beta or something. Right now, yeah, I'm but on. Yeah, 90% of that was just co op. Yeah. After, I think, the second part, I finished uh, mm -hmm. the couple of missions that they had. It's alright. You can watch a couple people and they'll, they'll show you some cool stuff. You know what you're looking for. They say those. He says they'll show you some cool stuff. You have to go out of your way to find people who are actually play Neo 2 and actually are good. You know, yeah. not brain dead at playing it, that don't stay in one stance all the time and actually use skills and know what armor effects do and can tell you actual stuff. There's probably only like 10 people who stream it that can do that. <laughs> and I'm one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, sub to Dustin at the Salty Knob. Spaces no, between every word. Nah, you're good. I don't care. The only reason I know how to play Neo is because of you, so. Thanks, Master. <laughs> Demon God? Or Demon Son? No, he said Onichan or Nissan. Oh, that's from uh, a lot of. He's been watching a lot of nasty videos. <laughs> no, nah. <laughs> no, it's obviously Fist of the North Star. No, Bo look up Boko no Pico, and you'll understand why he made that reference. Yeah, that's you do. We, we understand, but that does not that does not make the joke better. Oh yeah, you're right. Still fucking weird, dude. 
You know what he's talking about, right, Dustin? I just yes, I do. I'm, okay, okay, I'm just making sure. I'm aware of the fucking meme about it being androgynous 13 year old boys. I'm very aware of what. Uh, it is. let's just stop there. Let's just stop there. Let's keep it. You're at the, the one who brought it. You're you're the one who brought it up. I know, but I brought it up as a joke. No, actually, he brought it up. Someone else brought it up. It wasn't me for the first time. It was a meal. No, it wasn't. I promise you, it was the other guy. Ah, I mean, well, what's your real life? What's your government name, man? <laughs> what's your <laughs> government name? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good anime, stop though. Stop saying that. <laughs> uh, my neck hurts. Stop. <laughs> Did you set up a mission? Like, yeah. Uh, yeah, for I'm how long? I've been missing for like a minute or two. Uh, I'm joined with his foot. Enough, that's what she said jokes. <laughs> Michael, Michael Gary, Gary Scott. Gary Scott. <laughs> oh, you're on this? Why are you doing this mission? Oh, I forgot that this mission is like later on in the game. I told you it was a mid to late game mission, Hyro. No, I told you that it was a mid to late mission mission as well. I called it too, Goober. <laughs> Says the guy who keeps thinking it's an early game mission. Yeah, <laughs> that's because I'm used to the trial still. It doesn't count, bud. <laughs> Imagine not using God of Wind. Having dual what swords. He doesn't use God of One. <coughs> also, uh, it's so weird coming here and like this being open. In the trial, there was like a wood plank here that you couldn't walk. They made it into a shortcut. They changed this mission a little bit, yeah. Can't open it though. Yeah, there was a second shrine right up around the corner here. Refighting. <laughs> Are you playing? You mean in seven Expert foot one? Mode? Are you playing in expedition mode? Yeah. Oh, you stopped? Why'd you stop? Because it's... Because it's not the way you... Yeah, I understand. I understand that. Why did he stop? <laughs> yeah. You just stop. What do you mean? Just choose next. No, it isn't. If anything, it's more concise there because you can just access everything in one menu. The only thing that sucks about it is you can't go to the dojo. Yeah, you before the mission, you can immediately go to the like blacksmith or whatever. Instead of having to click tour, or I mean the home, then go to the blacksmith, then you can access it.
Mm. Why do you gotta criticize someone for not playing the game the stupidly hard way? Because I'm that guy. I just... I'm really that bitch. TB. Really, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Shut the fuck! You can't trademark. I think you can keep that acronym. Actually, yeah, I think TM hasn't been taken. Oh wait, no, TM is literally trademark. Yeah, I there meant you TB. Go, Tuberculosis foundations would argue with that. Fuck out of here. <laughs> What did they even do? <laughs> oh, they make Berkus? It's like, it's like, not saying that. That's messed up. That's messed up. <laughs> I mean, I like technically do. I guess probably kill more people than do help people. How? I mean, oh, that I was probably that a soul. Was the case. Mm. You probably just had good RNG, bro. I don't think you can get good RNG on a lung collapse, man. Nah, you can. No. <laughs> you got bad RNG, dude. You got bad RNG just getting it, though. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It's there was no good RNG in fixing it though. Mm. It was either it was gonna work or dead. <clears throat> no RNG there. There wouldn't be a conversation about the RNG involving it right now. You know what I'm saying? The RNG is uh, 50 50, I guess. I would say it's more 100% because I'm still alive. <clears throat> I That's mean, at the moment though. I'm saying. Yeah, it's at 100%. Mm. That has those surgeries have a hundred percent success rate. It depends on how your lung collapses, but yeah, I didn't have a surgery. Hmm. They just shove oh, a yeah. tube in the side, and they just suck all the empty air out and all the fluid and the hell you see them spinning. Where? Up there. Oh yeah. Out of here, goober. Oh my god, I drink a sacred water by accident. You know what? Oh wait. Okay. Okay. I wanna switch to my Odachi. Oh, you got a Odachi with uh, auto life recovery, Moonlit Snow. It's cool. Yeah, you wanna. Hear what mine is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes your deck damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Close combat damage and yeah, yeah, skill damage. Shut up. Wow, fine then. Fucking goober. No one has. Sour. Yeah, I'm sour because uh, I couldn't get a. What's it called? Melee uh, damage life drain. Attack. A, wh wh where do you want that? I have attack bonus, stamina A minus, and I'm an 85 stamina build. My fucking glaive does. My glaive right now has an attack rating of 1,300. I have a chain to attack salmon as well. Yeah, but you're not a stamina build anymore, there, bud. I am a stamina build. My highest stat is stamina. Yeah, at 35 stamina, or how much you said earlier. Garbage compared to mine. Yeah. I'm 92, dude. <clears throat> My glaive has 1,300 and something attack on it. Imagine min-maxing for base difficulty and not expedition mode? You suck! Nah, no, just flying. But I mean that internally. That's what I would say if I was a dickhead. But I did say it, so I am a dickhead. So now nah, I'm mad, Dustin. Imagine playing the game the way the game was designed to be played. <laughs> Couldn't be me. 
could not be me. You just like the Souls community who's like, if you're not playing at Soul Level 1, you're not playing the game correctly. What the fuck is Soul Level 1? There's a Godama down there. You don't level there. up. Oh, that sucks. Leveling up is good. I'm just joking, though. I think you gotta jump down regardless or unless or did you jump down? Oh wait, wait, were you trying to get that Kodama? Whatever. Oh. <laughs> I made it here first. You already no, picked you up didn't. on the goober lingo. Everyone says goober, what are you talking about? No, I invented that word. Actually, you're right, but also why are all the skeletons okay? Is mayonnaise an instrument? Why? It's, it's like it's not even funny. I don't know why Tater <laughs> says it. Is mayonnaise an instrument? Why am I so slow? Because you're in the water. Do I not have. Chow's wig or whatever the fuck it's called. Guess not. Get rid of the crystal first, and then we can summon people. <laughs> Big jitties. I it weird how you can, uh, Bolting Boar or whatever the frickin' skill for the Odachi is, that's a parry, um, the ape thing, the ape spear. Ooh, I got a Eureki chest piece. Yeah, but it doesn't do anything. What do you mean? No, you can like... bolt and bore in and throw them on the ground just like you would a regular human. That's all I was saying, that's super weird. Yeah, but only with the spear. That's the only weapon they have. I mean, you can't do it with, like, the Yokis or anything. Can you? What? Sorry, you're, you're like, confusing my brain. The bolting boar thing is the Odachi's parry. Yes. Yeah, and it's I'm saying... L1. Yeah, and you can, um, parry the, yes, the monkey. Yes, you can't do it on the Yokis. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, good. You understood. Have you, you tried doing me. it on the Yokis? Is what I'm saying. No, I have not. Because they don't have weapons. Unless the, the Ippon guys do, so it might work on them. No, Yokis are the fucking normal Yokai. The ones oh, that wield swords Oh, with the swords. I have not actually, not no. Not Agaki. No, I have not. I have not tried it on them. Then say, if you can do it to those, you should be able to do it to them as well. Because they're like the same medium size. Thanks, bud. What? Ah! I didn't push you off. Oh, sure. my screen anyways. I walked up next to you. Oh. Nah, you pushed me off. That networking then, because I, tr I tried to stand next to you. Yeah, 
Yeah, he actually hit hard. Take this. On. Aw. Uh, I'm gonna get my magic up. That doesn't get your magic up. Yeah, it does. It should, right? It's a magic item. Even if it's just a little bit, the initial. No. I know the overtime healing doesn't, I meant like the initial, oh sorry. The initial uh, spray does. Oh, it finally worked. Yeah, it only works if they're out of key. Yeah. If that hit hits them after the hit depletes them of key. And you can't really follow it up with anything. Hmm. No. I find it funny that they moved the Kodama from behind the staircase over here to out in front, so people were like, Hey, there's one here, guys. Because so many people apparently missed it when it was hi hidden behind the staircase in the trial. Hmm. They also moved the one that was hidden on the lip of that building and then just put it on top of the building. Yeah. <clears throat> People who don't use Kodama sense suck. No, I'm just fine. I didn't realize the maps are going to be Gigantor. That's half the reason why you want it, is because they're so spread out. Yeah. I kind of don't like the new Neo 2 maps, most of them at least. Dude, the one at the end of the game is probably the drag my yeah. least... I don't know. Even though the boss um, is cool, I'm just not going to go out of my way to even, like. I don't yeah. know. Whenever like, I'm if anyone asks me to help them on that mission. It's my least favorite mission to co op. But it's also, I've gotten very good at doing the mission. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Emil, your mic is fucking up. Whatever. At points, might as well put them in onto something. You gonna shoot cannon guy? It's really weird when you get all of them to follow you. No, it was only probably once you started moving around. Mm. 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 <laughs> Shut up. Where's the lady? I thought she would be here. I guess they took her out. No, I guess it's only expedition thing then. I don't know. Mister, I don't play the game normally, trying to judge what's in the game normally. Whatever. There's no annoying enemy with 6,000 HP here? Wow, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. I'll give that joke a, a 4 out of 5 star rating. Star On rating? the moist meter. Fall off, pussy. There you go. You know what? That sounded rude. <laughs> I was gonna say, why are you so hostile, bud? <laughs> What kicked the hostility in? Where's the salt and vinegar coming from? That delicious...
chips. There are currently two visitors, meaning you cannot summon Acolyte. Oh. That's weird. I know you can, like, random people that are in the world can help you, but... Yeah. But not through here, you have to go all the way around. Stop walking back and forth, shit for brains. Oh my god, the crystals really block them up. <laughs> Get stunned. Nerd, what are you gonna do? You ain't gonna do anything. No. I wait for the cop wire. Oh my god, whatever, I messed up the joke. I wait for the <laughs> cooperator. I never go ahead. <laughs> See, now I'm the guy that saves back, so I'm cool. You did that for that one little bit. No. Normally, I'm the person that ends up... Have I been in front of you this whole time, Tizzy? Exactly. You said sure. That means I am right and you are wrong. Normally when it's just me and him playing, I just stand next to him the entire time. Normally. But it's abnormal now, because I'm here. Yes, because <laughs> you are like a hyperactive Red Bull infused 13 year old when it comes to running around these levels. I'm, I'm staying back. I could have gone and killed him. I didn't have to shoot a bow. <clears throat> I mean, I want to change fair, my the character. Just die in like three hits. Hmm. Because your weapons are like OP though. I mean, even if he shot the thing with a freaking bow, it would have one shot it. <laughs> mm. Oh, he gave me a dung ball. I'll eat that for later. Eat that for later. So you're yeah. gonna eat it, chew it back, it's like spit it back up, and then eat it again. Yeah. How'd you know? I realized it was dumb once it came out, but I was just like, whatever. I doubt anyone will notice. You're in the party of super critical thinkers. <laughs> Indeed. <clears throat> but are you moist? I don't think that's a state your body can be in normally. Your insides are. I think. I mean, well, that yes, mucus. they have water in them, but calling them moist implies that it's like wet on the surface. Water is not wet. I'm pretty sure. Yes, it is. Yeah, water... yes, it is. <laughs> the fucking <laughs> the way you just said that was so wet. like. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Whatever you say, I don't. It doesn't matter. Water is not honest. wet to itself. That's the real statement. Exactly. Water being around water does not make the water wet. Exactly. Object has to be covered so water, water is not wet. wet. Yes. Yeah. But you just said water exactly. is wet. No, I'm saying water causes stuff to be wet. Yes. But then you cannot have what? water. You I have to rerun the stream because my brain seems to like misunderstood you, you what you guys said. You can't. Have something of course wet without water. I did not using feral. Phantom? That's... No, feral. You're not using feral. Yeah, I know. You're using phantom. I know. And I'm using brute. So I know. whatever you were saying is wrong. No, I did that on purpose. No, because none of us are using. I actually didn't. <laughs> On my existence, I didn't. Also, I never understood why there's two doors here. So just weird. Shortcut for a shortcut. Yeah. Instead of making actual shortcuts or making good level design, just have a bunch of bullshit everywhere. Uh. 
Oh, where? Down here. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Whatever. There's no lady here. Not like an expedition mode. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> See, I'm being you. Yeah. Oh, you didn't... Oh, we didn't get this guy? What? There's only two Omni- No, it's like... <laughs> I would slap you, boy. Boy, you go wind up dead. You don't do the country voice enough. Nah, because I can't. Country. Boy, I just can't. You go wind city. up dead. I'm a city boy in a city world. You go wind up dead. <laughs> boy. 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 Nah, I can't. Boy. You can also do the the like voice crack country. Like yeah. What up? What's up, brother? <laughs> nah, I'd probably say something like Sonny or some shit. Hey, Sonny. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you think about Holy over shit! Here? Oh my gosh, you're so funny. No, I can't. <laughs> I, I can't. It hurts my vocal cords. I think it hurts. Hurts your ears more, to be honest. What is it? Create a resonant frequency with your eardrums. <laughs> also over here Brody Brody Tendo let's go this way uh, uh, uh. <laughs> See, yeah I have 74 I said, health look who's look who's taking the lead now bud there is no lead because there's no enemies oh there's there's some amount of lead sure I'll be quiet and just listen and... <laughs> Tiny Tokichiro. Shut up. We're like two big boys and you're like skinny little I'm the story character. Haha. <laughs> Funny. This challenge is harder. I already broke it, but I'm gonna break it again, but like not talking is so hard. Just wanna say something. So there's an enemy back there. You wanna get the scampus? You don't have to though, I'll just follow you. Scampus, scampus. I don't think there's anything. I'll try there. I thought you would try to go through that crack. It Please. looks like it, right? Yeah. Nah. It's weird, even though it's like, it seems so possible to... I'm waiting for... Holy shit. When the hell... That's the first time I've seen him do a backflip, and not only do a backflip, he did it twice. Yep. That doesn't... Whatever, this game's characters are... I mean, this game's enemies are weird. They need to work oh, on yeah. their enemies. They're just more unpredictable. Err, too unpredictable. So much so that they're so predictable. So much so that you could fight an enemy for like five minutes and not see all of its attacks because for whatever reason it won't Oh my god, did you attack. see that? <laughs> Just walk through that gap like it was nothing. Yeah, you Super Mario brothered it. Hmm? If it's a one tile wide gap, you can just run over it. Yo! Your mic is messing up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. 
Ooh. Sounds that was like someone one. tapping the bass drum. Adobo Loco. Oops. Nice. I fell down. Because I'm following you. Because he's going. I'm taking it literally. When I say I'm gonna do something, being I take it. Absolute play. literal monster. <laughs> Why were you attacking stuff before we even got up the ladder? Not in slam. <laughs> oh, what the hell? These guys don't even shoot at you. No, they glitch out in this version for whatever reason, and the devs still haven't fixed it a couple patches in, so it's whatever. I guess they just expect the problem you to is, go up is that there. they detect you from way too far away, but then they don't shoot at you, and so they get turned around, and then because they're turned around, their vision range is reduced. Wow. So because they're turned around, they don't see you walking into the zone like they're supposed to. Because it is actually based on their vision. It's just like a cone in front of them. Kind of just like how your camera is. They can only see in the cone in front of them. Mm. If they're facing behind, their view range is drastically reduced. All right, After so playing, here, playing sorry. so many... Uh... I was just going to say, I want to bait her away, because if you kill the stone, she just dies and you don't get her stuff. Oh, god damn it. I hate the way they do the... <laughs> the little, like squirmy little worm dance when they finish the grab animation. Yeah, this is my, uh, least favorite enemy. Emil, your mic is still... Oh my god. You need to scrape together like five to ten bucks so you can buy another freaking earbud and mic piece. You just gotta remember not to set them down hard. And always pull them out by the jack. That's how I ruined one of mine. I think I was there when you fucked it up. Get out of here with that. Ooh, yeah, you jumped a soul core. That's what started to happen. Man, that's weird as fuck. Yeah, trying to phantom counter that is almost impossible. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, you thought I was gonna, right? <laughs> yeah. You, you you tried to be like you didn't see anything. Come on, Tizzy. I saw. I saw the light. You saw? You mean the darkness? That's evil. No, I, no, because your character glows. Ah. Uh. Your character is. Oh my god. Oh, nice one. Nice, nice tiger sprint, dude. Awesome. Thanks. You did it. I am best gamer. Who's better than me at Nio? The soul's like. If, I swear, if you say that again, I will. I will prosecute you legally. <laughs> Nio, the soul's like. The soul's clone, actually. It's not even a soul's like. They just call it a soul's clone. I forgot. Neo. No. Oh no. Uh, I damn it, I did it one... right. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, I think the best one is when Pyro pronounces it right when he doesn't when he's trying to pronounce it wrong. Because <laughs> Japanese is already not the right way to say it in English. So. Yeah. Nai o <laughs> People who use fucking kunai builds are just, like, you need to be destroyed. I can't farm any good gear on, uh, against Revenants in higher difficulties, because it's all just the same bullshit Kato set.
That gives them plus 20 ninjutsu, plus 10% kunai damage or some yeah. bullshit. It's like, okay, bud. You're so unique with the same build that literally 90% of people use. And that's, yeah, that's the only reason that, why dude, they're at that level of the fucking game. That's what that dude who kept coming to my stream changed his stuff over to. He stopped just using easy mode. heavy armor build and went over to ninjutsu and I'm like, dude, I... And he was asking me for like, what's a good build advice? And I'm like, well, for one, the original build that you had was good. The only problem is it wasn't good because you don't know how to play the fucking game right. <laughs> You gotta learn how to key pulse and do stuff, and if you refuse, you're just gonna be on no key all the time. Also, wait, Pyro, is Tizzy's stamina bar, like, off-center for you, too? No. For me, his stamina bar is, like... It's perfectly broken. fine, it's just like yours. It looks fucking weird on my screen. What is it like shifted to the side or something? Yeah, it's like shifted to the side and like blended in with the HP bar, so it's like only there's like a little tail of green sticking out the side that you can just barely see. Yep. I don't know why they give us that shortcut when we already came through here. Like this, this shit makes no. I mean, I guess it expects you to come back here after. If you didn't not come clearing. down here at all. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I guess. Because you don't need to come down here to go through the level at all. Mm. This is just an alternative route, which is what all the Neo level, all Neo 2 levels have an alternative route. Which is half of the reason why they feel so bloated and giant when you're trying to get all the Kodamas, because you have to go to the end of a half, it, it's like, I tried to describe Neo 1's level design versus Neo 2, and the only way to describe the difference is Neo 2 is like a sequence of chain linked together. It's a circle where there's two paths to get to the end of the circle that connect to the next circle. Whereas in Neo 1, the levels are designed more like a U, and once you get to the end of the U, you make a, a short line in between the top end of the U, if you understand what I'm saying. Yeah. Like a D. Yeah, let me buy. Yeah. But an elongated D. Mm -hmm. It'd be a long D, if you know what I mean, dude. That's what she said. I can't relate. Sorry, man. What, a long D? Yeah. <laughs> what, is that a micro D situation? No, uh, it's actually, uh... What, what is that <laughs> shit called? Um, Is it micro? I don't even know. <clears throat> yeah, I have the, the micro P situation. Micro The microbe. Oh, of course. Yeah, no, I just pee a little bit. Micro pee. <laughs> Honestly, it's to the point where I don't know if he's actually serious or not. <laughs> nah, I'm serious, man. <laughs> Can't I be having those. To verify. He wouldn't know that. I mean, <clears throat> not that I would know. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> High schools nowadays don't have locker rooms. <clears throat> no, nah, they do. It's just you don't. Yeah, change. but it's not with nude. <clears throat> New dudes next to each other. Yeah. Sorry, I grew up in the country. Only at the so gym. I'm the weird one here, so. Hey, you fucking redneck fucker. Not as far. Yeah, hey, more of the hick, but that's okay. Whatever. I can't. I can't tell the difference because I don't like actually try to learn fucking derogatory bullshit. That doesn't matter. Hicks talk like normal people, but act like a redneck. Oh, okay. Is Did that I why like, hey, people call them? Hey, you seen Cletus down by the mud hole? That's the that's butt like, hole. No, the mud hole. <laughs> no, I know. I, they always. It's what the Tizzy said. Cause the, cause they're all about mudding with their. Yeah, I'll be right back. Four wheelers and trucks. Yeah. <laughs> Get all them four by fours.
Yeah, but see, you said it in a nice way. They would be like, coming out looking like a negro. No, I'm being honest, because that's what people around here say. <laughs> yes, there's still people I know that say that. I mean, I hate... I, I, I hated saying it myself, but it's like... That is literally something people still say. There are still people who say, like, I, I mean, I can't say it because Hyro streaming, but N rigged, if you know what I mean. Wait, what happened? There are people around here who still use the word N rigged, if you know what I mean. Oh, God. Okay. Like N word rigged to refer to something that's like janky or put together. Wow. People who are obviously self-aware of this problem now call it jerry-rigged. But, yeah. That is still something that I'll hear out here and I'll be like, dude, you're glad that there isn't like someone live streaming that heard that around here. Like some random person just walking by with their phone live streaming because that's just so common now. Mm -hmm. Also, Emil, your mic is literally like freaking the fuck out. You know, we should just get a new mic, man. Let's just say... Honestly? It's not even that. You could get one of those little clip-on mics that you get for the PS4 from, like, GameStop for, like, ten bucks. <clears throat> and those things work perfectly well. They're just mono, so I understand why people hate them, but... Mm -hmm. Or you can get one of those trash ones that are, like, the two pieces. Oh, yeah. But it, he only uses it to talk, because I know his audio comes through his uh, TV anyway, so it really shouldn't matter. Doesn't he... Does he still not have his old PS4 blue thing that had the working mic but the broken earbud? I don't know. Not sure. It's kind of weird, because... Whenever someone talks, they come from the top of my head. Like, they're a thought. That hole Why? over there. Because that's just how the audio comes out of my mic. It comes out like they sound like they're on top of me. That's weird. Hmm. I like it that Every... way, though. What, you like everyone's audio being a face hugger? Yeah. That's the best. <laughs> also, you always think of weird shit. I don't know why. What do you mean? I don't know. I just never think of something like that. Now it's like, I have that image of my head of something like stuck to my head, just sucking on it. <laughs> <laughs> See, I don't have an imaginative mind like that. I say stuff like that, but my brain doesn't go like, oh yeah, I, I picture <laughs> me with a face hugger on my head going. <laughs> Jesus! I'm just gonna <laughs> get fucking on YouTube. <laughs> oh! What are these noises? They don't sound friendly. Yeah, but there's videos of plumbers on YouTube and those noises are a lot more foul. Oh, I got a level 170 weapon. So 170 is no. possible. I think it actually goes up to 200, but I could be wrong. Maybe, I don't know. I think you just need to get one item that's higher than 160, and then... I think you need to get further into the way the <laughs> Dream of the Strong is what it is. Yeah, probably, actually. <laughs> I don't even know I'm fucking min-maxing when I've, I haven't even finished Way of the Strong. I wouldn't say it's min-maxing, but it's, like, starting to yeah. min-max. Like, for me, my, like, minimum is I'll use, like, 50 to 60 Umbracite at maximum for a piece of armor to try and get whatever stats I want. Like, life mm. recovery from Emerita Absorption on no, chest yeah, is same. mandatory. That has to be there. Doesn't matter how many it takes. And then whatever extras I have, I'll just put on to random stuff. Yep. I have, like, 400 
Umbracite and probably a bunch that's ready to be turned into Umbracite because I recently turned some in. But that was like two days ago, so. Probably already out. I mean, I probably already have a lot again. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I just realized, I'm still wearing my Atagi Sadamune like I have a Kingo's piece on, but I don't. <laughs> oh, the single sword? <laughs> yeah, I was still wearing it like I had the set on because I was using the two-piece bonus for the life, but now that I wear all five Tatanashi, I don't need it. I need the Hacho, the Hacho Nenbutsu. For Saika's Yatagarasu. But oh, that'll just give me life what does that give Bullseye. You? Oh, what? Why would... That's trash. Or I can go for the Master Ar Archer's Bow and then have... 50% increase. Munji Matsu Karagu, and that's 20% bow damage. Yeah. Golden Boy. Golden Boy. That's what I call that shit. That's the, the Golden Boy set. Or you can go with Warrior of the West. Nah, get that shit out of here. It's good. It gives 100 life. It's like oh. for having the bow and the sword on. Mm. But then you're constrained to those. I don't know. I feel like the only reason why I haven't focused like a single build on anything is just because I use every weapon all the time. I'm not focusing on a single weapon. I just use it as my side weapon to get the set bonuses. Set bonuses mm. still apply even if it's not your main selected weapon. No, yeah. So. But I always like uh, what's it called? Um, I'm starting to get into the habit of uh, what's it called? Hold on. Let me read the skill. Flash attack. Flash attack. There you go. Just to be able to extend combos and make it look flashier. Instead yeah, of just beating but one the flashier thing with one way to do it is to just have your secondary weapon always have draw strikes and just do a weapon swap draw strike instead because it's way, way better for damage. Mm -hmm. I don't care about damage anymore like that. Probably start running yeah, level one weapons. I'm not talking about a full charged one. I'm talking about the baby draw strike that allows you to combo into your normal melee attacks. Oh. <laughs> It's weird how most weapons have a R1 circle now. Yeah, like the dual hatchets. Dual hatchets, would, switch glaive. Which make you look like you're about to take a dump right before the character fucking <laughs> does the animation. He like does a real squat into it and everything. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Oh, right here. Yeah. <laughs> it's like... <clears throat> Five skill. The skill requires no skill. The hatchets are the best example of why the single sword needs more updates. Because the hatchets have three triangle at end of combos for the mid stance. And the sword has swallow's wing and kick. Mm. Yay. But the sword has running attacks. Unlike most, well, I mean, most weapon, all weapons have running attacks, but the yes, but the running attacks don't combo, so it doesn't the matter. Single attack, the single sword ones. Yeah, they don't combo. They they, if you you have do to a use running um, attack. They do combo. You just got to make it combo by doing uh, what's that one skill? The one where you dash and you key pulse, so you can flux with that and make it the animation a lot faster. I don't know how to explain it. Yes, but it doesn't, it still doesn't combo. It uses a flat amount of key. Mm. And then once you do another action after it, unless you key pulse the running attack specifically, you're losing out on that chunk of key, and then you're taking a half to a full second because you need it if you're going for a full key pulse. Then it's just like, it. I don't know. I personally don't like the way running attacks are designed in Neo. And I wish yeah. that they would make them just go into normal combos. Because mm. rolling attacks do, and there are unique rolling attack combos. 
Yeah. Like with the dual swords and stuff like that. If you roll backwards with the dual I swords, think I was actually, showing... actually, the single sword does have a combo with the running attack, but I'm not sure. I no, think it, might it just doesn't. Be two no hits. weapons do. No weapons have a running attack combo. Meaning that mm. when you run and you press an attack button, it fluently combos the key bar. To me, a combo in Neo is when the attacks in sequence use key that is key pulsable all the way back. Mm. No, yeah. Like the low stance, the the low stance uh, for the single sword is an infinite combo. Also, I'm not when sure you if you set the... up a cup. Sorry to cut you off. Oh, okay. No, he's 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 typing on his phone. That's why you keep hearing the really really loud ding. Ding. Gonna give me tinnitus. I thought I already gave you that. Yeah. But then it went away because I fixed my PS4. <laughs> yeah. To be honest, it really improved for me as well. Yeah. I only hear it at night. What the PS4? No, my the ringing. Or the ringing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nah, even during night, like, that shit is not even there. It's not even comparable. Like, you can hear that shit through, like, with two doors closed in the bathroom. Fucking. Yeah. It was insane. I don't even know how people slept while that shit was on, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they were thankful for you actually fixing it. Yeah. That's why I'm surprised they shut off your Wi-Fi. It's like you fucking went out of your way to fix the thing. And do something Whatever. that could have cost you the console in the first place. Well, at least that's what people say. They're not actually that difficult to take apart and put back together. Mm. It's not like old consoles where there's a lot of tiny pieces and shit that yeah. you can accidentally shock yourself on. I'm still missing like two screws from the thing that I'd never figured out where to put. So, I mean, I did a pretty mediocre job to be honest. Like I messed up and it's still fun. Yeah. As long as there's a couple grounding screws in it, that's all that matters. They mm. can pretty much run with just one screw holding it all together. <laughs> if you really desperately wanted to, I mean, that's like a test bench for computers. It's just basically a rough skeleton to put the parts on to test it. Mm -hmm. Normally only held in by one or two couple screws. <laughs> you just don't want to be obviously shaking the thing around while it's on. Because, <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, the way the PS4 is built, even if the screws aren't there, everything kind of sits really well together. The only screws that really, really matter are the heat sink screws. you got to make sure to have all of those. Mm. Or else you're obviously not going to get even pressure on it. But that obviously wasn't an issue for you, because the second you put it back together and started it up, it was immediately quieter after you cleaned out the heat sink. Yeah, it was insane. Like, I, my mind was blown. Yeah. I loaded that's up a game and I couldn't hear anything, and I was like, oh my god, that's what I've been waiting for. Yeah, that's why, I, that's why the first thing I told you to do was to take it apart and get to the heat sink, even if you didn't have thermal paste or anything. Mm-hmm. Because even the shitty original thermal paste would have worked better if it was just the heatsink was cleaned. Yeah. Because that fucking mat of dust, people don't realize how bad that shit builds up over time. They just mm. take it for granted. Because they see the outside of the console and like the cracks on the inside and they're like, well, there isn't any dust there. And it's like, yeah, that's because that's the part you're cleaning. You're not cleaning the inside where it sucked the dust in and it's built up a wad of it. Even when people think they have, like, the cleanest houses that are, like, dust-free, their console will still build up dust like that. Yeah, because isn't dust just, like, dead sh skin yeah. cells and shit? And hair? Skin particles and fibers from clothing. Mm. I also don't have it in a really bad spot, because before I had it in a really bad spot. 
So it'll probably last me longer cleaned. Well, even then, if you had it in a bad spot now, it probably still wouldn't even be remotely as loud. Yeah. But now there's like... The closest thing to it is like my computer, and that's like a foot away from it. But that's why I was like way back, I think it was like a year and a half ago or two years ago when you were putting the freaking ice pack thing on the freaking <laughs> PS4. And I kept telling you that that wasn't like, although it helped cool it, it wasn't actually helping to cool it. Because mm -hmm. even back then the dust was probably fully covering the entire thing. Mm. It didn't, I didn't start overheating until, um, what was it? What even started overheating my freaking PS4? Monster Hunter? Yeah, Monster Hunter was like really where it started. I don't know. Sometimes you like playing Monster Hunter, but then I don't. Yeah. It's one of those games where like the original version of it was really good. There just wasn't much to do. And then they added more to do, but they changed the core mechanics and it's like it's not fun to go back to. Hmm. That's why I didn't go back to it, because they just had the free title update. What's that? What do they, they add? They added Furious Rajang and Furious Bracadios. Oh, is that like just cracked up version of them? Or something? Yeah. Mm. It's Rajang always yellow with no tail, so you can't break the yellow on him. He's always in enraged mode. And then Furious Bracadios is always in orange mode, where his shit explodes upon touching you. Wow. Uh -huh. Yeah, so it having the, what people used to use for Bracadios was you'd go the ailment hunting horn that prevented you from getting ailments, and his blast was basically nullified for the entire fight. Now you can't do that because his blast light is automatically applied like an explosion, so. And just, just crack up the game every update, yeah. man. That's part of the reason why I don't really enjoy it anymore as well, is it just be... I mean, all Monster Hunter games become super based around the really, really hard end game content, but Monster Hunter World took it to a new level because of how the game works. Like, the hardest content in Monster Hunter 4, you can go and look up people doing that shit, and they're just flinch locking the monsters to death solo. Mm. There's no stun locking or anything in Monster Hunter World, because every single thing has diminishing returns applied to it. It's even just like Monster Hunter Generations. Monster Hunter Generations makes Monster Hunter World look like an obsolete game, even though Monster Hunter Generations looks like a 10-year-old game. Yeah. Just because the flinching, the moves... The only thing that's worse about Generations is healing your character. And traveling around, too. That's about eh. it. But that's only because of the console. Yeah, but that's also, like, I like that system. I like the mini, mini maps on a bigger map system. Because there were a lot of core mechanics designed around it that aren't yeah. present. No, yeah, I get what you mean. World monsters just walk in between zones obnoxiously. Maybe you can control where they go or something. Yeah, you can, because meat actually had a purpose. Mm. <laughs> I meant, Back like, when in Monster world... Hunter was more like monster hunting and less like hunting. a giant map with fucking a monster on it. Find the monster, kill the monster, and the quest is over. There's no hunting process anymore, is what I'm saying. You don't need to paintball a monster to know its location. Mm. That's a system in every Monster Hunter game except World, is paintballing. To me, I think World is kind of a disservice to the series in a way, even though a lot of people really like it. I just... I like it, still. So. There's so many things about it that could have been better, though. You'd still be playing it. <laughs> if You're it was right. better. Its core is great. What it actually is, is meh not bad, but it's also just like, eh. 
That's the only real feeling you can have about it. <laughs> I don't know, I'll probably go back to it sooner or later though. I'll go back to it after they stop doing updates. Mm. And I'll try and continue getting mostly everything, but then again it's also just like, do I really want to do that? <laughs> <laughs> I did it for the high rank stuff where I did extreme behemoth for like three streams and just hated every ounce of it until I eventually somehow got queued into this three this group of three Asians who were working together but they had one slot missing and I just happened to join in on it and I was using a hunting horn the devil joe hunting horn and all three of them were using Diablo's charge blades and I just buffed them and healed them the entire time with wide range while they just killed Behemoth in like less than 15 minutes. Hmm. And then never beat him as easily ever since. You beat it a couple times with me. Yes, but not as easily. It wasn't in like less than fucking 15 minutes. It was like yeah. almost a full duration timeout to... One faint left if the guy dies to the ecliptic <laughs> meteor at the end, it's all over. Yeah. I haven't played frickin' that game ever since uh, Zach raged. Why well, he didn't even rage, he just stopped. Stop playing on PS4 that much. Are you in a mission, Tizzy? Mm. Let me go get something to eat real quick. <laughs> Excuse me.
Sorry, I had to get some water for some of my plants. Final blow, yeah, is when you stab them when they're laying on the ground. Grapple is when you stab them when they're standing up. If you wanted to increase the damage of that toe stab move that you have, you'd want grapple damage. Yeah. Because those override each other, so you have to choose to either have final blow or grapple damage. <coughs> But those damage types do not overwrite with, like, close combat damage. Or as in this game, it's called melee damage. The blue, blue rarity skill, I think it is. Yep. There isn't one for God of Wind, sadly. But there is one for Cherry Blossom, if I remember. pretty good do you have whirlwind unlocked with the dual swords because whirlwind is a really good skill to use when in a high stance in neo one before they right, nerfed karajishi you used to be able to just pretty much walk through the entire game with with Karajishi on using dual swords and spinning. Just doing whirlwind. You do like 10,000 damage a tick. Mm hmm. I personally never really liked doing that, so I always went for the cherry blossom type build because it did more damage. It just wasn't as hands free. I like dual sword. It's a cool weapon to combo with. Yeah, I just wish a lot of the new skills were easier to get. Yeah. It's cool, but like, it shouldn't take this many tries. Like, people have farmed that shit for hours and not even gotten one skill. And I got one like my fifth try and I was like, what the fuck? Twiz got one his first try. I don't even know. Oh, uh, I'm eating right now. Hold on. I'll, I mean, I'll join, I guess. It'll make it easier if I do play. I'll just be, like, eating. After this, I'm going to make myself some cinnamon raisin toast. Mmm, delicious. So good and tasty. Mmm, so good and tasty. Mmm, <laughs> that's tasty. I am all about that tasty. I like that how everyone's tasty. like... Yeah, I'm not playing Neo until it goes on sale because Doom Eternal. Or Animal Crossing. <laughs> Hopefully you'll be playing that game a week after it comes out. That's all I gotta say. The people with the Animal Crossing, yes. The people Probably, with Doom Eternal, yeah. no. 
Doom Eternal, most people are going to play through it one time and be like, cool, that was an experience, and then go back to playing whatever free multiplayer game they were playing regularly. <laughs> or go back to playing the shitty Call of Duty Warzone. Well, it's also free. Well, yeah, but that's what I mean. Because mm. that's like the most recent popular thing that everyone's been doing, and like, again, everyone's always like, Doom Eternal, <laughs> yeah, are you going to play that? Are you, is is that just going to be another Sekiro where you're going to play through it once and never touch it again? <laughs> the only person I've ever seen play Doom 2016 more than once is, uh... What the fuck is his name? The guy who beat Borderlands with a frickin' Guitar Hero controller. Senza. There you go. Senza beat Borderlands 3 with a power glove. <laughs> a Nintendo power glove. <laughs> and a steering wheel. And had Randy Pitchford tweet it on his Twitter. Wow. Randy Dickford. Twice. Twice. <laughs> Once when he did it with the steering wheel, and then again when he did it with the power glove. <laughs> Randy Pitchford ain't never tweeted about no jolts, dude. Wow. Yeah. He's one of the biggest supporters of the community. That's... Exactly. He's the voice of the people in terms of if you're going to listen to anyone on the game, listen to Jolts because he'll probably know it way better. Because mm. even though he plays without badass ranks, he does understand that a lot of people like to play with them on and stuff like that. Because mm. not everyone's trying to sit there like sweat, sweating their ass off trying to beat one raid boss to get a fucking chance at a weapon. <laughs> Not a guaranteed legendary, a chance at a legendary that isn't even that great, that you can only use with one specific build. One second, so I'm gonna use the bathroom real quick while you guys are waiting. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, ew. <laughs> that would have sucked. Also, sorry if you can barely hear me. I'm not trying to put my mouth on the mic so you can hear me. Yum, num, num.
I'm back. I like how everyone's like. Actually, you're not eating, so never mind. Don't go too fast. Slow down. It says Hyro. Yeah, but I'm eating like a meal. <laughs> Literally. Say hi, meal. <laughs> yeah, but he's not a meal, he's a snack. Sorry, you have to make that joke at least once a day. It is a legal requirement when you have the name Emil. It says on his birth certificate that everyone is legally obligated to make that joke at least one time a day. If you don't, it's actually against the law, and he can sue you. He needs to come out with his own line of food products called Emil's of Snacks. <laughs> Corniness sells, though. Look at Japan. I saw a vending machine that sells fucking pizza in Japan. That's the weirdest thing? I mean, it just comes out to of me. A, an To oven. me, that's weird. I think the weirdest thing there is that you can get, like, udon soup that's, like, almost freshly made with, like, nice warm broth and stuff like that out of a vending machine there. You get, like, <clears throat> basically a full-course meal out of some of those places. Yeah. <laughs> For half the price, and it's still better quality than what you could get at an American restaurant. That's what comes out of a vending machine there. The only thing that's not as good and I've seen it from several vending machine videos, is apparently they just don't know how to do french fries in a vending machine well. Which makes sense. You can't make anything crunchy fried in less than a couple minutes. Sorry. That nice... uh, you're like a cartoon character when you eat. Uh, it's like the mic is so far away from my mouth. I'm just saying that when you take a drink and you're like, that wasn't me. 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 It wasn't you that time. Nope. Wow. <laughs> I think we finally met Hyro's match. Hold on, I Except hit you with you one real quick. Your mic when you eat. Yeah. I well, Hyro just sits there like a cow chewing cud. I oh got you. Oh my god, dude. <sighs> oh, that's Honestly, delicious. Stop. Man. No, please continue. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> Alright, bear back, I gotta throw this stuff out. Hmm. I can't move my mic because my hands are all greasy.
Oh shoot, I forgot I didn't even mute my mic. Alright, I'm back. Welcome back. But I'm not done eating. I have a soup now. Of course not. <laughs> you know what that means. Where did you even get that from? The food? Is it just all microwave stuff? No, oh, ew. The f I can't eat that shit. No, it's from a restaurant. Even though they're supposed to be closed, quote unquote, but they're not. Just because those people don't care because they're like, what are they called, privately owned or whatever. Oh yeah, they're just trying to still make some money, dude. Yeah. You gotta make money. Yeah, I understand. Just put hand sanitizer and tell everyone to cover their face when they go in. I thought hand sanitizer doesn't even work. It only works if you put it on your face. <laughs> oh, no, so yeah. It's just because people touch their face a lot. Mm. And even if you didn't get someone breathing in your face, you could touch a surface that someone else coughed on. And it's like, even though the virus can't infect you through your hand, it's better off. Or wash your hands for 20 seconds. You don't necessarily need hand sanitizer, but it's the easiest way. Mm. But it also kills good bacteria, too. Because mm. there is such a thing as good bacteria. What about soap? Lives... Yeah? Does soap also kill the good bacteria? It just doesn't kill as many or something? Like, how does that work? No, they can recolonize. It's just... Soap is less of a harsh killer. Alcohol and stuff like that and hand sanitizers is like a fucking pistol. But it's a pistol that shoots at friendlies and good guys at the same time. Mm. Whereas soap is more like a, t a wave. And sure, it may take some people in a flood, but there's always going to be other people that escape sort of thing. And that's why when you wash your hands, you need to wash for like 20 seconds. You like, you, you, you get your hands wet, you put the soap in your hands, and you just do suds all over your hands for like 15 to 20 seconds. Just like a solid, make sure you get it all loose off your hands, and then you rinse, and you rinse for like another 5 seconds. Cause, yeah, that's how I wash my hands. Uh, Mark Rober just did a video on it. Oh, is that a guy who's popular on YouTube for doing a lot of science type videos or just social debunking videos. He did a video where he basically sent out wallets all throughout America that had random stuff on them and had people drop them in a place and see how many, what cities were most likely to actually return the wallet if it had like an ID or something in it. Mm. And what happened? And they th well, it was, like, not as many corrupt people as you think in the areas you think would be the most corrupt. Like, Chicago, for example, like, over, I think, like, more than half of the wallets were returned in Chicago. Wow. Places that people normally associate with people being thieves, but in, like, small towns in the middle of nowhere, they got stolen the most. Places where people always think that the people are more honest. I guess and it's, it's not exactly, because so many people live in the struggle, I guess. They understand. And, like I said, it's not entirely a correlation. Like, you, you'd you have to look it up. Mm. It's not like just a correlation in between city size or population or anything. It's really just about the area more than anything else. And it speaks more for the people who live in that area than it does for people in general. Because obviously they put it in different population densities, so you get a different statistical analysis of it. Versus when you put stuff in a densely crowded, like, big city, versus a low-density low city like where I live, where there's only 2,000 people. <clears throat> Not even really a city. It's a town. Hmm.
Oh yeah, you're right. What? It doesn't combo into anything, running attacks. Yep. That's why I always weapon. do that. I always go for the hit and dodge and switch stance. You didn't always do that. You only started recently doing that. Yep. It's the only way to make the low attacks more fluent. And I just like the low attacks because they're like the coolest looking ones to me. Like this. <laughs> Looks like a cool attack. Little flash. No, it's just that. I don't care, it doesn't do any fucking damage. Yeah. Like I said, it doesn't matter to me. Plus, I've seen too many fucking people spam that attack. What, the low attack spam? No, the fucking running attack. Even though it's bad. There's no point in spamming the running attack. You could just have walked up to the monster and started attacking it normally. Yeah. I already told you, it's not, that's not why I do it. Not for damage. Just to look cool. It doesn't even look cool, in my opinion. It just looks like you're doing one attack and then dodging backwards. Yep. I don't think the guy who's the swordsman in the anime who does one really fast, tiny attack forward is cool. Even Samurai Jack is cooler than that. Even he's a oh, multiple I forgot to change guy. my... Change my character's look. Why don't you just change it to William? Eh, I'm too used to William. Might put on like a Revenant or some shit. I don't know. Like the, the female, female Revenant. Revenant, so you can have ghost boobs. Yep, exactly. <laughs> They're not real, but they are. <laughs> Damn it, I'm so bad. Ooh, I hear Kodama. You must have the game audio cranked the fuck up, dude. Nah. To hear Kodamas from that far away? The closest one is like fucking... This is the one I heard. Right here. Yeah, that was pretty far away from down there. I don't know. You just have to have that kind of hearing... Uh... I mean, it, I don't know. It's not really hearing, it's just loudness, I guess. It is clear and loud. A, well, it's not loud, but it's clear. You're what a person would call a sound whore. Yes, indeed. Counter strike. I mean, yeah. You listen to all the. That's what happened to me when I started, like, playing all shooters. All the footsteps. Yeah. Yeah, you're sweaty, dude. You have to Is find a. What you're of course. <laughs> oh, of course. Too bad. I hate fucking no shooters. Oh. Uh... Sorry. I should have gotten rid of that guy. Uh. 
I've never been good at the duty calls. That's like one of the one sh shooters I've always been bad at. Yeah. I was telling Hyra the last like multiplayer shooter I played that I really liked was Red Orchestra on PC. Hmm. Do cool you have game. the Scampus in your hut yet, Hyro? Oh, of course. Do you not? See... I'll show you. I mean, unless you, you don't want to see, but I'll uh, I'll show you which yeah. one I have. I'll no. screenshot it to you. You don't need the screenshot and show it to me. I'm sure I'll co-op with you eventually. Mm. <laughs> I have seen the other rooms, so I know what those look like. Oh, there's other rooms? Yeah, you didn't know that there were other rooms that you could get? No, I'm talking about the one more than the ones that I have. The three? There's oh yeah, three no, I, I only have three. Yeah. I, I thought you meant, you like... No, yeah, I have all those. I assume they'll probably add more. Yep, I like them, actually. They get cooler and cooler as you go on. I use, uh, one that I don't think you have. Oh, sh I tried to look for an invite, because fucking... I'm so used to that being the way to that you, uh, co-op with people. In other games. Yeah. Dolls. My favorite kind of game are Souls likes and Souls games. You ever played that new Legend of Zelda Breath of the Souls game? Oh, of course. Yeah. Yo, you ever played that Souls racing game? <laughs> That's a thing? Who has ever said that? What would that oh, even yeah, be the like? Oh yeah, too, of course. That's Souls racing game. What are you talking oh, about? Oh my god. That's despicable to even it's think about. It's because the, the, the fucking hardest boss in the game is the connection. <laughs> it's the final only boss I would understand that because I fucking played. I'm the only one who played the crew through Saw. Turu? What the fuck did I even say? Crew Crudo? Crudo? Oh, that new mm. god of souls? Whatever the fuck it's called. Code Souls. Oh, of course. That game fucking sucks. <laughs> what, you don't like Code Vein? That's my favorite game. He hasn't even played it, so... <laughs> He played the trial of it with me, and it gave you the illusion that it was actually going to be a decent game, and then it turns out to be dog shit with bullshit boss fights the entire game. Triz- uh, fuck, Tizzy. I keep call tr tr trying to call you Trizzy for some reason. But Trizzy, have you played, uh, Sekiro? What was that? What are your thoughts on it? <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. I never bought it and played it, because I, I prefer RPGs more than I prefer, like, straight-up action games. The only action game that I liked was Tenchu. <clears throat> because that was more than just an action game, that was a find-the-guy-and-kill-him simulator. 
is like a Where's Waldo simulator, except you're a fucking shinobi and you can jump on buildings and stuff like that. That's where Sekiro got it. Its core game design from was Tenchu. Was, that's what you do in Tenchu is grappling hook up onto buildings and run around. <clears throat> that's part of the game that I think is awesome. I just hate that they took the RPG out of it. It could have been so much cooler if they had different katanas or different styles of weapons and shit that you could block or parry with. Again, that game is another it. one where it doesn't have a lot of RPG in it, from what I know. It's more of like a... ...story type thing. I think a lot of people are not gonna like that because of Sekiro. Because if you've seen the... ...the amount of combat... ...that they've shown in the game, it... Is it looks very very rudimentary and old, even compared to like Neo and Monster Hunter. But Neo kind of has like a good oldness about it, and it's not easy to explain. It's got like a PlayStation Two game kind of feel to it. And I mean that because certain elements of this game were thought about because they were just cool instead of them being, is this going to be balanced or is this going to be good? But then they started overbalancing the game. <laughs> what? What? Where? Oh my god. You got him saying the freaking Emil jokes. Oh, yeah. Jesus, I never noticed they look so fucking disgusting. It's so, like... It's like a PS2 game. <laughs> yeah. What's the, the... The sad part is, is that that actually looks worse than the unfinished Bloodborne content. <laughs> 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 the unfinished Bloodborne boss looks more complete than that pile of corpses. So I, I never noticed that. that. I can't climb. There you go. Did I ever show you the uncut or the cut bosses? That like big oh, red yeah. blob thing? Showed it to me multiple times. I tried fighting <laughs> one, but <clears throat> I couldn't find the code for it. He never gave it to me. Oh, if. Oh, if. You want it? I can I don't tell have, you, but again, no, nah, I don't have <laughs> yeah, Bloodborne it, anymore. Yeah, and why would you play it now that this game is released? There was that I mean, unknown guy that. Oh, the guy that was looking forward to your souls. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, because no, Dustin is it. Was a Google he streams. That came by my stream. I'm pretty sure he it was, was a bot, like... but. No, because he actually stayed and talked, remember? He did? Yeah, he he came back another time and stayed and talked for like an hour. Oh. Nah, just Dustin streams uh, games a lot. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, he was playing like Bloodborne before uh, Neo 2. Get this shit Yeah, I played it open. for like almost a month straight. Yeah. Mm. Going through all the difficulties. My character ended at NG plus six. That was a shortcut, by the way. This way. Over here. I don't even know why that's a shortcut, because you don't even need to go up there. You can just go this way and then turn left right here. Jeez. Put it on silent. Do not disturb whatever it's called. No, it just way. scares me. Like I said, I'm probably... I'm like definitely sure it's not that loud for you, but for whatever reason, microphones pick that shit up so much louder than it actually is. 
It happens with the earbuds on my fucking computer. I can hear those from like two feet away. The guy over there. Oh shit. Oh well, tenacity doesn't stop you from dying to the the environment. It just I mean, stops, it only stops you from the dying proc. to the yeah the overtime damage. The hell it just turned back into a yokai. No, it's because I rang the bell. Oh, I haven't even rung these. There's like a trophy for it, right? Yeah, now I can't get it to ring again. It's supposed to ring several times, and then the bell breaks and falls down. I think you might have to shoot it with a cannon or something. No, you can hit it with a weapon, definitely. But once the yokai ROM goes away, you can't activate it anymore. Oh, uh, okay. That's weird. Ooh. Get back in. I wonder if I chest slap it, will it like get mad? Yes, it will. I tried it oh last Oh my god. <laughs> Don't do it. I tried it. Alright, I won't do it. I won't do it now. I'll do it another time. When everyone forgets. Shut up. <laughs> Wow. I'm still waiting for that, uh, that what thing that happened like four months ago, by the way. What, what thing? How you're gonna get me to say what or something. I don't even remember what it was specifically, but I remember that you were trying to make me say something. I still remember. I remembered it like. No. You made me say something, and then I told you I'd get you back, but I never told you what I was going to get you back with. Yeah. Something like that. And you just did the American Dad episode where Roger reminded the person that forgot that that's what they were going to do, and now you <laughs> reminded me. So now it's going to be even more fuckery. Good. I wanted to remind you. In case you forgot. Or maybe you didn't forget and you wanted me to remind me that's the thing that you wanted me to get. I don't know. <laughs> Move, I can't get in. Yeah, why is this like a one person? I'm next. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh my I god, am... you put your ass all over my face. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Delicious. I mean, you were the one sitting there. I could have just moved. You're right. Just dodge, forehead. Oh my god. Die already! <laughs> See, this is as good as my Tatanashi build is so far. Wow, that's hor- I mean, it's not horrible. I'll see how much I take. I'll take 40 more damage on that. So, I mean, it's alright. I need some work. Well, I'm not wearing one of my accessories that gives me elemental reduction. Mm -hmm. You can also get a little bit like 3% or something from soul cores. I wonder if there's a guardian spirit that gives you elemental uh, damage reduce. I think the turtle. Is it only while guarding? Uh, 
You're done now. Oh, there's a Kodama. <laughs> hey, Hyro. Hello. You're doing a good job out there. Oh, you know. Oh. No, you know. <laughs> no, I want to be sarcastic. But... Damn it. Oh. There you go. Don't make me do it. Or I'll straight punch you, boy. God damn it, why? <laughs> you better be aware at all times, bud. <laughs> oh, you can't even dodge that. I wonder if you can just spot dodge it. Hold on. Nope. Hold on. I need to get the timing better. Oh, you bought it too? Alright, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> that, that. Damn it! <laughs> oh right, I forgot this map. You have to take it right here. Yeah, you have to go up. <laughs> oh, you might get lucky and get something here first try. Yup. <laughs> Death for the enemy. That is. <laughs> Ow. Yeah. Oh shit. Why'd you jump that? There's a Kodama over here. If you're looking oh, for yeah, it. Oh yeah, you need to jump down here. That's a Kodama that I heard. Also, life recovery from Amarita absorption is absolutely delicious, man. Well, it's not life recovery from Amarita absorption. Oh, it's... It's life recovery... Parentheses, Amrita absorption, parentheses. Mm. Okay. Sure. Yeah, end parentheses, right. Okay. Of course, I'm, I'm mistaken, sorry. Because the there's also ring. another stat that's called... Uh, Auto life I recovery, have a, amrit absorption. I, I have the firefly blade, and it's auto life recovery, amrit absorption. Which is the health regen over time. Mm. Damn it. You're facing the wrong way. You gotta be like this. God! <laughs> what? Ah, I got it! That's not way. I deflected it. I body blocked. God damn it. <laughs> it, it, when it's a three person game, it's a real difficult game. God. <laughs> no! <laughs> no, I'm this gonna get hit. This would be the dumbest mini game if they made a PvP mode that's just chest slap only. <laughs> God damn it. You get punished so hard for doing the animation. <laughs> yeah, you open up with it. <laughs> you gotta be accurate, too. There you go. You gotta try and Ooh. predict where a person's gonna go. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Opposite directions. Got him first. Ooh. There you go. You got the devil. Double kill. <laughs> That's such a cool move, man. Too bad it does no fucking damage unless you do this. I am anime Shortcut. guy. Shortcut. 
He's tanky. See, Hyro, the trick is to use an axe with that weapon and then apply the axe effect that reduces the key usage of the item, and then you can do that for like a minute straight. Wow. But it reduces the damage though, right? No. Oh, what does it do? Increase? It Decrease defense it, or something? No, it decreases your... It increases the cost of dodging. Oh. So dodges cost more at the cost of attacks costing you less. It's really good. It's called Battle Focus. That's what I used for the spin, spin to win on Umibozu in Neo 1. Should try doing it if you haven't. No, nah, yeah, I will. I don't know how fun. much axe skill you have, though. I don't know if you have all three of the buffs. Because you can actually put all three of the buffs on and then swap your weapon. Mm. And that is insane. I'm gonna get Merciless Barrage even though it's like, it's a whatever skill. Just to have a cool grapple animation. Yeah, and you don't even use the, the, the Toshie skill, which is the best skill if you get the timing right. Which one, this one? No, the actual Toshie skill. Oh, th this one? What? Wait. What one? This one. Oh, wait. No, not that one. That's the only one I have, it's remember? Called... Oh, you don't have triple threat? No, I told you, I don't... <clears throat> oh, I didn't buff. Yep. Yeah, sorry, we should have said something. He looks He's like cool. a character from Yakuza. Hmm. He also looks like Goro Majima. He's like my brother. Can I parry the parry? I wonder. No, you can't parry the spin after he does that. Really? That sucks. No, because it's not a basic attack. It's a skill. Wait, did you unequip your grapple? You you took away the toe stab? Why? <clears throat> Why did you take Wait, did Hi Hyro were huh? you the person who grappled in there? No. Why'd you take the toe stab off? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> The toe stab is the same though. And it gives the animal, right? Yeah. It's better. It's the only reason to use grapple. To be yeah. honest. Because otherwise, just draw strike him on the ground and draw strike him again. It's way more damage. Or cherry blossom. At least mathematically. Doesn't matter, Even you're gonna kill him anyways. Really At least there. <sighs> Man, what time is it? 2.40. Oh, so you're on the east side. Nice. He's the, in the west side of the east side. Mm. So you're in Chicago? Oh. Uh, Chicago is in the east side. No, it's not. Is it not? It's central. Oh. Whatever. It's west of Michigan, bud. I don't know where Michigan is. The, the only states like I know are like states are like Ohio and stuff. 
Oh hi, ho. Oh. Where That's are you from you though, Tizzy? Where are you from? Connect thicket. Yeah, I live right next to the Connecticut River. The Connecticut River. But I'm in New Hampshire. I'm in the other new that's not York. Oh, yeah. New you Delaware. Right. Oh, of course. New Maryland. <laughs> yeah, of course. Nah, not in New Jersey. He's in New England, dude. I'm in New of England. Course. Yeah. New Kringle. Nah, yeah, I'm in New Jersey. <laughs> he's, in, he's in the area where everyone makes fun of their lifestyle, even though everyone else also has hilarious lifestyles. Lifestyle, oh yeah. Remember Snooky? Oh, jeez. Remember when that was a thing and that and it died? <laughs> It still airs on TV, like new seasons and shit. Even though who watches cable anymore, I don't even know who. Dude. Chili cheese Fritos. That actually sounds good. Let me have a taste. Course. All right, here you go. Here's one. Mm, that's very good, Dustin. Thank you. That's so nasty. <laughs> I tried to ignore it at first, and I was like, ill, and I was just like, yeah, nah. Are you Spanish? No, maybe us. Are you the soy espanol? Bolas de fuego? Oh, of course. <laughs> Goodness Anywhere. gracious. We can drop down here. Bolas de fuego. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can go down this ladder over here. If you want a safer way down, that's not the high row way. Safe? <laughs> oh, fuck. He gave us his government name, but I don't remember it. What's your name again? Oh, you didn't? I think you just laughed at the question and, like, ignored me. Yeah, it's fine. You don't have to say your name. Hyro just always asks people everything. Yeah. He's a weirdo. What's your uh, SS? What's your SSN? Yeah. No wonder Emil is such a paranoid person. <laughs> <laughs> he has to be around you all the time. Where do you live? Um, address specifically? Um, okay. Oh, okay. Let me write that down. Remember that Hyro is streaming. No, yeah, he's joking and he's not sharing his audio. Oh, he's not? Nah. That's why I said, good thing, because he played like a couple of videos that would have gotten me, uh... Oh, yeah. What's it called? Striked or whatever the fuck it's called. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> <laughs> that is actually insane. He'll never know. God damn it. I have too many gestures unlocked to have that be no, a possibility. I, I do have too many gestures unlocked. It's just somehow I picked that one. Yeah. Because we were chest slapping. I was there by default. I was just like, you know what, let's pick this one, because it looks cool. I just so happened that at that moment, oh, it's weird. That rarely happens, and when it does, it's creepy. It seems like I'm in the Matrix, and I'm the real human. No, I think the weirdest time was when you were listening to the song, 
that I told you to play, and oh, I yeah. was ghost listening to it in my brain in sequence with the song that you were listening to without even hearing it because your mic was muted. And you were like, how did you time that so perfectly? <laughs> Yeah, just let me fight this guy. The joke enemy. What? You're a oh god, god, dude. Nah, no, yeah, you're right. What, are you gonna die to a muscle milk, man? Muscle, muscle milk? milk man? <laughs> muscle milk? <laughs> a muscle man, milk man? <laughs> are you gonna die to a one-eyed muscle milk man? Also, he doesn't remind me of Brandon at all. What? Tizzy. Personality-wise, no. Brandon's a piece of shit. Yeah, exactly. I was just saying because he's from a similar area. Oh, okay. Yuck. Yuck. How would you know? So that means you had to know where he was from. I mean, yeah. How? We we played. Ah, uh, okay. Like a handful of times together. Hmm. I think I met him when I was doing Neo One random encounters or something. Oh, okay. Just for fun. <laughs> You still have that Black Titan guy added? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. I was just wondering Why? if it was Tizzy, just like with a different name. No. That would have been crazy. Crazy! Yeah, it's almost like nobody's ever that done dude. that. Play Absolver? Absolver. Yeah, yes. it's so fucking weird. I don't even have him added, but like, I just know that does, that's what he's playing. I don't even know who still plays that game, yeah. Especially on PS4, because it's a multi-platform game, so it's like, even when you go to the Reddit and it seems like there's a community, they're split across three different platforms. Oh, there's no crossplay? No. <laughs> oh, jeez. Probably should do that soon because the communities are probably dying. It's because there's barely anyone playing it. Even though that game was, like, cool, but, like, I'm not into fighting games just because I'm not good at them. Well, it's not even, like, a true fighting game. <clears throat> Yeah, they're just moves that you can be like, normal move that's fast, followed by guard break move, followed by low duck move, and you can just do basic, like, three hit mix-ups in, in between different things. You don't even need a full deck to, like, womp people in that fucking game. Hmm. Yeah, because you're not going to have a full deck most of the time. <laughs> mm. Weird kick, jab, double punch, or whatever. There's like that one basic combo, which was just broken. Yeah. The drunken punch, yeah. Asshole, man, this boss is such an annoyance. The first time I fought him, I, he killed me like two times. 
I didn't die my first time to him. I actually thought he was a little bit too easy. <laughs> nah. His um his Guardian Sphere moves are like really nasty. The one where he runs back and forth, yes, but I guess because I'm used to Forgive me, Neo Gods. I guess I'm used to DS3's even more obnoxious running back and forth attacks. Mm. That are way Forgive harder me, to Neo deal Gods. with. <laughs> But it's true, those ones go in like a straight line. They don't like fucking... It's not like Vort in DS3, where you have to dodge the jump back and forth thing. If you mm. don't dodge it, you get hit. <laughs> Forehead. Mm. I feel all the replayability early game is going to come out of me just doing shit like this. Why? Just because there aren't many, like, missions to do. Like, like, what do you do after you beat everything? Like, obviously min-max and stuff, but then what's after that? Nothing. Because there's no DLC, you know, nothing, no Abyss. Even though I didn't even play the Abyss like that, at least it was something to do. You never played base Neo 1. The whole objective for people who like to min-max late game is co-op. If you're not a person who likes to co-op, then there's no fucking point. <laughs> mm. The whole point is expedition mode plus doing random encounters to then make even more perfected gear. And I mean, eventually you do get bored of it, but then like a couple weeks later when you're playing a different game and you're like, I kind of want to play some Neo, you'll go back and play that game again because it's... The addictive combat is what makes you want to play more in Neo. For mm. me, anyways. Yeah. Kind of crazy how he put so much time in this game, and I'm just now starting to do more crazy stuff with the combos. Starting to learn a little bit. Just watching some of the people who are crazy at this game play and seeing what moves they use and how they use them. Trying to add my own spin to it. Yeah, but you could just watch me. No, I meant like good people. Like insane. Like actually good. No, I'm wow. just <laughs> Like actually good. Yeah, those people are good at dodging. That's the only difference. Mmm. <laughs> really? Nah, I'm just playing. You're good though. I'm time, not gonna say yeah. you're you're not you're not bad at all. I though. suck at dodging. I'm great at the normal controls and doing all the different stance stuff and yeah like I said I'm the person who pioneered the weapon swap draw strike and learning how to draw strike in different stances from a different stance mm. I still don't see people there's do no that one, there was no one else who did that kind of stuff and I even made a post on it that people didn't even know it was possible on reddit back like fucking two or three years ago mm. Trying to tell people like, hey, if you didn't know this was a mechanic, you can do this. And like I was showing uh, Tizzy here the other day, there's a glitch in Neo 2 with Night Rain that prevents you from being able to do the one weird mechanic that I figured out how to do. Oh yeah, how you can Guardian Spirit? No, uh, no, no. Oh no. wait, no. Wait, how what? you can stance swap draw strike. Oh. How you could be like in mid and swap to high stance to change the draw strike at the last second from a night rain into a in into a quick draw. And that's because night rain startup animation is different. It doesn't have a charge anymore. It's not like EI or Tiger Sprint to have a charge. It has a set amount of time. So if you hold the button, it doesn't matter. It always comes out the same. And mm. that fucked it up and like I was showing him if you have your weapon drawn in mid stance and you have night rain on mid stance and you press R1 circle and then the triangle button if you go R1 circle and then triangle to swap the stance right at the last second your character will always just eh, and just stop what they're doing and just stand dead still it just completely glitches out your your, your character animation hmm I think I was doing it earlier, but you had to R1 circle and then 
square triangle, like R1 circles. Wait, no. What the fuck did I do? You have to do the you have to do the stance input before you hold the circle button for the charge. Mm -hmm. If you press. Oh it yeah, after, that's what I meant to say. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I was doing earlier because I figured yeah. out that you just you just go. I don't even know why I just did that. Like you can see me, like but you yeah. get what I mean. Yeah. No, just I stand. know. Remember, I, I. I know the technical analysis of the game. Mm -hmm. I if out of all the people that play the game, there's probably only like four or five other people that have as good of a technical analysis on how all of the intricacies of the stances and all this different shit work. And I know what every single weapon does in every single different stance with every ability that's available to them. Mm -hmm. Most of them of which I know by name. The only weapons I don't really know the skills by name are the the Tomfa and the Switchglaive. Hmm. And, and the, the dual, dual axe. hatchets, yeah. But those aren't. I don't even those know why you call them dual radar. hatchets. Just what do you hatchets. mean? They're all, they are called the dual hatchets, though. They are. No, they're just called hatchets. Unlike the dual swords that are specifically called dual. Yes. Yeah, exactly. They're dual hatchets. I know, but they're not called that in the game. That's what I was trying to say. It doesn't matter if they're not called that in the game. They're dual <laughs> okay. hatchets. Whatever. I mean, you can technically call the dual sword swords. Yeah. It's not. That's but they're not specifically an called dual. Explain it. <laughs> hatchets just implies there's more than one. That's the same thing with swords. I just realized. I have swords. I just realized that the the dual hatchets whatever thing is one is bigger than the other just like the dual katana. Even well, though the dual only... the dual hatchets have uh, the same size. That's the because sword. the icon is trying to imply that one is being held further away than the other one. Uh, like if you were okay. looking at a person holding them from the side, one is smaller because it's further away. They do that well with the dual hatchets, but with the dual swords it looks weird because the little ones on the on, in the front. Yeah. The little one looks like a dagger, to be honest. <laughs> More than an That's what it is. It would normally be a wakizashi. Mm. A wakizashi is basically a mini katana. A mini sword, or more like a dagger. Mm. It's what Hanzo has on his back. Young Hanzo, <clears throat> not old Hanzo. Hanzo. <clears throat> not Toad Hanzo. Non Cat Hanzo. I want I wanted to see more Neo One bosses just be reused in Neo Two S side missions, but like I'm like kind of disappointed that there weren't as many enemies or bosses as I thought there would be. Nope, I told you there wasn't going to be. That's I told you there would be more levels, but there wouldn't be as many bosses just because they're. You want to know one of the things I got bitched about the most in Neo One? Reuse reusing bosses. The fuck cares? I want to fight the same guy over and over again if I want to. Why do you think they removed the Mizuki from that one level? Not even because it was hard, just because people would be like, I have to face this boss again? Oh my god. Such goobers. Unryoki got used way too much, I feel. Three times. Yeah. In that underground mission, he's like hard to find, so I don't really count that one as even fighting him because ninety percent of people aren't gonna like go out of their way to find him like that. I only did because I was looking for all the Kodamas and just somehow got there. Yeah, even Rasan didn't find a way to get down there, mm. and I asked him if he wanted me to spoil it, and I was like, "It guessed a Neo boss from Neo One that got reused a lot," and he was immediately like, "Own Ryoki," and I was like, "Yep." <laughs> <laughs> Only part he didn't guess was the fact it was the Another ball and chain meal. Your mic is already fucking up. Yeah. Did you fall asleep or something? What the fuck? Actually dirty. <laughs> the one thing about Sekiro that I really don't like is that it doesn't feel fluid for some reason. 
All the running and jumping animations feel so like weird and out of place. Even though they're so such such uh because big every mechanics. animation in Dark Souls is over animated. Mm. It's like your character jumps and then he has to wait a couple seconds to be able to actually do anything. So it's like you jump then there's like a second where you're not doing something because you're just in the air. And if you don't press the air attack button with the one skill that you learn in the air, you're going to be in the air for a couple seconds and probably will get hit. So you got to you gotta dodge like a low sweep by like jumping, press R1 to immediately attack, and then be immediately ready to deflect the next attack, which you'll probably have to deflect. Multiple times. Not even just once. Uh -huh. Multiple times. And this gets into this repetitive loop that people think is like some type of weird god sense, like kind of common. And it just isn't like no, it just isn't. Those people, I'm just like you guys probably would have fun if you played Guitar Hero because then at least you could listen to music <laughs> and do the boss fight at the same time. Mm. I think Sekiro is one of my like top ten most hated games of all time. <laughs> <laughs> at this point, like I talk so much shit about it all the time. I just hate it. Such an unfun game. Like I said, it has the freaking the syndrome of that one game, Code Vein Syndrome, where everything has to do an AOE multiple times, and nothing ever feels strong. And people um, on the Reddit yeah. are like, "Get good. You're just ass." Some dude just called me straight up ass, and I was like, "Okay, enough of this." Also, Emil, your mic is fucking up regardless if it's muted or not. Oh. I don't know. Do you have your old microphone, Hyro? I do, but it's expensive. So? Huh, I'm cheap and greedy. Don't put me on the spot. Give it to Emil. No! He's your brother. You can't I do know. that to him. Shut up. He's your brother from another mother. And father. Emil's just like, I don't need another brother from another mother. <laughs> That's what he's really thinking. I know, I know. It's just that, I don't know. Well, I'd rather have Emil have a working mic than a mic that I can't even hear him talk half of the time because his <laughs> mic is just... <laughs> oh, God. Sorry. Just sit still. Sit as still as you possibly can. I know that's hard. It's hard for me to sit still, so... I'm always hopped up on... Oh, fuck. On caffeine and... Fritos. Coffee and Fritos. Coffee. That sounds like such Fritos. a drama shit. Chicken. Coffee and Fritos. <laughs> Except for there's probably actually a flavor of Fritos that goes well with coffee. Hmm. The default one is maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I really like these. Chili cheese ones. You add Those a little probably bit of... taste good. Well, I also add a little bit of my homemade, like, habanero powder from my plants last year, so oh, okay. I add a little bit of that in and then shake it up to give it some actual spiciness to it because it doesn't have any chili pepper in it, even though it's called chili cheese. <laughs> Tastes really good, though. Mm. Kind of has that Tex-Mex kind of chili flavor to it. I don't know what that is. Like cheap canned chili. No, I never had chili like that. I never had oh. chili like traditional chili at all, to be honest. I don't know what that tastes like. It's I don't know, people say it's good. 
Normally the best people who make it are a grandmother. <laughs> I mean, no. The best... If, if you're gonna have a black woman cook, you want, like, a jambalaya or, like, a gumbo or something like that. A true... True Creole. Or something like that. Hey, I'm just saying. I've always seen that kind of food are you on my TV shoes. Uh, what are you? Okay. Oh, you're a mixed, mixed baby. Are you, uh, Are you a light-skinned Barbie? I was gonna say, are you an Oreo? But that's like a northeastern person joke, so. Well, I uh, mean... In, in Oreo normally refers to someone who, like, well, not just that. At least around here, people used to use it more as, like, a very specific term for, like, someone who is clearly, like, has a deep complexion, but is basically a quote-unquote white kid in terms of how they act. It's like a... Yeah. Nah, I but most people nowadays use it to refer to a kid who just has a black and white family. But that's what we used to mean it when we were a kid. And Oreo was always the person that basically was the person who liked like orchestral music or something. <laughs> but that's me. I'm that weirdo. But I'm like Native American, so I'm my own weird racial group that got scrutinized when I was growing up. Also, can you give me a couple minutes? I know we don't like talking about stuff like that because people always misconstrue a lot of what I say as like me trying to have like a negative opinion on what a person is or where a person is from, but. I'm just a person who, in, in my mind, like, I treat everyone the same. <laughs> to me, I don't care where a person is from, what country they're from, what nationality they're from. If they treat me with respect, I'm going to do the same back to them. That's just how I was raised. Which one? You mean to put the blades back in the sheath? Oh, you mean if you walk a little bit forward and put your weapon away like that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. See? I do it a lot smoother. What do you mean? You mean like a draw strike? Oh. Uh, ah, uh, hold on. If your weapons are drawn, the fastest way to draw a strike is actually to tap the aim button. Yeah. No, I was just saying, if you were, like, walking around with your weapons drawn and you didn't want to do the sheathing animation, that's that's the way that my friend Rasan taught me how to do it. Hmm. Or you can move backwards. That's the way you used to do it to infinite backstab chain people with the draw strike and Neo 1. You do a draw strike, tap R1 circle, and then walk backwards, back around their back, draw strike again, and just keep doing that loop until they died. Doesn't work in Neo 2 because they don't fall over so when awkward. you draw strike them from behind. so weird how you have to freaking do it so fast now to freaking switch stances while uh to draw strike from uh single sword yeah 
Mm-hmm. You gotta do it all in like one motion. You gotta play kind of claw to be honest. No, you just gotta have lanky thumbs like me. I have. See, I can hold the circle thumbs. button and press the square button independently because of how my thumb is. I know a lot of people can't do that, but I can. Hold the circle button, press square. Yeah. Hold, hold the circle button, press R1 and oh, circle, holding the circle button with your thumb and press the square with the tip of your thumb. The tip? Yeah. Oh, actually, I mean, I guess. I have fat fingers, so. Yeah, I have lanky, skinny fingers, so like my thumb, I can fit them. I can, I can do that without touching the other two buttons, is what I'm saying. No, I touch every button if I put my my finger across like that. Yeah, that's how I do it. <laughs> that's why when I told people about the about that mechanic, people thought that it wasn't possible at first because there are a lot more people who have fat thumbs than people who have like skinny thumbs like I do. So I can do stuff with a controller like that, where my thumb sideways on the controller doesn't touch X or triangle at all. Because I kind of put my thumb a little bit sideways on the controller as well, just because of the way that my hand sits on the on, on a controller. Yeah, the only way I'm able to uh to uh high stance to mid stance to switch from draw to um, whatever it call whatever it's called is to stretch my my left hand over. Yeah. It's possible though, it just Yeah. For me it's a lot a lot easier. Yeah. That's why they uh oh they lengthened the amount of time in which you could get a double flux because certain people couldn't do a double flux from like if, if you're trying to go from mid to high to low stance, some people couldn't do that with their thumb properly in the amount of time required to get a double flex in Neo 1. But in Neo 2, you can delay the double flex like a full second after. So so you can go R1 Oh, X what squared. the hell? Yeah, and get way more stamina back that way. That's what I was trying to tell you before, is that if you delay the double flex, you get more stamina back. It's just you obviously don't want to do that all the time in combat because doing a fast double flex will still allow you to dodge, whereas the slow one is purely just to get a lot of stamina back. <laughs> it's it's just a key Gotta pulse and then swap, swap two stances, not the stance that you were in though. So if you're in mid stance, you have to swap from high to low. That's why the easiest way to practice a double flux oh, is yeah. starting out in high stance and then going to low to mid or mid to low. Yeah. If you're in mid, yes. But you can keep pulse to low than high as well. Do you have this skill unlocked? Because you actually do have to have it unlocked in the samurai skill tree. Flux and flex too. Yeah. Then Did you yeah, have it it's unlocked? Just changing to. Sorry. <laughs> changing to any two stances oh after a key pulse. That isn't the, the stance you started out as. So. If you start out in mid, you can't go back to mid. You have to go to low. That is so weird. Or high. That's what I was trying to get down with the Tomfa. That I was telling you about how I was delaying the key pulse into the flux. Oh, yeah. That's what I was trying to do with the Tomfa that I was talking about. But Oh, I just take Demon Dance off, honestly. <laughs> the uh, way yeah. that I play the Tomfa, when you watch me play it, I just take Demon Dance off. I just play it like a dual sword kind of weapon. Mm -hmm. And just use all the key damage abilities, like the shove and stuff, and just spam enemies out of key. Yeah. Tomfa's Demon Dance is really cool, though. If you are yeah, good if you're at it. really good at it, when you get the Mystic Art and you can cancel out of any attack into iframes, it's yeah. insane. But you gotta be fucking an insane person to actually be good at it. 
a revenant thing or whatever it's called is right here. I don't know. Can you spawn it in? But yeah, delaying the double flux. You can also delay the double flux off of one of those abilities. So if you demon dance to key pulse, you can delay the double flux like a full second after the demon dance as well. So it's even more delayed if you want to get the full amount of key back wow. that you can. <laughs> it's like you, you do an attack and you wait like two seconds is basically what it is. It feels so out of place though, like... And you can like almost never get it off unless like you're super far away. What, the delayed double flux? Off the demon the dance. Like delayed double flux, I can see it sometimes happening. Well like adding that extra demon dance animation and shit. Yeah. No, it just that's why every Tonfa user ever uses barrier slash kekai talisman. Hmm. For that instant key recovery. <laughs> Cause yeah. it, not only that, it also just has ridiculous key consumption. The highest of almost any weapon besides Zero Dachi and Axe. Hmm. And it's a spam weapon, so it, like, makes no sense. <laughs> yeah, and it doesn't scale with heart. It scales with strength, skill, and dexterity, if I remember correctly. Or skill, dexterity, and body, or some shit. Luckily now though with Dream of the Strong items you can uh <coughs> Oh shit. <coughs> Forgot I have it set the high stance. Make them specialized into one type of weapon. <coughs> if you haven't done that yet, Hyro. Wait, what? Sorry. Use the remodeling tool at the blacksmith. Oh, I used it, but I fucking wasted it all. I don't know how to get uh, more. You gotta do it in uh, Way of the Strong missions. I keep uh, calling it Way of the Strong, but you know what I mean. Nah, yeah. It's easier for you to say it like that than Way of Dream or whatever the fuck it's called. Dream of the Strong. Yeah. That's difficulty too. Yeah. Why does that take so damn long, man? That shit is like... <laughs> <laughs> it looks really good with the action camera, though. The way it, like, your character's overtly serious face just kind of stares them down. Mm. Mm. I'm now missing one hot animal. spring. Oh, how much do you get from that? You get sit you get half your anima bar. Oh, so I'd probably get like seven point <laughs> four or something. Yeah, I get six. There's a Kodama behind that door, by the way. If you don't see him. I'm missing one hot spring, I don't know if I said that. I don't know which one. It's it in is. the submission, I guarantee it. That's where I'm missing one and I can't remember which one I missed it in. Yeah. And there isn't an icon for it like there is in Neo one. No, there is. You just gotta press R1, remember? It's not really oh, an yeah, icon. Oh, that's right. Right. No, I forgot they have the tab where you can see how many locks yeah. are in a mission or whatever. I actually enjoy that they added that. I thought I was wearing... Wearing? I thought I was yeah. using dual sword. Try the freaking draw strike with the uh, spear. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Not even going the right way, I think you gotta go around here. If you go around here, they can't hit you. Did that motherfucker just shoot that cannon 90 degrees? I got rid of him. But I'm coming. Oh, watch out. You 
can't kill me through all my HP regen, dude. <laughs> oh my god, I would have killed him already. He's not even... No, it doesn't do that much damage, like I said. Yeah, this shit for all damage. Well, it hit him for 1,600. Ooh. <laughs> not that bad. It hits for like 400 on the initial, 1,600 on the middle part, and then like 200 when he pulls the sword back out. Hmm. It does like 2,000 damage Oh, it's collected. this mission. Yeah, you can talk to... You, you can talk Hanzo. to Hanzo. Hanzo. There you go. Yeah, now can... both your oh, stamina wait, wait, bars are like crooked for me. Oh. Oh yeah, his is for me as well. I think it's when he picked up that guy. Ew. I see what yeah. you mean. Yeah, it's like all fucked up. <laughs> yeah. His is like super fucked up for me now. His is just his regular is like, Had fucked multiple up. evolutions of it. At first it was like off to the side, now yeah, it's like now they're it's completely off to the side. overlapping. <laughs> I like I can't I can barely even see what his key is. It's just like a tiny little green line underneath the bar. <laughs> oh shit, I forgot I'm using this fucker now. Hanzo took that long. We killed the enemy before Hanzo even walked into the room. Yeah, like, he hey walked guys. in with his sword. I mean, his uh, spear already in his back. Still in his back. Yeah, he's got also, the frog spear. Just realized this one. is a shortcut. Which is actually a part of a set now. And is not called the giant frog spear. Mm. There, like, there's so many Neo 1 bosses that I just wanted to see. Like, I really hope they add them back, all of them. Just all of them. I hope that's what the improved abyss is gonna be. Yeah. Because they had so much... Regardless if you think the enemy, like, the bosses are, like, lame or already been... Or unoriginal, they're just... No, I liked fighting bosses, like, New Way and stuff like that. They were a fun fight. Because they weren't hard, but they also weren't a pushover. Mm. If you got stunned by Nue and he did the fucking sonic spin at you, you were pretty fucked. This area is cool. Stop. <laughs> oh, I thought freaking Hanzo was an enemy. Yeah, because he took forever to get here. I just oh, literally... Yeah, this is the first wheel. The wheel is a really good skill. Does he drop or a soul core? He has a chance to. He doesn't drop one every time. Well, I missed time now. Take him on a spin. <coughs> yeah, I just gave everyone a fresh defense talisman. Is he sloth? Why did he feel so slow? No, that attack is always that slow. Oh, I guess they changed it in way of the uh, whatever it's called. Maybe yeah, it's slightly fast. faster. Yeah. It's so weird, like, getting reused to the timing. I keep saying way of the strong, but I'm just gonna call it that from now on. Just cause, whatever. Yeah, to be honest, I don't know. This is dream bullshit. Because it was all a dream. 
<laughs> Neo 2 story is fake. William never lost him. This old 70 year old character. Oh, wait. Yeah, I know. He's such I actually old know what he's. Yeah. I forgot you said you didn't care about spoilers. That guy has a crab looking thing. What the hell is that? Oh, that's a wheel monk. He has a Kodama? What? The hell, this guy has three freaking guardian spirit. I mean, uh. Three, uh, thingies. Oh, wait, they all do. Yeah. Nah, I just thought this guy, because he was a higher level, that he, like, came back to this mission and died. I didn't even know there was a Kodama Soul Core. I haven't gotten one. Yeah, I haven't gotten one either. I know there is one, and there's literally a trophy that is for getting it. That's how you get the one where, like, you get all the soul cores, too, I'm pretty sure. I hear him just parry nonsense. Oh my god. <laughs> the hell, Hansa? Freaking smacked him while he was going down. There's something back that way, by the way. Yeah. But yeah, how do you... I wonder how you get even on Kodama Soul Core. Maybe you have to get all the Kodamas in the no, game? I already have all of them. It has to be like some random shit that you can get from a random ass enemy that has like a low drop chance or something. I don't even know. Or maybe it's from that one side mission where you have to help the Kodamas. I don't know, to be honest. But where did you see it on? On this guy? Oh yeah. Yeah, he's got like a Kodama looking soul core. <coughs> Maybe if we kill him. Kill him! Give me the it's Kodama soul core. Time. I mean, he got it early on, cause... Yeah. He's wearing like yellow fucking garbage. Yeah, he was wearing some white stuff too. <laughs> Real ninjas use tiger sprint. Yeah, but you're not wearing the Warrior of the West armor. Yeah. I'll do a Warrior of the West roleplay some other time. I want to do a Ninja 2 build after everyone who's done the Ninja 2 build gets bored of it. That's not going to happen? Because the people who do Ninja 2 builds are already bored of the game? Long. Probably. At if you're that desperate to beat the game, you're already bored of the game. <coughs> oh, there's a little thingy right here. Oh, yeah, sacred water. Jesus. Oh, 
Oh my god, I tried the freaking draw strike from Morning Moon or whatever it's called. No! It's alright, you can come back. Yeah, but he has to go put a cup down. Uh It's alright, we're gonna hit the shrine up soon. That ability is so annoying and shouldn't be allowed to be spammed. Oh, he's gonna do it another time. The spin? Yeah. <coughs> he literally did it three times in a row. Stop using fucking low stance. Who? You. Use some high stance. I use high stance. I use every stance. I just always engage with low. Down there. Wow. Yeah, that's such a, like, fucking annoying thing that they added. What, did he die? Nah. The skeletons have, like, that weird... Like, they deform, or whatever the fuck it's called, and then teleport somewhere else. Reform. Oh yeah, they dodge. That's their dodge. Everything does it now whenever you try to shoot or throw firebombs at something that can't engage with you. They just auto-dodge anything you throw at them. I don't even know how the kunai build works. Wouldn't everything just dodge it or like... No, because you still need to be within engagement distance. To you need to have on. the enemy aggroed on you so they don't try to dodge everything. Hmm. Bait them into doing a move and then you just fucking unload with storm kunai or normal kunai yeah i've seen some goobers just like make the game super unfun and clear out the whole mission before everyone is like even the first shrine is even activated <laughs> some dude like did that while i was co-oping he just ran through the whole level killed everything yep just went Ch -ch 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 doing like four thousand damage a throw yeah and then using a shinobi box to get all of them back Using the freaking Kato set or whatever the fuck it's called. Yeah, and then everyone I'm uses. Ninjutsu rolled on every piece of armor, and then rolled on both the accessories, so you have like a 60 to 80 percent chance to throw a free, free one. <coughs> and you just stand there and mash down on your D-pad or whatever the fuck you set it to. That's fun. I think magic builds on freaking Dark Souls have more to them than that shit. Well, magic builds, you're cycling all your magic with one button. Mm. And then you have to press a completely different button to cast it. Oh, what the hell? I didn't even see him. Campus. Oh shit. I thought you were gonna attack him. You think of the enemy, I mean Hanzo's enemy. He is Hanzo the demon. <laughs> he just smacks like random objects in his way. Yes. That's their...
try to get the AI. Hey, did you get to a shrine yet? We're almost there, yeah. <coughs> I'll let you know, or he'll let you know, or something. Oh, this is just down here. I want them to add Izuna drop back. Yeah, as far as I'm aware, it's not in the game currently. Yeah, it sucks. Neither is Flame Dragon. Oh, which one's that? The Fireball. Oh, okay. Yeah. That giant AoE fireball that you could summon that was probably the only good offensive, like, spell or magic or ninjutsu in the game that wasn't a fucking kunai. Hmm. Oh, uh, later on in a mission. I spent, like, an hour trying to get through that and just, like, it's so bullshit. You have to do a lot of backtracking in, like, the new Neo missions. <coughs> <coughs> Yeah, because, like I said, they're set up like a chain-link fence. It's like, the second you get to the half end of a half circle, you have to go back the other half circle to get all the shit that was in that part of the half of the map. <coughs> so every part of the map has two fucking half circles that you have to clear out that don't intersect with each other at all. So there's no, like, cross paths or anything. It's not like... Even in the big missions in Neo 1, most of them were like circles. The only one that wasn't like that was the last mission in the, the quote unquote last mission in the game, which is basically a straight line up to a castle. The one with the, the Amata no Orochi. The one where Hanzo and Okatsu follow you? Yeah. Oh, okay. That one's just a straight line, for the most part. I really like that mission, actually. I I was expecting missions to be more like that, if they were going to be long, not like what they have now, where it's just like, you go down, then to go up, to then go all the way down, just to come all the way back up. Like, it's like, what the fuck? Yeah, it's a fucking rap song. <laughs> are we jumping up, or are we getting down? What's the... What's the memo here? Jump up, jump up to get down. Jump around. Jump around. I'm gonna die. No. God damn it. <coughs> That's such an annoying thing though. Deal with. <coughs> yeah, let's hurry up and get to that shrine. Like, right there. There you go. That's how you get that Kodama. Let's get out of the shrine so we can summon him and then go back. <coughs> Excuse me, jeez. Alright, what's up, Dustin? What? What's up? The cup's up. The cups up. Da 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 da. Ay, but, but. You suck, suck. <laughs> Man. The freaking rat fink thing that you showed me has been stuck on my head for like the past couple months. Or months Why? that you told me. Just because it's such a cool like character. Oh yeah, that's like one of the original like biker 
kind of designs. Mm -hmm. Ever since I was a kid, that's like been one of my favorite things. Yeah. I used to have like three different Ratfink t-shirts that were a bunch of his different designs because he's done Ratfink, but he's also done other stuff that's in the same style that is also really fucking cool too. Mm. Yeah. I got one of his like little pictures Oz, and one of my profile pictures for Instagram. Mm -hmm. That's a cool picture to be honest. Yeah, if you've never seen anything Rat Fink, it's like a it was a character made by a guy in like a specific just crazy over it's like super overly detailed <laughs> but in like a grotesque way. Like it's got like mangy teeth and like the lips are all wavy and like its tongue, tongue is like is three like, feet long. And has like little <laughs> what do you call bumps it? Uh, and stuff bumps on, on it. Yeah. It's really cool. Yeah. I like it's it. It's really, really good. Rat designer fits Rat Fink very well. <laughs> mm. Mm. Use a different weapon. Use a different weapon. Oh, I thought you said that it was too much. Oh. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this map has a problem with that, like, PS3 fog. It just kind of makes everything look, like, hazy and dull. He's gonna get ya! I can <laughs> hit that shit pretty well, but not there. <coughs> yeah, I might have this cough on me now for some reason. Yeah. Did I really get sick when I knew I was probably gonna get sick from what I just did? Whatever. I was like, you know what? <sighs> Fuck it, if I get sick, I get sick. And now I'm fucking sick for some reason. Or at least I'm starting to get sick. I don't know. Well, unless you're really unhealthy, a sickness shouldn't come on within several hours of doing something. It would have been something you'd done like four or five days ago. Wow. Uh, no, I haven't. I've just been in my freaking room, man. Just been playing Neo. Nothing I haven't. <laughs> Eating? Nah, I do eat though. That was smexy. Wow, that has a huge AoE. Careful, dude. Oh shoot, I tried to shoot at you thinking that you were an enemy. That was the other enemy that was there. Dead. It actually Yay. does something, but you had already shot it. 
Yeah. Yeah. Even though the, like there's literally a door right here, so I don't know why they even added that. <coughs> Just for the haha -ha lols. There's a cannon up here you actually do need to fire though. No, I already got this it. Cannon. Oh, you, yeah, yeah, I, I know. So I just want to back for. <clears throat> I was just saying that's the cannon that actually does something that you actually need to do it. It's the only useful one. Maybe I'm just down with the sickness. I don't even know how that shit goes. Get your ass up. Oh, what the hell? That's what I'm gonna do. The freaking tornado or whatever this shit is, this is like literally my favorite move for the spear. That one in the high stance poke one, they made a lot better in this game. This one or which one? The piercing rain? The piercing rain, yeah. yeah. No, yeah, I was thinking of either putting that one on, because it, it actually probably is better than this one, I just like this one because cool yeah it looks a lot more than... fluid yeah but it doesn't work 90% of the time whereas the other one does <laughs> the other one always works mm. the only one that that is really good for is like Saika the the like flying guy because you can hit him in the air mm. with it mm. you can just throw nah you can just throw like a pebble at him though no. or whatever I usually carry bombs. Yeah, but it's more damage if you hit him with your weapon, and it's cooler looking. Says the guy who was like all about cool looking stuff earlier because he was doing a freaking 200 damage running attack with a single sword. Ha <laughs> Because he saw someone do it online. There's a reason why I've never taught you how to do certain things like that. Because yes, it is good, and yes, it does look cool, but it is utterly boring. Because everyone does it. Mm. Oh no! And it doesn't combo into anything. <coughs> Don't worry, we'll kill this one. Or not. No chest slap. I was ready. Don't do it! I was about ready to do it just to you to stop him. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm ready. Oh god, it's a snake. Oh my god. Come on, let me get him. Well, whatever. Alright, just doesn't matter what we do, we just gotta beat on him. I like how you don't even have to go to the next, like, you can just stop at the stomp. Yep. And the stomp key pulses as well, if you didn't notice. No, yeah. I use it to, uh, you... what do you call it, to switch stances sometimes. Well, no, I mean with the tornado. If you time the inputs, you can keep a key pulse that will give you more key back. Cause wait, if, oh, wait. If you watch the... The stomp part makes particles come up. If you press the tornado oh, button I see. at I the see right what you time, mean. yeah, you keep more more key oh. for the combo. I see what you mean. Yeah. If I remember correctly, anyways, hold on. Uh, it looks around the same, to be honest. Oh no, no, it does. It save it saves it wherever the key pulse was. So if you just mash it, you'll lose more stamina than if you time it. 
<clears throat> Try it, you, you'll see. Five ninety. A little bit more, yeah. Yeah, it's not much, but it's just like the same thing with the fluxing. It's like it's only a tiny bit extra, but you add all those little tiny extras up, and it actually is pretty good considering your key recovery will always be shit unless you level up courage. Yeah. It's like I like the idea of courage, but at the same time, I hate it because it makes the default recovery speed really, like, ass. Yeah. That's why barrier talismans exist, though. Mm. I might start running those, to be honest, just because I'm... You don't? Nah. I never thought they would be useful. Because I always Even just use does. a sacred... Sacred water. Wait. Yeah, see, that's a barrier. He just put one on. Alright, let's go. I can't even remember what boss this is. Toriyoshi, or oh, whatever yeah. the fuck his name is. No, it's you. Yeah. Tokichiro. Toriyo you, you oh, know. right. I was thinking Tokichiro. of... Tokichiro. The one from, uh... Neo 1. If you the actually one. want to say it like a Japanese person, it's Tokichiro. Not mm. Tokichiro. Hideyoshi. The only person that fucking ages, man. It's nice seeing a real character in the cutscenes for once, and not an anime boob girl. <laughs> wow. I wonder who that is. <clears throat> Iroh. But I have a chest plate on that, like, completely covers it and makes it flat, so it doesn't really matter. Puri Puri Samurai. Oh wait, or is it Puri Puri Man? I don't even remember. I think Tokachiro is a hard boss, but he's just literally the Neo One guy. He has the same move set. Yeah, I don't have that move. <clears throat> oh, yeah, because it's like God of Wind on steroids in terms of needing to time it properly. Yeah, I was seeing some guy use it with the whole Matsuza set. I'm guessing it's affected by thrust damage. Yeah. In the Mystic Art, that increases thrust makes it better. If you time the third hit right, it's like God of Wind, <coughs> where you get an extra little mini hit that does a ton of key damage mm -hmm. as well. Here, I'll see if I can properly execute it for you so you can see. Like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just like my Detoshi is. Yeah. So, Mida, they all have Mida has perfect. three skills? No, two. Two that you can learn. Oh, he has triple okay. threat and the, and the and this one. Yeah. That shit uses way too much key. It like needs to be, and you can't keep pulse out of it. So bad. Yeah. Has a follow up yeah. though. That you yeah, can't keep pulse. Yeah, and what's funny pulse. is if you assign a, if you assign one of those skills to it, uh, it makes it use even more key. Yeah. Exactly. That's why I took that shit off. It completely wasted my bar. I was like, yeah, no, these skills suck. Absolute ass. I pretty much... The only ones that are worth using are the ones that are damage bonus for a stat. Because they're only yeah. like a 1.10 yeah. increase. So I put the damage boost stamina on the skill that I want to do the highest damage. And that's about yeah. it. Like with dual swords, I put it on cherry blossom and shit. 
I thought it was going to be like a cool system at first, and then like realizing now that I actually use it more, it's actually like kind of bad. It needs to be worked a little it bit. It needs to be, a lot of them need to be buffed yeah. in terms of the amount of key they use needs to be lowered. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or the amount of damage increase needs to be substantially higher. Yeah. Or whatever the effect they give is. Because right now, the downside is not worth it. Even a yeah. lot of the pro players don't even use them. <laughs> mm. It's sad because it's like such a cool idea in theory, but they make such a bad, like, freaking downside to it. Every upside has to have, like, a severe downside. To be honest, like... there shouldn't even be a downside to it. It should, like, you're already spending a point to unlock it. Might as well be progression. Yeah. Yeah, it should be choice, but instead it just encourages you to be like, eh, do I really want to, if I spend this much, because a lot of the time what it does is it makes you spend so much key, you actually can't double flux to recover it all. Mm. And you actually will end up running out of key without having a barrier talisman or something, because barrier, like you saw, it's just OP. You basically it just stop attacking for a half a second and you're at full key again. Yeah. No, yeah, I noticed There's that no with point. Sacred Waters. Is it, like, as good as Sacred yeah. Waters, or, like... No, it's better. Better? Wow. Yeah, it's, like, almost double the speed. <laughs> what the hell? And I already thought Sacred Water was, like, busted. That's why I was curious. That's why you it. had it in that fight, because he put it on with his low magic, because the, the higher the magic just affects the duration, doesn't affect the key okay. regen. So the key yeah. regen is just insane on it. Oh, so that's why that goober that was doing yep. that Jutsu build was having quick change on for the whole freaking mission? Yes. That's also just because the Mystic Art is a lot better now. The Mystic Art that makes them last longer got combined into the Mystic Art that makes them instant cast. So now they're instant what? cast and they last longer. With what? Ninjutsu. Yes. I thought it was the casting the one, though. Yourself. I don't have it yet. It's only Omnio Magic that has them separate. Because ninjutsu has the mystic art that increases your throwable damage. So you have to pick if you want buffs that last forever oh, okay. or slightly increase throwable damage. But the throwable damage isn't worth it versus having buffs that last forever. Unless you're doing the, the one build yep. where you go... Ching, 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 ching. Mm -hmm. I have all these combos and amazing combat, but I want to press one button. Yeah, the boss is too hard for me. I want to just go. <laughs> oh, I need to dodge. <laughs> Dead. Yeah. I did so much. I just grinding. I had to fight three revenants because everyone uses the same army set. It's kind of sad, to be honest. I don't know. However you want to play, it's whatever. You spent the money, you get to waste it how you want. It's the same people who are like, Doom Eternal, even though they're only going to play it for like two days. Rainwater. Aguita. Aqua fresca. Agua. Agua fresca. Yeah. Yo, you got some fresh water? Water. Yo. I need that agua fresca. Say it like an Australian, Mexican, American hybrid person. <laughs> Imagine a person who speaks in an accent where every third word is a different accent. That'd be kind of scary. What up, Mike? 
Hey, yeah. Nah, I don't even know. Like, that shit would be kind of a talent, to be honest. Hey. What? Oh. Mate. <laughs> Mate. <laughs> Mate. And you have to have different mannerisms each time. I so it's like, if, if that word... If... Mm. Yeah, like you go from like American to Irish to Scottish to British to Australian. In each word on each separate word. So each different word is spoken in a different accent. <laughs> that would be so freaking weird. I would love to see if someone. Of someone? <laughs> As your. Wait, wait. I just did the clan battle turn in thing. As your individual record for this clan places you in the top 532, they have loaned you their treasured tea utensils. Wait, what? Wow, thanks. What place are you? Hold on. <laughs> well, that was for last week. Holy shit! <laughs> right now, for individual clan rank, I'm at 273. For overall, I'm at 5,692. I'm 233 for clan, 4,671 overall. My position is an elder. I'm an elder as well. My clan favor is Honda? 1 million. Yeah. Oh shit, so we're already like competing to be the best in the Honda clan. We're 140. What oh, clan what does are that mean? Oh. oh, you're in Honda too? See, everyone's in Honda gang. Yeah. Oh, that's not bad. That's good considering you're still <clears throat> playing through the first difficulty. Well, and, like, Honda is, like, the fourth and fifth most populated clan. Fifth, yeah. This is overall fifth. Oh, yeah. Well, that's just yeah. in terms of points on the leaderboard. That's not indicative of population. Oh. The overall rank is just what position are you on the leaderboard? Oh, yeah, Honda because Honda only has three, three character people yeah. on it. <clears throat> And Why? What? And Toyotomi? Yep. This guy got a hundred million. <laughs> yeah, that's a save editor. He figured out how to save edit the game. Already? Yep. That's not that hard. Most of the stuff that worked with Neo 1, it's the same engine. <laughs> There's nothing that stops you. So the guy that's 16 million is a legit, or is that guy also like a... Yeah. That's legit. I then. would call that legit. If you're, in Dream, if you're in Dream of the Strong, last week you could have been in Dream of the Strong all week long. And that's like 300 glory a kill. And some people literally only farm revenants. On top of the fact you have to remember, you can leave a benevolent grave on every single mission in the game in both difficulties. And that you can? amount of glory. Well, you can only you leave get... one. Yeah, you can only leave one. One in a mission? No, no, no. One in each. Uh, what is it called? Uh, difficulty. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Why'd you do that? <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> what even is that? Oh. Jeez. Oh. <laughs> I can't even remember what I was saying. Yeah, me either. That shit, like, scared me. Oh, they only farm. That's because the game didn't come out before last time. I think. That was back when only people, like... <clears throat> that's people who got the game, like, two to three days early. Yeah. The game came out 313. Those are the people who got the game three days early. Yeah. Which happened. Like, if you didn't know, yes. people got the game early for some reason. Yeah, there are people who got...
Again, you can put down multiple benevol. I have three down currently, so I don't know what you guys are talking about. Really? I have like three in beginning levels of the game, but I never put down any extra ones. Hmm. I don't know then. I know. Yes, you can only put one down per mission. Really? In I thought you one could... area. I thought you could only put one down. No. In one you can freaking. Put... No, nope, as long as it's a different mission. What? Yeah, no wonder you, no wonder people think that I'm like, I have way too much glory because that's how I'm. That's probably how I'm leading you in glory, because we've both been playing the same amount of time since the reset, but I have been regularly collecting my stuff from my benevolent graves. Wow. Well, Which is like ten to twenty thousand on a regular basis. So. Well, I need to go put some benevolent grades down. Some random ass spots. Yeah, just load into a mission, put a blue guy down, and then load out of the mission. <laughs> yeah, I'm a. Yep. I have seven hundred thirty cups. Although, don't go into a mission and put it down at the beginning. Try and at least run somewhere <clears throat> into the mission. Where it because seems a little bit difficult. Find, yeah, you'll find that you'll actually have stuff way summoned way more regularly if you put it in an inconspicuous, not inconspicuous, but in an area where everyone else, because everyone sticks them by shrunk and stuff like that. But if you stick it in front of like a hard enemy or a hard area, I find that a lot of people who are playing by themselves will summon that thing, especially if you're good and you're wearing like full purples or full divines. So when they see your character thing, they're like, oh, jeez. Yeah. Again, if you stick down benevolent graves in regular spots. Oh yeah, I just realized. Yeah. Yeah. You are you putting down benevolent graves? Just a couple, right? Imagine yeah, the people who put one in every take... freaking mission. Yeah. I don't know, maybe he just now started getting like free I time. You, the most of them probably did Most of them probably did save edit it. Like that's why I don't even look at the leaderboards. It might be. I don't know. It could also be legit. I don't know. It's possible. But I know millions aren't far off. I could get millions in Neo one. <laughs> No, 100 million, yeah, for sure. But, like, 16 million, I think, like, if you were just farming revenants for a day straight and, like, literally wouldn't do anything else just to get rank 1. You, you have to remember when the crew... When the crew 2 came out, it had an icon system. And people got to Icon 9999 within two weeks of the game coming out. And they did that without save editing. Just abusing glitches to get stuff really high. So, even if the person didn't save edit, he probably abused a glitch. Could have probably just used glory on every freaking piece of his armor or something, if that's even a yeah, thing. Yeah, because you can also donate stuff to them. To get more yeah. glory. You Whatever can revenants you armor. killed, you'd literally donate all the stuff yeah. that you get. And certain clans give you bonus glory. Yeah. Possibly. Yeah, you just... You, you donate all your stuff, which raises your glory. You then reload your save from the save that had the stuff back on it. And you just keep... Chucking it in because that's done on the online side, so it just keeps racking it up even though your character's glory doesn't technically increase. Like your glory amount that your character has stays the same, but the glory on the server goes up by the amount that you sell to them every single time. Oh, you can only you place can... three down. Only three? Yeah. 
Oh, then, yeah. Then that guy definitely glitch, glitch abused. Okay, you're gonna place three down? I didn't know if you could place multiple down, because I had only placed three down, and I just assumed, like, oh, they must have removed the limit or something. Oh, yeah, you can only but place three. But then again, in the trial, there were only, like, three missions, so... You couldn't ever know if there was more than that. There was in the beta, though. Or four missions. Yeah, but one of them was a 1v1 with no summon or anything. Uh -huh. It was with Mida. I hate how they took that fight out of him and put him in this like weird-ass spot. No, you can still fight him normally. In that area? No, you cannot. Oh, no, not in that area. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I kind of wish he was there. Because that place was, like, a lot more open and felt more of, like, where he would actually fight. Versus this, like, weird-ass bridge that he has now. Where he can't just go from one side to the other swinging his freaking thing. The spear. Yeah, but that's better. Uh, I like fighting him on the bridge better than the circle, because the circle, half of the reason fighting him in the circle was hard is because it was a circle. It's like Tachibana. You give that a little bit more space so the tiger sprint doesn't close the entire gap of the circle, and then it's not as big of a deal anymore. Yeah. Damn, it's kind of weird not having all these bosses from Neo 1 in the freaking game. Why do you keep saying that? I don't know, because I, I just miss fighting them. It's an, it's Neo 2. I know, but I was just expecting some of these, like, some bosses to come back. What did you want, Tachibana? Yeah, just, like, staple bosses that are just, yeah, like Tachibana. There are no staples. The first game was the first game. I know, but you know what I mean. Whatever. You can't call... I mean, Honda's back, but they had to change everything because of the element system. So it's like, anything that did wind damage, it's like the Tengu. They had to change it to physical. Yeah, but like... <clears throat> freaking that guy did lightning, or whatever. No, he did wind! What? Tachibana... The Tengu's... Tachibana, oh, yeah. no. Tachibana does lightning. Yeah, yeah, with R Raiken and everything, but Raiken isn't in this game, even though his set is in this game. They had to change the stats, because in fucking Neo 1, it gives you attack and defense Raiken. Oh, what does it give it now, like, sword or something? It doesn't even have an attack and defense thing. I don't think. Kind of weird, though, how so many people got to play it, like, three days early. Oh, yeah, here's here's the Warrior of the West set now. So, the the sword is not called Naya Konimitsu or whatever it was called before. It's called yep. Wave Swimmer. <laughs> this is it still Wave immune with Swimmer. water? So, yeah, Warrior of the West bow... And then the helmet and all the other stuff. And then the, the set bonuses are life plus 100, tiger sprint damage 20%, mm -hmm. melee damage plus 4%, uh, melee what's that one? Melee damage versus it's, electrified enemy. It's scrolling, but it's so slow. Melee damage versus electrified enemy. Active skill key consumption, negative 10%. And then uh, plus 7% melee damage... Uh, no backstab bonus. I don't so understand you... what's the even point of going for more than five pieces, to be honest. Well, w what's the funny thing about the seven-piece Tachibana set is you get 7% increased damage for not being able to backstab enemies anymore. Exactly, that's Like, you ass. don't deal double damage anymore. Exactly, that's and it's just ass. like, why would you ever fucking want that? And there's no reason, I mean, active skill consumption, I guess, and but like, it's not worth- the more fucked up part is that he can actually hit you from behind in Neo 2 and crit you. <laughs> he can hit you from behind and knock you on the ground in Neo 1. <laughs> if you don't dodge the draw strike. That you can't. 
I can't. I just dodge away from it and oh, hope yeah, that's I why space I it. Literally, to be honest, after the two piece, everything else is just optional. Optional? Yeah. You mean the three piece? Because the tiger sprint is a three piece, not a two. No, but why would you want tiger sprint? Like, what's? <laughs> I mean, that's what. I don't know, just a skill damage to a skill that doesn't do a lot of damage, so it actually does damage, so you want to use it. Mm. Yeah. I mean, be honest with yourself, what else are you going to use anyways? EI Quick Draw, you already know it's good. That's the whole reason why you're using the fucking Tiger Sprint in the first place, because it bad. And you just <laughs> like using bad stuff, because it bad. Not because it's bad. You... You, you you adopted my characteristic of playing a game where I use stuff regardless of if it's bad, but I don't use it just because it's bad. I just mix it into the good stuff. That's what I do. You you don't though. I see you in low stance all the time and you just you you are the type of person who becomes the vicious cycle of gameplay. Where it's like you'll start doing one thing and then that one thing encompasses like 50 to 60 percent of your entire gameplay style <laughs> it's like if you watched yourself play two days ago versus how you're playing now you'd be like what the fuck that's because i was going try hard two days ago trying to like actually beat the game and i'm just like chilling doing whatever the fuck not even that's trying what to you sweat. should always be doing but i know but like i was playing on expedition mode. hard expedition <laughs> mode yeah exactly <laughs> Fucking goober mesh. <laughs> I couldn't play the game the fun way because I was too busy playing the game the try hard way. <laughs> Such a first world. That is like, that's not even a first world problem. That is like, that is a fucking minus. A that zero is a world. Point one word. A, a zero point one world problem. Uh, I couldn't I couldn't have fun playing a video game because I was playing in the hard mode of the video game but in reality it was actually much easier but I didn't want to do the easy mode because I wanted to beat it on the hard mode so that I could say that I beat it on the hard mode and it's like you need a paragraph to explain the reasoning inside your brain yeah beat it because it's hard beat it because it's hard but I couldn't have fun no, I did have fun. No, you didn't. Sometimes. No, I you did usually. You were just sitting there. I did usually. You were just sitting there. The only time... The only time I didn't have fun, whatever. coming out of your ears. That was only for one boss fight. Even though you didn't have the audio on, you could feel the steam coming out of your ears. <laughs> it was just one boss fight that I didn't find fair. <laughs> I mean, it, I, if you, literally what you told me was just, like, astonishing to my brain, because, uh, like, they amped that shit up to 2 million on freaking Expedition mode. Yeah. Why, did you actually watch it, what it's like when you're playing by yourself? No, just what you told me, like, the fact that those guys die and, like, even just one hit of, like, a high stance combo is just yeah crazy to me. Like, those things did not, no. <laughs> Well, that's why I was surprised when you were like, oh, I'm going to... That's why when I got to that boss, I'm like, I know in Expedition, they're going to summon ads when he does that, a summon ability. Yeah. And it was like, yep. Mm -hmm. They were throwing freaking the little shotgun guys. What are they called? Aberrant soldiers or whatever? Yeah, <laughs> the fucking cannon bros. Yeah. And like, I think cannon skeletons. Arm. Skeleton archers skeletons. or something. And then, uh, the... No, there's no, there's nothing else, I think. On the way of the strong version of it, I think it's a cannon yoki. Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> One of the blue cannon yokis. <laughs> Shit is so, so fucking, like... Insane. Also, I hate this mission, man. With yeah, passion. sorry, I went out for a cigarette real quick. This is one of the missions that I'm just like, uh... What mission is it? It's the one that's like the after you kill Torch Tochido. Oh, you mean the the cherry blossom viewing in Daigo? Uh, no, that's that the one after. Mission? No, that's the one after. 
Mm. This one's uh some other shit. I forgot what it's called. You can press the options button and see, or not oh, the right. options button, but you know the, the high spirited demon. Yeah, oh, this yeah. fucking shit sucks. Major ass, man. Because it's all yokai enemies that are like beefy as fuck. Well, again, he played in expedition mode. Still though, that like every enemy is gonna be yokai. Oh well, yeah. Gonna be but a, like some even nasty worse boys. For you, man. Like it's it's not that bad solo. The part that I was having bad solo is I think isn't this a map where you can fall off of it in several stupid a areas? Yeah. There's like That's the like tiny, every almost map, invisible though. gaps. Well, mm -hmm. yeah, but they don't have tiny little, like, almost invisible gaps that you can fall into. Yeah. There's a lot of those, actually. There's, like, a couple pools of water that are just randomly put just to fuck you up. Yeah. The only thing cool it's about this map is I think this is one of the best-looking maps. Yep. In terms the music is of... cool too. Feels like something from oh, yeah. JoJo. It feels like, uh, from those old Japanese action animes like Cowboy Bebop. It feels like music from those kinds of shows actually. Yeah. Because they always kind of mixed like the this because this music isn't orchestrated like it is in Bloodborne. This music's all done via synth and MIDI. It's all artificial instrument, basically. It's not real instrument. Although the composer is great. But it's all fake instrument. That's why it all sounds so consistent. That's one of the things about Bloodborne's soundtrack that I've always loved, is that that music was, like, handcrafted, and you can hear, like, not necessarily the imperfections, but you can hear how the instruments don't blend together perfectly because they're not put through a fucking sound effects board or whatever. One second, though. Someone just called in. Yeah. Oh, shit, I didn't even realize that he wasn't playing with us. Yeah. Muyamu, or whatever her name is. Oh, jeez. I can't. I can't do it as well as he does. Oh, that hurt. Oof. Yeah, that's it. It's just <laughs> ridiculous. I used to scuff for Neo, man. Fuck. I hate those fucking people that just scuff this, scuff that. And you can pretty much set controls, the uh, custom controls on most games nowadays. Oh my god. Oh, do you have a scuff? Oh my god. Whatever that's just... Oh my god. What is the difference between a custom controller and a scuff? Or is it or are they the same thing? Like what is a scuff? Oh, okay. Oh, so one of them is a little bit up. Oh, that's disgusting. I mean, like, I, I can see people playing like that. 
No, yeah. Yeah. So this is like you tell them what you want personally. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. You. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, I, I play the same way. I just have my con control set custom. Yeah, I have my... Uh, it's all thanks to the other goober. No, he has his control set up the... the real shooter way, which is to have L1 as a jump button. Yes. Yeah, bumper jumper, the old Halo method. Yeah. Well, that's the old Halo method, because... Uh, yeah, yeah, but Destiny is made by, like, whatever the goobers are called. I, I know, I know. I'm just saying that, like, the originator of Bumper Jumper came from Halo. And specifically Halo 1 and 2. They had, I believe, R1 was the jump button, not even L1. Or something like that. I can understand what you're saying, but I'm just so used to it. I, in a shooter environment, if I put it on any button other than L1 now, I can't on muscle memory. Because in Borderlands and everything like that, I change it to bumper jumper and stuff like that as well. Uh, my Apex control set like that as well. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I have it so fucked up that I had my crouch on R1 for like. On Apex, so it's so weird coming back to so many different Why? shooters. Why? What's the right stick press? Dude? The right stick? Uh, that's melee, but you don't need a melee while jumping. So it's yeah, more comfortable to put... the bunny bunny hop like, like that with R1 and L1. So it's even more optimal for me. There's a lot of bunny hopping while healing in Apex. You use melee to do that? I use R1, yeah. L1, R1, shift, shifted back and forth. <laughs> but, um... My controllers are all broken on the right stick now, so I deleted all the shooter games that I have, because I can't play them anymore. Which sucks. <laughs> nah, all controllers drift. All controllers, Stuff controllers are actually really durable, though. They're made out of different materials. The only thing they use is the normal PS4 logic boards because PlayStation requires them to do that in order to make third-party products. So oh, the okay. internals of a scuff controller are, like, identical to a normal PS4 controller. There's no, like, added garbage onto it mm. except for the stuff where the paddles work but that's not that's just it's just wired into the same shit on the motherboard for the controller that the normal buttons would be so oh, okay <laughs> yeah 
That's why you can bind them to anything as well. Hmm. Yeah. yeah, and the scuff controllers are a lot easier to take apart than normal PS4 controllers. <laughs> mm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, yeah. Yeah. I don't play yeah, many fighters, but them yeah. Them holes. Yeah. Hmm. It probably is easier, but I already muscle memoried L1, so. Well, yeah, but you can just use it for different buttons that aren't L1. Yeah. Buttons that would be on the face button, like grenade, you could put on a bu on a thing or something like that, so you can aim and grenade, or wow. whatever. Yeah. It takes it to the even next level if you're really that. <laughs> yeah, that's what people would do when they played For Honor, to guard break. You'd put it on, a, you'd use a scuff controller and then put it on a, a paddle. Wow. I guess they're not a waste. Waste of money. They're not even that much. Hmm. Nah, I don't even. Nah, I don't. I don't. I don't even treat my regular controllers like that. <laughs> he's just. He's just rough when it comes to the actual usage part. Yeah. And, like I said, they're way easier to take apart to clean out the mechanisms that cause the things to even start to drift in the first place. Oh yeah, you don't have to do it right now, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's a Godama right there, what the hell? You have to get him from the other side, though. You have to go through here. Hmm. Nice. He's just walking, freaking around, not even helping. What a goober. Yeah, Mumio's garbage. <laughs> Is that what her name is actually meant to be said like? Mumyo? Mumyo. Is that how they say it in English? No, that's how they say it in Japanese. Oh. Oh, it's over here. Mumyo. Oh, shit. There's kind of like a silent syllable in between it, though, but that's just kind of how you say Japanese words. It's Mumyo. Mm. Shit. Yeah. Where? Did you kick this down? Oh yeah, you did. Yeah, it's already kicked down. Mumbio. <laughs> That's so weird. Mumbio. Yeah, what? Mumbio. How, how would you say it? Oh, I called her like Mumio or some shit. I don't even remember. I have Mumio? to see the letters. No, I have to see the letters. I don't know how it's actually spelled. It's a like how Omnio Magic is pronounced with the O and the the sorry the N and the M reversed. It's not Omnio. It's, it's not Omnio. Not not Omnio. Omnio. I don't know. I have to see her name to be honest. Mumio. O M N. Mumio, Mumio is spelled M U M Y O. Mumio. So it'd be Munyo. No M U M. Oh Mum. Mumyo. Yes, Mumyo. <laughs> you 
you put like <laughs> less e emphasis on the U and more mm. of like a hard sound, so it's mum yo. Mum yo. Mum. If you're gonna say omnio, it's a hard O M Omnia. sound followed by N Y O. Um. Mum. Um. Yo. Mum yo. Mum yo. Mum yo. Mum magic. Mum yo. Yeah. Omnio is normally the one people get confused. Her name's easy to pronounce. Mumyo. Stop. Stop saying Mumyo. Stay, say Omnio. Omnio. I know I do have an accent. Uh, no, everyone has oh, an accent. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. shit. No! Ah, it's alright. It's a side boss, we can still go Oh, back. you just fucking skipped the freaking cutscene of Mumyo getting destroyed? Yeah, Mumyo gets fucking pile-drived off the bridge into the water. You don't see her ever since. Yeah, she yep. literally dies. No, she doesn't die. <laughs> God damn it, I wanted to, like... I wanted to make him think about skipping the cutscene. Did you get his skill? <coughs> I killed that dude like seven times already. I Here. haven't gotten one skill. Wait. Yeah, we can go back. Mumyo. Stop saying it. I Every can't. Now you got it stuck it in my head. And more fucked up. Mumyo. <laughs> say mum. 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 Mum? Mum? I can't. A little bit more I can't. Mum? Mum. Mum? I can't! Go ma. Go ma. A mum, yo. There you go. Mum. No, I can't. Mum, yo. You just did it. Mum, yo. Ew. That sounds dirty. Go. That doesn't sound like me. Mum, yo. Yeah, but that's, that's how you say it in Japanese. <laughs> mum, yo. Mumio. No, now, now you're just, now uh, you're just being weird about it. Good, 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 yeah. <laughs> trash. Put mm -hmm. it in a trash can. Oh, you can't even tiger sprint. You can, but not if your weapon's already drawn. You can. No, if your weapon's drawn, but you're not in a sheathing animation. If you if you have your weapon just out normally, like just like me right now, and then you try to do it, it'll glitch out. Normally. Wait, what? Oh shit. I don't know. Yeah, we already, we already got, got that, that one. one. This is just a loop around. This what the hell? He just got up. stuck on that wall for like five seconds. <laughs> and I turned the wrong way because I'm a dumbo. I just turned and ran into the wall. I have more stamina. I get to be ahead even though I need to follow the cooperate summoner. Yeah, it's, I'm going to poke you, boy. You missed. Hit. Poke. Get out of here. That's that's freaking Mitotoshi's tracking. I swear, they nerfed him so bad. Seems like he no. You yeah. can do 180s with this. Yeah, but he never it, does. Do, yeah, I'm just saying that you can do. I mean, he used 180s. to be able to. He used to do 360s. <laughs> he would just be able to switch to the freaking different direction. It's just you have to dodge it at the last. I, think I it's really. It's a pretty fun move. It just takes a lot of practice to get the three timing down. Mm -hmm. It's like God of Wind, but you need two separate, perfectly timed inputs. But I'm pretty good at. It's weird because I'm bad at timing like boss attacks, but I'm good at learning timings for abilities like that. 
Mm, except for back way. Well, I mean, I guess that's enemy abilities that's that you different. have to learn. That's reacting to an enemy doing random attacks that when I'm looking at them, I just, I can't. I'm not good at doing that. Mm. But being able to reliably to... Because the way that I train my brain to do a lot of this kind of stuff is just... Rhythm? On a timing-based thing. Yeah. I guess. Because depending on when you time it, you actually get different abilities. Oh, let me see the other ones. Hold on. I, I can't... It's hard for me to do that. <laughs> That's a normal one. But this is if you stay in it. And then this is if you do it late. There's not that many variants, because it's just a couple thrust attacks. What if you There's delay no, like, the first one? Anything. What do you mean? There's like, delay the, the first... first... The, the first... Oh, the first is the like... double? No, the first is always just a single with a spin, and then every hit after is a key pulse that you have to time properly. It, like, has a little thing on the key bar, what so if you, you mistime like... the first one? You just go short. Do it. Like that. See? It's like a little baby one. Hmm. You have to get it. I'm not lucky. It takes a long time to farm. Like I said, I spent like an hour doing it. Munio. M Munio? I don't know. Whatever. There's no end, dude. I, exactly. I don't Mun know. Yo. Mun -yo. Uh, take that. <laughs> I love freaking sheathing my weapon. It's so cool. How do you pronounce Sasuke? Sasuke. Ninus Land. <laughs> Sasuke. Sasuke. Yeah. I hate this. Part of this yeah, map. this this is the area that I was talking about. Here, I'll try and be the martyr. Alright, we gotta I go back martyr. here. No, he wants the host. Oh, never <sighs> mind. He's attacking me now. I think once he locks onto you, he'll always attack you. Nope. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought you died. Block. Come on, get me. Open the door. Oh, he can't hit me right here. Oh, yeah. This makes him not aggro on you when you walk around that corner. When you come into here. <laughs> what the hell? Did you get hit by the fucking crystal yeah, explosion? Right when I was jumping down. This is a shrine. Or not a shrine, a hot spring. Now you got me fucked up, Hyro. <clears throat> I got you fucked up. You got me fucked up. <laughs> Oh, you almost got it. Oh, come get the spirit stone. There's only like two or three in the game that you can sit on the outside of. There's a one in the one mission with the weasel as the boss. 
That yep. mission, you can literally sit on the dirt outside of the fucking thing. <laughs> oh shit, this this is gonna move. I hate those enemies, man. Those little guys, they're the most annoying enemy in the game. Well, that wasn't a red kappa, that was a normal oh. one. Oh my god. The real spin the winds are the like little red kappas. Those shits are like actually disgusting. Because at Ow. least you can burst counter like this guy. But those little kappa things, you can't do anything, and they paralyze you and have like this insta grab out of paralyze. Is this bullshit? And they just spam the uh. I'm gonna kill you with this shit. Aww. Sorry. Alright. It's a bad move anyways. I'll kill- Oh wait, I'm too far away. Oh, he's- he's stroking it. <laughs> no! It almost pushed me off. I'll even break those things? That's crazy. Yeah. What, that didn't one shot? Were there any joke bosses in Neo 1? What do you mean? Like, just... Bosses like that guy? have, like, a gimmick to them, yeah. Uh, yeah, the Great Centipede. Ah, right. The centipede level was cool, but then when you get to the boss, it's he's kind of lame. It's very annoying. Yeah. I equate the centipede boss to the fucking giant thing. I actually don't think this boss is that bad. No, it's just a I gimmick. I just feel like it's out of place. Yeah, exactly. It feels like a God of War boss or something, just without quick time events when you knock him down sort of thing. Mm. It's like you feel like there should be quick time events where he like takes his arm and slams the arm into his own face or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> mm. I mean, this is, it is kind of cool, but they don't really do enough with the demon form in terms of like the finishers. They should be way cooler than they actually are. Stop Thanks. <laughs> I saved you the animation recovery. Don't you dare do it. Don't do it. Don't. <laughs> God damn it, Hyro. I had to do it for the one time. Now I know. Even though you already told me. Motherfucker. <laughs> Why don't you do the annoying long grapple that doesn't do any damage? Because it doesn't have... there's no... The character that you get it from doesn't use a spear. He uses Odachi single sword and dual swords. Oh, uh, okay. Also, what? Like, that's such a weird boss fight. What is? The bo like your brother character or whatever, sister or whatever. Yeah, that's who you have to farm to get the ability that he got, the toe stab thing. Mm. That's the same thing as the Odachi one. Like I said, there's one for the Odachi, the single sword, and the dual sword. I have all three. Lucky... Wastard. You can just look at that spreadsheet. No, yeah, I know where to get them, it's just I'm unlucky as shit. I can't even get a freaking blueprint for an item. Yeah, they're just really rare, dude. Freaking out here farming hours just to get a blueprint reminds me of BL3 when we were farming that stupid shotgun. Yeah, but Neo is more engaging. 
Yeah. I like farming bosses over and over again in Neo because I get good at taking them down. There's That's how I got there. to the point where I could do Toshi A without taking any damage. Oh, oh he's got the the Neo one axe hammer. Can't believe people still use red demon armor. Red douchebag armor, you mean? <laughs> I know, it's so freaking. Because it's so bad, it needs that clan. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Actual skill. I literally freaking. Whatever that. End of uh, square move. Air square combo move. Oh my god. I jumped over that. Did you see that? Wow. I pole vaulted over that with the freaking spear and didn't take damage. You know what? You know what? Come on, nerd. Me? Yeah, burst counter. You're supposed to be a god. I was trying to time it right, but... I what find happened that good... to my fucking god student? Uh... The master is becoming the master again. Nah. It's because it's I haven't slept in like 24 hours probably now. Why? Why are you staying I'm trying up? to fix my sleep schedule to get back into school. Oh. School is gonna start soon, and I need to be ready to. Are you trying to, to get over onto there? There is a Kodama over there, though. If you haven't gotten it yet. Yeah. There's a little yeah. goober. Oh, yeah, these the... are the worst enemies. Yeah. These are the red kappas. Two hits, and you're paralyzed. They only seem easy because, well, nope, even as a group, that shit is still, like, disgusting. You can't do anything to punish them. But yeah, if you're by yourself and that thing just focuses you, then you're, you're dead. I've died to that enemy more than I have to most bosses. Even though it's, it's probably see, it is a Hiro, basic this enemy. is what you do when you have a female character, and you want to see the DOA physics in action. You just do this. I, I did it. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Ha! Huh. I used it, but it didn't make much of a difference. Like I noticed it a little bit. Yeah. It isn't like freaking what's the code vein? I think. No. D O A. Oh, Dead or Alive. Dead or Alive is made by Team Ninja, the same company that makes this. Yeah. That's why I said they put like a early version of the physics from those games in this <coughs> game. <coughs> or like a very, like rudimentary version of the physics or whatever. Oh my god, this is what I'm talking about. These goobers just come out of nowhere and insta-grab you. He was in the bushes, dude. Exactly, and I'm hiding from the freaking rock. Like, who expects that to happen? I guess that was the point of the, the bush. The bush camper. I never expected to be masticated by a turtle trying to dodge a rock rolled by a forearm man. Did I just yep. say that sentence out loud? Also, I forgot that there was a Kodama back here. Krogan, Kro Is that the last one? Krogana? You wanna Joanna? You tried to rob a bank with a banana. Shut up.
can shoot at him from here. I don't know why. It doesn't really do anything. What? Why'd you put that there, Hyro? That was by accident. I was trying to switch to my next slot, and I have the thing as the right slot. Can you blow I... it up by shooting at it? No, I think you might have to shoot it with a gun. Nope. 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 Put a bomb on the ground. Oh, uh, no. Wait, buffs! Oh, there it goes. Yeah, <laughs> it blew up eventually. Go. Right, go. Let's go. Go, matey. I don't know. I can only do my own accent. Oi, Mike. Wow, that's the first time I've seen him start out. I don't even know if you can actually properly burst counter that stuff. Alright, the zero damage. Yeah, you just cheese him yeah. like this. That's how you also cause, like, frame rate lag out the wazoo, dude. Nope. Oh my god, all the freaking shaking is making me nauseated. Alright, gotta run up the arm. That's a freaking God of War enemy. Kinda deal. Fucking laggy. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the only way fun. I like. Go press triangle on him. All right, what? Okay. Oh, I'm moving while this happens. What the? F yeah. That's so awkward. It's not a cutscene. You can even do gestures in front of the camera and prevent me from seeing what's going on. <laughs> you can like do the jump gesture. <coughs> <laughs> I just walked up and pressed square and it activated, but normally you have to press triangle. Yeah. yeah. I pressed triangle for all the other ones. I don't know. Yeah, exactly. But I walked up and I was like, I'm just going to try and quick attack it. And it just went <laughs> and transformed me into the thing. <laughs> I was like, well, okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my No. <laughs> Full core drop rate, yokai shift. Yeah, like I'm ever gonna be in yokai shift for more than five seconds. Yeah, exactly. Yokai shift is the best thing to ever come to this game. Said no one. Ew. <coughs> what? The female revenant is like absolutely hideous. 
who is. Uh, you didn't government profile me, bro. What? All right. Oh, it's Hyro. I say it like all the time. Yeah. Yeah. Like. Yeah. J a i r o. Hi. It's gyro, technically, but nah, it isn't though. If you're saying it in English, it's gyro, but nah, he's, it's not. He's though. from South El, El Salvador, so it's Hyro. Just like jalapeno is not jalapeno. <laughs> <laughs> Disgusting. Hop on no jalapenos. <laughs> Pickles? Sorry. Extra! <laughs> <laughs> You're in the party with someone who doesn't like pickles? Ew, that's absolutely disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it. I give that a four star rating. <coughs> Hyro, if you saw how many plus one things I have right now, it's. If you saw how many plus dung. Plus dung? Plus one thing? Plus dung? But dun 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 dun. <laughs> that is <laughs> like <Griffin>. borderline. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It's That's borderline. Like. It's borderline. Borderline. I know what you mean, bruh. I know what you mean, cut. <laughs> I know what you mean, bruh. I know what you mean, cut. Sorry, what? <laughs> I was just. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> What? Oh. <laughs> Sounds like a Hispanic boy. Equipment. Mommy. It's a real way. Mommy. Jesus Christ, man. Ooh, Neo Toon Ninjutsu build melt everything with kunai. Let's click this video. Stop looking it up and it won't show up. I didn't look it up. That's the sad part. It's just, it is the community now. Fighting Cowboy? I don't know who that yep. is. Yeah, he doesn't count. Why? Because he doesn't count. Because he's using ninjutsu, it doesn't count. He isn't a player. He doesn't play Neo. Oh. Bro, I judge you for how you game every day of the week. I I don't even mind ninjutsu builds. Like the problem is ninjutsu games, your first playthrough, that's like, uh... but whatever. Like I said, spend waste your not. It's not spending at this point. Waste your money however you want. Delicious. Jeez. Tokichiro? Tokichiro. It's not Tokichiro, Hira. That's how you fucking say it. No. That's how I say it as a joke. It's Tokichiro. You should have told me. What? I did tell you it was called Toki Tokichiro earlier. Whatever. When we were having that convo about how to pronounce shit. Tokoshiro. It's Tokichiro. 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 There you go. Ooh. Ooh. It also depends on 
where you lived in Japan at the time, I guess, because, I mean, it's just like anywhere else. Some places say stuff slightly different than others. Ew, the Resident Evil 3 remake looks way worse than freaking Resident Evil 2 remake. That's because they probably tried to get away with using the same engine. <laughs> uh... No, it is the same engine. It literally looks the exact same. It's just, it looks worse. Ooh. Tokichiro. Chino? Choki. Gabi. Chicken. Cheetos. Gobby. Chicken. Cheetos. What? Partially. I mean, to some people, they would say, yeah, that's how it actually was. I mean, I would call those people insane, but the, there are those people out there that do think that. The new half Life VR game. I've been seeing that pop up a lot. Half-Life VR lot. game. I don't have a VR headset or a computer that could probably even run that game, regardless if I had a VR headset. I'm just stockpiling money right now. In real life or in the game? In the game, of course. Oh. Of course. <laughs> I mean, who, who doesn't? If you don't, you're just a freaking douche nozzle. <sighs> <laughs> Ew, what the fuck? The big titty mermaid. Oh, yeah. I forgot that that was one. Probably. Whatever. <laughs> What time is it? I'll give you a tip for setting up your Five, key utensils. Ten. Prioritize luck if you want to have a higher chance at getting stuff. Eccentricity basically doesn't matter. I don't even know what anything else does except for money drop and luck. Because those two are the only stats that I've known from Neo 1. Ow. But yeah, I still don't know what that eccentricity or utility shit does. Do you know? Is what I'm asking? Yeah, it just increases stuff. Obviously, but what does it increase? <laughs> Luck? Eccentricity and whatever the fuck it's called? That other shit? Eccentricity <coughs> is T utensil drop rate. Simplicity is money acquired, and Splendor is luck. Okay. See, that's all you had to say, man. Alright. Alright. Yeah, I didn't know that. I thought those are just different stats stacked on top of whatever was there. Because it shows both of them for some reason. And then I have a Honda Clan treasure for being in the top thing, which is applied regardless and that's a uh, Sekidera, and that gives me 310 Splendor on top of the four already. So you can place four of your own, and then the big slot in the bottom left is for the clan one. Mm. If you're wondering why you can't put one in the bottom left slot. Let's go to the hut and see that myself. T-tensils here. How do I get the hanging scrolls thing unlocked? You go to the hidden tea house and buy them. Okay. Hidden tea house. Is that in trade? 
Yes. It's 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 the last tab. Oh, I see. Yeah, I'm gonna buy all of them. <coughs> what do they even do? Jesus, there's so many of them. I love it. I'm gonna get the one that's called Neo, just because I'm that guy. There, I got them all. Nice. It took 180,000. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jeez, those are all... There we go, and I can get a trophy for free. It's not, there's no trophy for it. Love it gives you a title, Lover though. of letters. No, it does give you a trophy. It does? I didn't get a trophy for it. You gotta hang and it. I just... Oh! Goober. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> Image? There are images? Mm -hmm. Images are just the default one that you got. Yeah, but I can't put them. I can't select an image. That's just the default one. If you click oh. image, it is the image. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now, I, I get it. Yeah. I wish there were different images, though. <laughs> nope. And you can just. It's just text, dude. Yeah, I know. It's so lame. And you just bought all of them for no reason. <laughs> Fucking <laughs> well, goober. You should have bought the other everything. shit. I bought all of them. I have all the transformations, all the gestures, everything. Uh, I have okay. everything that you can buy. Hmm. Does that give you, like, a title? Or... I know it said you got a title, but does having yeah. everything give you a title? Oh, it does. Yes. I'm still missing transformation. a lot of transformations. I'll get the Maria one since it's expensive. All the transformations that are left for me to buy suck ass. Why, why do I need another William one? Like, that doesn't even make sense. I'll buy this. Here, I'm gonna put the one for sound health. To be in perfect health, completely free of any ailment. Yeah! Wow. In these nice. trying times. <laughs> and then I have my little scampus. I'm gonna Whoa, transform into this. someone hideous. Your mother? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where do you <I'm> live? <laughs> I will pull up. <laughs> and I'll pull up deep. I, I just love that that was the first thing that you said. Where do you live? <laughs> like, bro, where are you living? Or are you living, cut? I want to peep, peep. Let me peep that address, cut. I got the horses in the back, AK-47 in the front. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you're dead. You know what? I'll See just you. nuke all of New Hampshire. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Press the big red button. He's currently sitting next to the big red button, and he's like super sweating, and he's like... <laughs> Don't make me, don't make me do it. <laughs> uh, uh, did you set up uh, another one? I'm making myself some toast with some butter on it. <clears throat> I don't use none of that margarine around here. That's for city folk. Oh, that margarine butter bullshit? Yeah, do you use margarine? Yeah. You 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 like margarine? I don't like it. Margin do boo? I use it? Yes. You like margin boo? Oh, of course not. He's my favorite character too. Oh, of course not. Of course, yes. Is that I'm I'm sorry, I'm only hearing hat. Of course. Oh, thanks for fucking spoiling YouTube. I appreciate it. What? Spoiling what? Oh, what the max level is? It's 300. Wow, thanks. What, you didn't know? No. Well, yeah, I'm gonna look it up. Be what, 
it was going to be what Neo 1 was supposed to be, but when Neo 1 came out, it was 750, and then the first DLC nerfed it back down to like 400 or 450, then it, they increased it, then they increased it again, and then they let you be 750 again. Hmm. I think that's what they're going to do this time around as well. Because honestly, that system was better. <laughs> Just being able to get to 750 off the beginning only encouraged people who abuse the fuck out of systems. Mm, damn, read the farms, like... I'm okay. going the fastest way to farm to level 300! There's already like, videos like that on exactly. YouTube. Exactly. Two days ago, somebody posted that shit. That's literally the video that got recommended to me. I was like, ah... I watched one freaking Neo video from one goober that did some bullshit. Then YouTube bailed. And now I have, like... I didn't even watch it. I, like, clicked on it just to click on it. You gave him a click, dude. You can't... You can't... You, that's... <laughs> You, you know what? I'll dislike it right now. You're right. Not a slime. I don't even think dislikes do anything. They don't, really. Unless it's like more than half the video or something. Yeah. People will be more inclined to dislike it. Yeah. And it just gets bombarded. Gets a bum like barded. You get the herd mentality. Yeah. If he did, I'll do We're... it too, because it makes sense. Right? I don't like this because someone else doesn't like this. I heard from this one person on this podcast that this wasn't a good thing, so I don't like this. <laughs> I never bothered to see for anything myself. I heard I, I heard from Joe Rogan it was bad, so I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> Although I will give Joe Rogan credit. He's been doing a lot more actual research recently, and he's no longer a person who thinks that the moon landing was entirely a hoax because mm. it wasn't just the pictures and the photos and the videos most of those were faked oh, okay but did people actually go to the moon yes you would have to argue with the 700 scientists that got the people there in the first place <laughs> <laughs> like it's not like, it's one thing for a video to be fake, but the actual process of doing it was not. And sure, there probably is real footage, but I doubt the government actually let any real footage ever slip outside of, like, very specific things. Which were always muddied and watery down, even for the time. Those little cool, like, Things that you can find on the map, the little red glowies are cool, but like I can never find find them most of the time. Look for specific. I just like loop the the blue circle in a circle until well, I hit I'm something. Saying on the map, you can see that there are like little buildings. Yeah. Or, like specific. But sometimes it's in like a random ass spot. Too. Well, and then it'll be on, like, the top of a mountain or whatever. Yeah, exactly. Or at the in-between of a road, but it's always because that's a real place. Mm. Kind of cool how they did the map. It looks looks nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's nicer moves. than Neo 1. So weird to do this. Goddamn. I like how the Neo 2 experience brutal combat in an action RPG like ad literally like spoils a bunch of shit. Like it, the thumbnail is like a boss. Mm-hmm. Neo 2, available now. Please People don't like games to be mysteries anymore. They want to know the entire game before they've even played it. Oh, of course. What's the best way? I like my experiences, yet I actually don't, because I don't actually play them for experiences. Experiences? Because I'm playing it because someone else did. They say they enjoyed it, because someone else did. I mean, that's not a... 
Um, That's the way, like, Red Dead Redemption 2 works. Like, everyone says the game is good and whatever, but it's really just boring bullshit over and over again. And it's only, like, fun a couple of times. <laughs> when you're actually, Some like... Some really like that. Yeah. And then those people, like, other people just, uh, hop on the wave of them <laughs> saying that. That's what I'm saying. Uh, I would yeah, but join. that's not entirely bad. But I will give it to you if they don't. If they didn't play it for more than sixty hours, I think they're full of shit. Mm. Nah, the game's super fucking long. Even just doing the base stuff. I mean, that like literally nobody's playing Red Dead Redemption Two online anymore just because it's fucking ass. Well, yeah, they don't update it like they did with Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, they still update GTA Online, which is weird. Something. Yeah, they're just making shit at this point. Like, there's flying cars and shit, flying motorcycles. Yeah, I don't even know anymore. I don't even know anymore. We got freaking nuclear strikes or some bullshit. I don't even know. It is like anything that they could think of, they just added that to the game. I wonder what GTA 6 Online is going to be like. It's going to be a fuck fest. <clears throat> I really like the GTA story though. It's funny a lot of the time. There's a lot to do too. Are you in another mission yet? Oh yeah, I was gonna soul match some of my Eureki stuff and re... Re whatever it... Sell some of the divines you've been getting to, so that you can make new divine stuff for the different slots. Mm -hmm. Remember that you can do that. Because I know that you didn't know. <laughs> no, yeah, I just, so just I sell some earlier. of it and disassemble some of it. I disassemble all the greens until I have like at least a couple hundred divine fragments. Mm. No, but yeah, I crafted all the Gariki stuff. I mean, I just need to temper it and soul match it. Is it not green? No, yeah, that's what I said. Oh, it's all you green, have but. All green. But yeah. all the plus three Eureki purple stuff is just better because it's it's higher level and I scaled it with weight or whatever the thing called. When so did it, you change from your high stamina setup to that setup? Uh, I just been using that ever since I switched mid mid uh, way of the dream, like around 120. When items started hitting 120, just because like the level 60 obsidian shit was just not cutting it out anymore. Even though the set was good, it's just it was under leveled, and I didn't want to level it up because it cost like so much gold. And ever since then, I just have been using the Guriki stuff just because it's it's high toughness, easy to craft, easy to craft, yeah, medium weight. Mm-hmm. Not actually that heavy. There's actually medium armors heavier at the than end it? game. Yeah, that are heavier, like War of <laughs> the West and stuff like that. Is heavier than Eureki. It's crazy. Oh yeah, it's not even. What do you think I was using it? Because I already like knew the second that set was there. I was just like, "Yep, yeah, that's that's absolutely broken for the point in the game that it is." The Eureki should have been like a. Yeah, it should have been like a NG plus only set, so at, by that point the effect wouldn't be that good. Hmm. 
Because it's way stronger than even the Hotaru Maru. What's that? The Firefly Blade, which has life recover or auto life recovery and Rita absorption. There we go. Now the Yuriki stuff is starting to get better than the. Uh... It's an Odachi. You might have the smithing text for it. Hmm. It's another thing that's good if you want to go for regen. Oh, the moonlets. Wait, is that the one? Mm -mm. I think I have another one. That's also really good for regen. No, the one I'm talking about has uh, Emrita absorption effect on it by default. It's called oh, the Firefly okay. Blade. In Neo 1, it was called Hotaru Maru, but... Hmm. Oh, no, I didn't. But yeah, I'll, I'll finish doing this and then I'll do it up. Wow. Uh. What the fuck? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Dirty Ray. Sorry, what what were you saying? What the fuck about? Oh, I don't even remember, to be honest. <laughs> what did I... Yeah, I don't remember. Was it about a stat? I don't... I don't remember. <laughs> Were you forging something or re-rolling something? Uh, I think so. I don't remember, to be honest. Starting to hit the poopy brain territory. I played a lot of Apex though. I used to anyways, but that that broke my the last good controller I had and now I don't have anything to play Apex with. Oh, the left and right stick. Both had drift on them and I couldn't sprint anymore and I couldn't look to like without having drag unless I set it to like large large dead zones and then then I had no accuracy, so it was like, whatever. <clears throat> mm. Which one? Nah. I don't know. Yeah. What's the difference between having it lower and higher? Like, just the arc of travel. A low stick, you're moving it less. See how? Far, whereas a tall stick, you're moving it further around. So you have more control with a tall stick, or you're like. Yeah. Okay, so your right finger would have a tall stick. Hmm. Mm. 
Mm. What is that? Is it linear or which one is? Linear is like raw input, right? Yes. Mm. Linear is zero to one or zero to ten. Mm. Think of like crew two car handling. You can press a little bit. But full linear is just a zero and a one, whereas non-linear would be zero to ten, but having variable in it. Mm. No, yeah, I, I'm re... Oh wait, why the fuck am I editing this one? Oh, so you already watched the full game, or...? Okay. I hate that fucking mission, oh my god. Hmm. No, oh, that that mission is ridiculous. Oh shit, I completely forgot he was in the party, that scared me. Why would you think it was? Nah, I just... I didn't know that he was still in here. The hell, why do I have running speed? What? Where you go? Yeah, he doesn't have a ranged weapon. He's probably one of those people who learned how to play from the guy that I showed Hyro. Kage? Using... No, the fucking Dan Giesling guy. Oh. The idiot who calls everything resin. <laughs> like, you can't use the bow, it's resin, because it kills stuff. <laughs> yeah. Imagine that you're playing a game and it kills things. So it's considered overpowered. So no, no everything resin. is considered overpowered. It's resin, dude. Can't use that. Yeah. He calls exactly. them resin because of gold pine resin in Dark Souls 1. Yeah, but it's a mechanic in a game that people call an overpowered game. Or a hard game. 
and then you put the stuff in that makes it easy and everyone's like don't use the stuff that makes your game easy though and it's like then is it actually a hard game no exactly just talking it up yeah I, I hate that. It's just like the people who are like, don't level up. You should be you should be forced to stop leveling up at soul level 120 and know exactly how you're going to build your character before you even play the game a single time. <laughs> what? You didn't game theory the game before you even played it? You didn't look up all the Vati Vidya videos on the lore? The fuck is... Oh, right. <clears throat> that guy. That guy's like, whatever, but like, I don't even know. People are just weird with Souls games. Like, they're cool and all. They're all right games, but like, you over... Overhyped them, to be honest. People do. I don't know. People are weird. Well, it's not even just that. It's like... Let's say you were a popular person on YouTube. You never played Dark Souls before. You start playing Dark Souls, and you... And you over-level your character. If you so much as mention the word farming to level up, every fucking Dark Souls White Knight's gonna be in the comment section, You're over-leveled for this boss, that's why you killed it easily, ha <laughs> ha this boss is supposed to be much harder if you take 30 seconds. <gasps> I fucking hate it. It's like, it's an RPG, idiot. They can do whatever the fuck they want. That's the whole point of an RPG. Go play fucking Sekiro. Now, I'm glad that Sekiro exists because now I can tell people, go play fucking Sekiro if you don't want an RPG. Fucking loser. <laughs> yeah, he blends in. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just complete fucking retarded people. <laughs> Yeah, I swear, like, one of the things that I I hate the most about anything to do with this game being viewed from people that are in the Souls community is just the sheer amount of people who just refuse to treat the game like it has uniqueness to it. And people who are just like, it's... It's one thing to tell someone, yeah, you can beat the game without key pulsing. It's another thing to be a confirmation bias where you're like, yeah, key pulsing is fucking useless. Why would you ever key pulse sort of shit? <laughs> and it's just like, no, you're just an idiot and bad at the game. And that's why it takes you five minutes to kill a boss you can kill in a minute and a half without even needing fucking way of the strong shit. Me and Hyro, I think, both killed the fucking elephant guy first try and got the kill in under 60 seconds title for it. I the did guy it before, that he's actually uh, dressing up as. Yeah. I got that thing by myself, just fucking fighting him regularly. This is yeah. so easy. Hmm. He's... He's a Every human enemy in this game is a joke. You can unless you, you have a brute. Ask. Yeah, you have to be brute. Yeah, even Feral can't counter it. Phantom and Feral that. can't counter it, only brute. God damn it. I thought he did I thought he was gonna throw me in the water. Oh what the fuck? It's like you had two people underneath you, and he goes for the one fucker that's standing 20 feet away. Oh my god, dude, this guy is so hideous. 
Yeah, why'd you pick black teeth, dude? Because I was like, I want to look disgusting. But I didn't expect it to be this disgusting. <laughs> Got the Aqua Bay of Black Grills. Made out of straight charcoal. Don't jump down there. Oh, I hate this this fucking mission, man. Yeah, there's a shortcut. Yeah. Yeah. Hate looking at that that character. Yeah, Sam. This shit is fucking hideous. I'm gonna change it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. I pushed you out of the fucking way. <laughs> Oh, don't go there. Right, wrong side. <laughs> yeah. It's so trippy looking down there and just seeing that shit. At first I thought it was a reflection, but then I realized... It... Yeah, no, it's the building upside down. Yeah. Yeah, it's the it's the actual building upside down. It's not, it's not underwater or a reflection. It's actually the building. And you walk in those areas. Down mm. on those... But just, See, this a little area blue thing has one down of the there. most annoying Kadamas to get. Yeah. It's not a reflection. It looks really... Yeah, yeah. it's just floating. Exactly. It looks so... This map... Not only does it look disgusting, it's also disgusting to navigate. I think it looks cool. It's just terrible to navigate. I think the concept is amazing. The first time I saw it, it like... Almost gave me a headache because I couldn't... Like, my brain couldn't process... I kept- my brain was seeing it as a oh reflection. My, God. my brain wasn't seeing it as what it was. I, I don't even know how to explain how my brain was seeing it. Oh, I forget I have arrow boys now. Oh my God. But yeah, let's get this before we do anything else, just because this Kodam is annoying. Wow. Nice. Of course oh, it would shit. be me. Don't fall. I hate that there's like the black cloud right on top of the hole. Because <laughs> it kind of like conceals it. Not because it actually <laughs> conceals the hole, but because your eyes get fixated on the black cloud. Mm, they just ignore the hole. Below. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, this whole map is like weird. Mm -hmm. Just wait until you have to like <coughs> until we get into the lower levels, and it's just like a brain fuck of how to get to the next spot. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I've got most of this map down, now, so it's gonna be too hard to figure out where to go. Yeah, I ran through the Twilight mission earlier today. So I'm, I kind of remember a little bit. What's funny is the map is still really low frame rate, and I don't know why. If you've ever had enemy sensor or anything on your gear, and you watch enemies move around, it's like... Yeah, same thing with just freaking uh, NPCs, too. Yep. Yeah. I was gonna say, don't don't do anything funny there, kiddo. You're the one in the way, old man. Hey, hey! <laughs> Motherfucker, don't do that. Trigger. Don't, me off. don't push me off either. I'm scratching my head. Stop. I didn't. I didn't. Sure. I got. I. I was. I was close. But I, let me stand on the very tippy edge and see what happens. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh my god. I was hoping that was gonna be the Cory <laughs> you're just gonna fall. Just the one little boom. Oh shit. Well What? <laughs> you didn't know this was down here? That's no, why I was no, risking you it. Fall down there. You have to go down there anyways. Mm. <laughs> oh I need help. I don't have no I'll just run past these guys. There we go, she won't chase me over here. Hello. I hate that enemy. <laughs> oh shit. Sheet. Run away from this line. Oh, I missed. Nice throw. Thanks. You got him. He's gonna burn slowly, but surely. Why did he attack you? I'm sitting here like... With a bow out, so you're the most vulnerable one. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. It's a little dot. Now. He's trying to pin the little Aratama. Is that what that is? Yeah, the little black things that fly around. Hmm. They're like the base form of a spirit. Before they've manifested into something. Stay right here, they're gonna come out. Oh shit, sorry. Oh my god. Run! Oh my god, you almost didn't. You, you should have pressed the sprint button a lot faster there. <laughs> Shoot it. She's so pretty. Negative. This character is absolute atrocity to the, like, Neo. Like, who designed this shit? I mean, he didn't. He wasn't designed. He existed and then was interpreted. Why did he exist? <laughs> He's fucking disgusting. Wow, that's that's mean to say about another human being. <laughs> nah, Why did you exist? Oh shit! Sorry. Oh, what's that? You want to? If I fall on that ledge, there's no way oh, to get back up. Yo, I just. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, you did? I screamed in real life. Like I actually like jumped. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's so scary. Holy shit! I actually jumped. <laughs> Watching me do goober shit and not even play the game. That's when I get the most viewers. So as soon as I start doing combat and they see me play the freaking game, oh, I just map. go. No, there's a Kodama up there. Don't drop down. Walk I'm best player. This corner. Yeah, oh, there you shit, go. I thought you were mm -hmm. lagging. And then you can jump down here. Once you get that Kodama, Kodama Rama. Nice try, but she was ahead. She was forty thousand steps ahead of you. Yeah, I know. You spear on those. Oh, the vomit comet. I press. I mean, you literally heard it on stream. I literally pressed the burst counter, but it did not work. Oh, it's because I have this one now. I forgot. I don't know why I'm using that one. Oh, Feral? Yeah, f Brute. I should oh. be using Phantom. I don't know why I switched. Hello? Are you there? I think his controller died. Oh, huh? no. no. I guess his mic is muted. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Slurp it real good. Damn, brother. Look out. Oh my god, you can make that? For yeah, fast I enough? told you, it's like Super Mario. Yeah. Oh, look, the guy's falling down after you, because he's a 
Why did you fall down there, by the way, Genghis? Because you have to come down here. No, you don't. Much. Or you can go to the other side, I mean. You want to come to this side first and kill everything. Well, enjoy that down there. I'm sure you can deal with it. Oh, yeah, no, this is light. Whoa! <laughs> this is... This is treachery on another... Oh, I got a golden gourd gauntlet. Or gauntlets. And they're plus one. Nice. Be able to soul there match that. The Yuriki stuff I have. <laughs> what kind of ice cream was it? <laughs> oh, you yeah, should have seen jump. what I did. I did I pretty freaking... much the same exact thing you just did. <laughs> uh, Except I did it with that spear lunge thing where you can jump in a direction after you key pulse. Yeah. And I key pulsed right onto the very tippy edge. <laughs> I wonder I if like could... the low part. Oh my god. Why are you well why 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 you do those? So scary. Why do you do such a thing? Open the chest. I'm gonna push you off. Get back. Nope. 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 Well I got something for you. Stop. Let me get the emote out. There you go. You're not pushing me. Oh, almost. Oh. Oh, you can block that. Oh, whatever. Nope. Goodbye. Whatever. You need to come down here, anyways. <laughs> yeah. Knock you off the ladder. I don't care. Here. Get over here, boy. We need to jump down. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Shut up, nerd. <laughs> cool. What the hell? You were in the ground for me. I am immune to your nonsense. Oh. Gotcha. <laughs> I wanted to double him when he came up, but I turned my character too far. No. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 there he goes. Oh, no! <laughs> yep, never mind. <laughs> I hate how they made this. Ooh, oh, boss. How they made this so freaking. Oh, jeez. So hard to maneuver. <laughs> oh, I gotta go this time? Wow. Yeah, I got him. <laughs> Damn nope. it. Oh! Oh! Ah! I almost got Spot him. dodged. Oh, I thought he was gonna move. Are you almost. Fucking. <laughs> 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 gotcha. See, I told you the trick is. Oh! To gotcha. No, I got Watch. you. I got you. What? That doesn't count. I could just block the whole time then. <laughs> exactly. Okay. I reinvented the game. And now I don't play that game. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I used to touch me, no touchbacks, head ass. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking whatever that shit used to be called. Yeah, no tag max. Wait, do we need this to go This guy has a Kodama room? Soul Core. Yeah, it's a shortcut and there's a chest. And there's a revenant with the Kodama Soul Core. I still don't know how how to get. That should have been a freaking parry. 
<laughs> it counts that as a ledge if you try to attack past that point. I've fallen well, off that one before. If you do well, one of the the charge charges off, you can uh, fall off. Oh, charges yeah. with the spear. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go back here. Yes. Wow. God. Is that a female character? No, it's a guy. <laughs> this guy, he a bitch. <laughs> Was a bitch died like a bitch. I am on the ground. I am blocked. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> nice. I just used it to be special. Absolute clones. Well, now we can go that way and I think there's a Kodama up there or something. I'm not sure. How do we get. Yeah, yeah, we, we gotta need, go yeah. out there. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go this Yaman? way. Yaman? Is there a guy in there this time? Yaman? I don't know. But I'm just waiting here at the door. I'm the real Neo 2 boss. <laughs> Seriously, you can hit it from that? <laughs> That's such a cheese factor. Hold on, I wonder if it works. It doesn't change your hitbox. Try it now. That one does. Exactly. And guess what I can do off that? Mm. Nothing, Stupid. Because it doesn't matter. <laughs> but you know what I can do? I can. Oh, wait, wait, yeah, wait. Yeah, you thought. Now stomp on your corpse. <laughs> Whatever. You're gonna you push me out the freaking edge. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't even fall off. No, it doesn't let you fall. Damn it! You... you can't catch me. I'll never be caughtable. What the hell? Did you hear the scampus? Nah. He was like angry. I'm sorry, scampus. Oh, what the hell? I just aggroed. Oh. Right, let's go this way. <laughs> oh, there is a Kodama here, yeah. See, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> Hold on. I gotta You're put... gonna buff with the axe. Oh my god. You're right, this lasts so much longer. <laughs> Put on a sacred water too. Oh wait, I don't think that'll oh. affect it. Yeah, that doesn't matter. It, you need stamina redu cost reduction. Mm. Skill cost right, reduction. We need to go down this hole. <laughs> no, we don't. Nerd! <laughs> This shit is lagging my game. Oh what my is... god, look how close I am to the edge. Oh, don't try it. <laughs> I 
Get out of my way. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why my laugh is so fucked up there. Oh, what the hell? Why did I take damage from? Because you're a goober and you deserve to take damage there. Oh no! Nice. There's a wall here. I can just emo. Damn it! <laughs> That's the wrong one. It's always a nice, by the way. I'm pretty sure, at least. That's what it always. It's always a nice emoji. No. Or emo, for me at least it is. I think it's he random. No, they're set for some reason. No. I'm pretty sure they are. No, they're random. Upon loading the map. <clears throat> Maybe you're right. There'll be two Rock, Jaspers paper, right here. Nope, two choco cups. Poison Omamari. Did we get this yet? No, we gotta kill this thing up here. A tizzy, come here. Why do you have those? To heal? Whenever I'm out Just of elixirs? Put... Just put normal rejuves on. Yeah. It does heal a lot faster, and it can be stacked on. Damn, that shit has no fucking range. It's fucking... Stop moving around! I'm not doing it the cool way. <laughs> Poison control. Do you not have antidotes set as a shortcut? Oh no, he's eating ice cream. <laughs> yes. Solid snake. It's more like a Batman. Oh my god, dude. I thought there was going to be a snake here. Snake! Solid snake! Yep, and you can just go down here while there's the water still here. Saw was completely underwater for like a second. <laughs> I always wait for the summoner. Also, I see what you mean. Like the freaking stamina bar gets more and more messed up. Yep. The 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 longer it goes on. <laughs> yeah. Now right it's now like... your stamina bar and your HP bar are the same bar. <laughs> For you, it's starting to get to the point where, like, it's starting to merge, but it's not there yet. It's, like, halfway. Yeah, now Tizzy's has gone the opposite way, where his his stamina bar is on top of the health bar. <laughs> if I have fuck? my camera tilted down, and then if I have my camera tilted upwards, the health bar is on top of the stamina bar. And I don't know what the fuck is up with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they get progressively more fucked up. I don't even know anymore. They're all weird. From a distance, like, I can barely tell if, like, it's starting to merge, like I said. Like, I can mm. still tell a little bit, but it's, like, hard. No, I can't tell with yours. Mm. A challenge? 
Bring it on. I wonder if that's Dan Giesling's grave. I thought he, he's only been playing Neo 1. Yeah, Have you even been but... watching his videos? No. <laughs> I stopped watching stop? around 5 or 6. Yeah, I couldn't watch that shit after the second or third episode. I forgot which one the it was. The second he changed his controls from Neo controls to Dark Souls controls, I was like, nope, I'm out. <laughs> sure, that, that the dedicated. If you make L1 the key pulse button, you're fucked. You're just, you're, you're unhelpable. L1? What do you mean? Yeah. Go look at the Dark Souls oh, controls. Oh, it's ew. I, key pulse is R1. I just realized that. Go to the controls. Yeah. Go to the controls and look at... How do you even do that? How do you even change the controls? Type B. Basic game setting? Is that... No. Game mode? No. It says controls Controller. as an option. Dude, I'm sorry. Quick attack, R1, strong attack, R2. <laughs> Shifting button, triangle, interact, circle, dodge, X, guard, square. <laughs> Stance... Stance so in order to do one. a yokai skill, you have to press and hold triangle and then press X to do the R two X, because triangle is R two. So triangle X at the same time just to do a yokai skill. Yeah, and then triangle R one to do the the square, and then R two tri or triangle R two to do the R two triangle. I'm gonna, L1 is stance. I'm gonna keep this control scheme on for like a little bit. That is so. No, I can't. <laughs> no. I can't. I can't. It's I can't. so bad. Like I probably get used to it, but it just doesn't feel like Neo. No, it is. It is so bad. I. He was like, "Now the game feels more familiar," and I'm like, "No." Now it feels even less familiar, because now it's not even its own game. Because it's it's not even like Dark Souls controls, because stance isn't a thing in Dark Souls. Mm. And only if you're playing this game like a bimbling fucking idiot and not key pulsing and swapping stances are you going to enjoy that control scheme. Hmm. And you guarded with square? What the... <laughs> yes. So, in order to do guard attacks, you have to hold square and then press R1 or R2. <laughs> that is disgusting. Exactly. <laughs> Because they want to make it seem as... They want to make... They force this game into Dark Souls. Dark yeah. Souls-like. Regardless of how different it is. It, like, fucked me up now. Like, just putting it on for two seconds literally fucked me up. Feels oh, weird I now. have my control... I I accidentally changed my control scheme. To be? I didn't even realize... And, and I was like... Hmm, why? I'm pressing R1. Why am I not key pulsing? I'm just attacking. And I'm like, oh, because I changed my control scheme. There we go. <laughs> Jeez. I'm never supposed I to get back to B type. Back to what? That was only a test. I use type D. I've just never told anyone that I use a different control scheme. Oh, what's type D? Check Type D out. just swaps the options menu and the touchpad. So the pause button becomes your actual system menu, and then the touchpad becomes the gesture menu, just like Bloodborne. Oh, uh, okay. No, I'll use Type A. I'm used to that one already. Mm -hmm. That doesn't make much of a difference. I actually like the touchpad no. being a... Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, did you see that? I almost fell through the ground right there. Oh, yeah, what the hell? You're like, your foot is in the ground. 
Right there. My feet are in the ground now. Oh, it's because it's like a step, yeah. Oh, whoa! You see that? There's probably some weird out of bounds. Whoa! Go, go block there and like walk into the right spot. <laughs> I couldn't get it to fall through. <laughs> nah, yeah, I'm trying to push you into it to see if you would die. No, I wanted to push you in there to see if you would die. Oh, oh, it's like right there. Push me. Right there. Uh. Ooh. I'll turn around the other way so you can see my face. <laughs> oh, you fucking goober. But yeah. Oh! <laughs> Why did you... <laughs> what the hell? Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me get in the right spot. Oh, there we go. Hit me. Try to slap me into the spot. Oh, shoot. I can't block. Hold on. How did you even do that where you got knocked over by I don't it? even know. <laughs> so weird. <laughs> yeah. It was like you're... Oh, it's right there. Yeah, yeah, hit me like right here. Bad aims, man. Jesus, horrible aims, man. Yeah, it has to be like around here, I'm guessing. The weird shit that I find <clears throat> in video games. <laughs> That's like the crack in the floor in Borderlands 1 that allows you to farm the armory. Well, and I'll see if I can do like a ground emote that'll glitch me into the thing. Oh! Oh shit! That looks like you can probably push me in there. Hold on. Hold on. Stop standing up, Hyro. You gotta not press anything. <laughs> I gotta be sidewards, to be honest. Yeah, let me yeah, get. Yeah, you gotta be more sidewards. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, there. <laughs> oh, it just makes you automatically stand back up. <laughs> Well, at least you know how to do, do it, it consistently. Exactly. You're about me? Or about you? Alright, hold on. <clears throat> I still don't know your government name, so... Okay. Wow. That's amazing. <laughs> you gotta look at it. You gotta look at it. Also, I'm surprised I didn't send you a f FR. It's a little funny joke. Sure. I mean, it is technically. Try to put me in on the other side. See if the other side has like the same glitch. Oh, sure. <laughs> you can send me one. Yeah, I'm going the second. Suck on? Sock on. Sock on these nuts. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, this is interesting. 69. <laughs> yeah! Is that a dog? A dog? Is that your dog? That's a cool dog. Hold on, I want to try and get more into the yin yang position. <laughs> I'll save that as a screenshot if you pull it off well. There we go. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Ying Yang. Oh, there you go. Even better. Hold yeah. on. Don't, don't. Don't move it. Don't touch me. Here, I'll take <laughs> one as well. Your character's itching their ear. <laughs> no, but you can just press the share button and take a screenshot. Uh, or you can hold it for the special... Try to get on the on the top or something. This is what Neo is truly about. It's not about the combat. <laughs> it's not about the the loot. It's all about the emotes and talking. Yeah. Also, your freaking stamina bar starting to glitch out for me. Starting to go sideways, and Dustin's is already like clipping through his HP bar. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh no, I stream for hours, man. Hours. Oh, yeah, no, I had like five people watching just now. Shut up. <laughs> no, they weren't talking. Nah, <clears throat> I don't have any people talk, but I, there's, there's always like one or two people watching. And if someone does talk, it's usually like one of my friends. Nice. Oh shoot, I stood up. Absolute hideous. Oh shit. <laughs> Aw. There's gotta be emo where you can glitch through the frickin' ground. Maybe if I stomp the ground. Curtsy? Where is that one? Oh shh! That one looks like gives you the most drop. Yeah, yeah I, don't I don't know, know how I did that. <laughs> I always find out weird fucking. I don't know how I do it. I just see like one tiny little animation go eat, and I'm like, what was that? <laughs> Try to push me forward. See if I can glitch through like this. Oh shit. Me? I'm not even there at the moment. I took the liberty of going out for a smoke. So far I haven't I haven't seen anyone get out of bounds in any of the maps. 
But that looks like definitely the start, probably. Yeah, but that doesn't look like it'd get you out of bounds. It just look like it'd get you through the floor. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe there's some way to get out of bounds using this, though. Because that just looks like they accidentally put a gap in between two collision points that really shouldn't have been there. Hmm. Sort of thing. Maybe there's more more ones in, like... Mm. Or it's just modular. A lot of the time when that happens, it's because the level design is like like they can take one piece off of another piece and use it on something else, or, sort of thing. So you get you you just end up with those natural gaps and things, especially where there aren't walls directly below it or whatever. <laughs> I don't exactly know how the collision detection in Neo works, but I know it's better than fucking Souls games. At least in terms of not being able to glitch your character out of bounds. <laughs> Souls games, there are glitches with your character movement and just normal gameplay. And then if you're in co-op, it's like, accentuated even worse. Oh my god, these fucking enemies, man. Oh, you guys are actually playing now? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I'll be in a oh, second. Oh, shit. Well, I broke her. Yeah, I'll follow her. Fun catch. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, because the lag sometimes shows you following with something. Following. Even though you don't. Yeah. I've seen a lot of people, like, look like they died, but they really just teleport back. Yeah. That's happened to you at least, like, three times this past thing, but I'm just so used to it that I only actually process it as being something bad if I hear the person go, <gasps> or whatever. <laughs> One second, I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna use the bathroom real quick. Hold on. Oh, Firefly Blade that he was talking about. That it has a uh, life recovery on it by default or something. Well, let me check what it has on it. Auto life recovery and read absorption, yeah. Imbued purity. Hmm, that's pretty cool. Oh, you get the same one? You got the same one? What do you mean? Oh, no, it's a... It's not even... A, I mean, uh, Divine, so it's ass. It has a thousand and five attack rating. Uh, imbued purity six, plus six. Active skill damage. Plus 4.3, high attack key consumption, minus 
Come here. Let's fight this. Ah. Phantom. No, you can't. It's just. Uh huh. It'll do it immediately and like. Trying to get the timing right with the Phantom. That's what I'm used to now. Was that? <coughs> oh, my fucking hell. Did he not get the orb? You have to kill the guys up there. Sorry. <laughs> Looked like you did it first. Fucking posted the frickin' assignment that was supposed to be handed in in the morning. I mean, not handed in, given out in the morning just now. Stupid. So I was there typing up the response. Oh, well, I got a purple firefly blade. Damn it. You do baby damage to me. You 
finna die, to baby. Compared to the freaking one-eyed Oni, anyways. Punch Boy hit me for like 900 damage even with my Tatanashi. Gotta hit him with the... Oh, we're not. Jesus. Oh, you're using that? Hmm. Yeah, I got him into using salt, because I use salt. Salt? Salty dub. No, this- what? <laughs> like, it has nothing to do with what we were talking about. I'm, like, trying to process. We're talking about the soul core ability, where, like, you heal. We're picking up a soul core. Salt. Whatever. All I think of is salt. Here, try to knock me off some weird glitch spot up here. Niner, niner, sixty nine. I'm just being an edge lord and walking along this pillar. Oh, sh you can actually fall off that. <laughs> Oops. Yep. <laughs> oh, can you lounge into it as well? Oh, of course. <laughs> it's like a freaking what do you call that shit? Body slam? Getting ready to body slam! Ah, oh, uh, I messed it up. <laughs> you had more than 50% of your body on it. Oh, shit. Makes sense. Body slam. I'm still alive. Yeah, I have to get it now. There. Well, that's not what I. I need to get it right. It has to happen. There we go. Oh shoot. Nice. That's actually a nice screenshot, probably. <laughs> Hold on, stay right there. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hold on. Let me do like a... There we go. You know what? Stay right there, too. Or not. <laughs> this is... Just crazy. Huh? Alright. I'll be right back. <laughs> Hold on. You can just flex on them haters. It's tea time. The tea is lime green.
job. 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 Job.
Yep. Just been waiting. Yeah, normally she's standing over it, but I accidentally walked too close to her. Drowned. You can drop down here. Yeah, but there's a Kodama this way. Might as well get it now and kill this guy, even if we're not going to do the boss yet. Damn, you kept interrupting me. That's a bot. Wait, what? Guest players. <laughs> what a weird name. Oh, thanks. Wrong way, we need to go this way. I'm gonna write. 
and then down. Before you flip that switch, come this way. Yeah, there's a switch right there. Do you equip anti-paralytic needles? Yeah. I put that on my fourth item bar thing, because I have all four active at the moment. And so when I have my thing at my elixir, it's R1 left and then down to unparalyze myself. Oh, nice. There's an enemy sitting right there. I don't know how it didn't aggro on us. I was just having us go that way to kill those enemies. We don't actually need to go this way at all.
he just turns us into the room we were just in. Which then, we use this, and go back up this thing over here. And then this is a path straight to the boss, <coughs> but you need that Kodama right there, so. And you come this way. Or wait, hold on. Is that the jump down? No. Then what we need to do is... Oh wait, no, it's not this way. It's not this way. It's right here. I mean, you can get the shrine. I mean, the hot spring too. Nice. Easy. This level takes so much less time when you actually know where the fuck to go. Because <laughs> if you imagine how, where we started all the way back up there before we even put the first orb in. Yeah, that's why this is the mission I was talking about that's end game and can take you two to two and a half hours your first time through. Just trying to figure out how to get to everything and do everything. The best parry. Well, the best part about the strike is it leaves them on the ground, so you can draw, strike them, and then final blow them. I wouldn't use any of the other parries, except maybe the piercing wheel or whatever it's called. We have to. If we go into the boss fight, I mean, I guess we don't have to, but he'll die. More than likely. Plus, this next boss is actually a pretty cool boss. He's one of my favorite in this game. What do you mean? Like how many skill points you get? Yes. Most of them go up to three. Most of the ninjutsu things.
Yes, exactly. It's not sheets or whatever it was, papers. The little scroll. Yeah. The Dead Sea Scrolls, except it's the Samurai Sea Scrolls. Oh, that's the Hotaru Maru right there. <clears throat> the the Odachi you just put on? That's the Firefly Blade. In Nia 1 it was called Hotaru Maru. If you look at the description for the sword by pressing L2, you'll see what I mean. It says it in the description, known as Hotaru Maru, or whatever. Hotaru Maru, or however you're supposed to say in Japanese. They don't have an R sound. <clears> Hotaru <throat> Maru. Totally Maru, dude. Sha Turn into Napoleon Dynamite. I mean, if he doesn't get back in, like, the next five or so minutes, <clears throat> you can just go to the shrine and we can boot him. But he's normally not the type to be gone for long, so he must have had something important pop up. He might have also passed out because he's also known for spontaneously getting super tired. There's a very solid possibility that when he came back into his room, he sat down on his bed for a second, closed his eyes, and literally fell asleep. So. <clears throat> well, I've been in a party with him before. Like, mid-talking, and then just start to hear snoring. And at first I thought it was like a joking thing, and I was like, oh, ha ha. And then he'd continue to snore, and I'd be, I'd have to yell at him. <laughs> he'd be like, oh. Yeah. He'd be like, I wasn't sleeping. Jeez, was that his mic? Or is that a clip? What? Yeah. Was that the get no scoped? Oh, Jesus criminy. Yeah. 
It sounded like the kid in the Get No Scoped video. Ooh, baby, a triple. Boy, you gonna wind up dead. That's a good sword. In terms of stats, anyways. Doesn't have a set. Purity is good. Corruption, a lot of the enemies are... Yeah, they're not weak against it, so it's almost impossible to apply it. Oh, well, it only works with strong attacks. It doesn't work with skills or basic attacks like God of Wind or anything like that. It only works with strong attacks, like triangle attacks. And specifically, if it's a multi-hit strong attack combo, only the last hit will shoot a projectile. It's only really worth it with the dual swords that have the single overhead when in high stance. Because, like I showed you the other day, you can do the double flip if you roll backwards. Yeah. Exactly. And that can be decent, but... Again, that shit you have to, like, work into the muscle memory of combat, and that shit can take a while to even... Before you're even trying to do that kind of stuff. That's why a lot of the time when I try to learn something new in these games, I'll just keep doing it over and over again, even when there's no enemies around. Like that spear ability that you get from Toshie, that has to be perfectly timed. It's just like you gotta just keep doing it until you get the timing down. Yeah. <laughs> They can be in Twilight levels, because they have way more of the frickin' Biwas, and they'll frickin' put them behind objects where you can't shoot them or snipe them easily, so you have to deal with them. And normally it's in a dark realm, so they get... They normally end up being summoned as like a yokai shift version of themselves, and that's when they can be a little bit difficult, but... Even that's... Oh no, it's not a worth it stat. Because it overrides other damage stats, like... If a weapon has damage to revenants on it, it can't have melee damage increase or anything like that. But it can have grapple damage. Yeah, well, Diablo had that as well. It's kind of just a byproduct. Well, just so you have something to customize. If all the stats were good, then most stuff wouldn't be worth customizing. For me, that's half of the fun late game is making, like, perfect weapons. Oh yeah, some of them are fucking garbage.
Well, yeah, but that's because it would be unbalanced otherwise. But it is good, but it's only good when it's like A, A+, because then you can get like 15 to 16 percent damage out of it. With a D-, minus, you don't get that much. And since I don't think agility damage bonus exists on ranged weapons anymore, you can't get anything else besides that. So, even though it is a bit of a dead stat, having it on your ranged weapon is actually pretty good. Yeah, sorry. I'm back. No, no. <laughs> I had to go do something real quick. Well, not real quick. Took me like 10 minutes. Probably more. Yo, that minutes. was real quick. <laughs> Are you yeah, guys at the bosses? Yep. Yeah. I got them all the Kodamas and everything. Hmm. We're just waiting at the boss door. He can use an amulet if you want him to. What does that do? Summon you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if he is... Mm-hmm. Deleting what? Just drop everything for Ed. <laughs> drop. Did it work? Oh, thank you. Well, I got an Umbra sight from that guy. Yeah. That's why you do visitor mode and not expedition mode. Forehead. <laughs> Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> You're a penis. I'm more of a a p p kind of guy. You know, I like the. You're, the you're, do you like Europeans? What? Oh no. I mean... Yo, hit me up. <laughs> Tell me that. Tell her to hit me up. <laughs> Dude, I was eating something? And I almost <laughs> choked. <laughs> Fucking disgust. Yo, hit me up. What up, Emil? He came in at the best time. Oh, look, it's a Neo One boss. Mm hmm. Yeah. Nope, Ninetales went to be a Neo 1 boss. Meanwhile... Yeah, he's the best character. Alright, what do you need help with? He looks cool. I thought he was a good fight. I cannot hear you.
man, Reese's candy is like starting to become some of my favorite shit to eat. That shit is good. It's unhealthy, dude. I know that, but it tastes good. <laughs> the fuck? The bag kink. Probably get sick. I get sick, yeah. I mean, maybe if they're like fucking on 30 drugs. <laughs> no, so those people who do that kind of shit probably are, though. That's the thing. Yeah, but the other people that they're doing it with also are normally, yeah. too. <laughs> it's normally like a circle of slaughter kind of thing when it comes to that. <laughs> Welcome to the circle of slaughter. Oh, you play Borderlands 2? As well? Borderlands as well? What about the pre sequel, the best one? Hmm. I'll do you some gear, fam. Ew. I, got I hate that shit. Boots. People use, like, those fucking glitch guns that suck major ass, but think are good. You mean the modded guns? Yeah, that are, like, purple. The Just... purple, blue, lime green, black. Yeah. Uh -huh. I've seen all the rainbow. It's just from manipulating part values. Hmm. It's because the way the game normally decides what color an item is going to be is based off of part values, which are a sum of all the parts on an item. And those sums can only equal up to a certain amount, which makes them a certain color. Even though the scale of rarity has a much wider variety of colors on it. Alright, that's enough Reese. So I eat too many of these before I get a stomach ache. I played a little bit of Borderlands 2 and, and shit. I never get, did anything that got me really far, but I I put a lot of time into it just making new characters over and over again. Hi, Rove, guess what? What? I got divine Japanese scissors that I'm going to sell. How much anima do you give? Point zero, or sorry, point nine. Uh, okay. That's, that's a disgrace, man. You should, uh... End your life. <laughs> I need another Japanese scissors. I said that was the last one. Come on. Yeah, you. Serving size is three cups. What the hell? I ate like seven. I ate like double or maybe even triple the serving sizes now from the little Reese's. 
It's not even bad, it's all the sugar. It's all the sugar and fat and shit. 80 milligrams of sodium. That'll burn your stomach. 14 grams of sugar. Pretty much just drank like the soda. Eating those cups of Reese's. That's enough sugar for me. Where I get a Into stomach them? ache. That's like that little zone that you spawn in at the beginning of the game. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I think you have to. Nothing, it just. It's just, just see like shit. a dreamland. It's the Dark Souls sub world. Hub world, I mean, sorry. It's like the Fire Lake Shrine. Except it's not. <laughs> what? You can't even do anything in there. So? That doesn't matter. It looks like it, though, right? So's like. Yeah. See, you can talk to people and interact with them, even if you can't do anything. That's Souls like, man. <laughs> Mum. Oh, shit. I got people watching me while I'm doing jack shit, as always. I'll start up a random mission just to do. Oh my god, I still have this hideous fucker as my character. <sighs> really? You didn't change it yet? Yeah, I forgot. I loaded up a mission. Nah, I loaded up a mission. Hold on, I'll change him after I finish this. I have Japanese scissors that have .9 anima, defense bonus magic B, elemental damage taken 11.9, faster winded recovery, and anima charge plus 6.7. And you're gonna sell it? No. Oh. Okay. I just re-rolled it to have that. Oh, okay. So you did end up keeping it? Okay. What the hell? Why was that so delayed? Attack bonus courage C, but it and it's an in, inheritable. It couldn't have been an A. God damn it.
So weird how the way of the uh or the dream of the strong. Yeah. I don't even fucking know. Yokai enemies get a instant attack off of uh some bullshit. I forgot which animation it was. And they're really aggressive with the kicks. I got a weapon with the orange inheritable on it. Which basically just you can add to another weapon to give it a rerollable slot. I really like that. Yeah, it's definitely probably the best mechanic they added for late game armor. It means it's, you don't have to the, the orange inheritable lets you add an effect onto a piece of armor without it becoming an inheritable. So it just adds. Yep. Yeah. I don't know how it works if the armor piece already has an inheritable, though. That's what I plan on seeing. Well, you have to have them at max familiarity to transfer the effect. So you gotta use like whetstones or whatever. Got one on one of my yokai. What was that? Nikawa glue. Oh yeah, it's just called glue in this game though. Yeah. You only get it later on in the game though, because... Uh, first difficulty armor doesn't have familiarity. Only once you get to... Divines. Uh, the second difficulty it gets it. Yeah. And that's when you also get the orange yeah. inheritables too. Yeah, it's weird. Here, right now I'm trying to see if we can put a orange inheritable onto a weapon that already has one. Or if it just is gonna... Oh, no, it just adds it onto the bottom anyways. Yeah, that's cool. So even if the weapon already has an inheritable or another slot, you can just add it anyways. And we'll just override something. Throwing bombs? Oh shit, I forgot I rebinded that. Oh, 
My my game just crashed when I tried to put a stat onto a weapon that already had all the slots filled out. Oh, that's not good. But I mean, you're not supposed to do that, so I I guess. Although I don't think it should crash, I think it should just not allow you to do it. Timing for this shit is so freaking restrictive, man. Holy shit, I juggled him. <laughs> what are you juggled using? The spear? Nah. I yokai him. Uh, you know how the yokai thing does like a little twirl before it drops all the blades down? With the phantom, I twirled him in the mm. air. Oh shit! Give me a sec. So it's just a clusterfuck of people now. Alright. Oh. Alright. That's better anyways. See ya, man. Have a good one. Here, let's see if that happens again. You're gonna test if it crashes? See if it crashes every single time, or if it just happened to be, uh, like... ...a sequence of events. Oh shit, I was about to freaking. <laughs> I thought the AI broke, so I was about to sit down for some tea. Hmm, no idea why it crashed. Is it. Isn't crashing this time? Must only happen sometimes or something. Sir, the environment kills me more than anything in this game. So dangerous everywhere. <sighs> if I probably had Tatanashi and I wouldn't have died to that fire.
It's the first time I had my game crash. And it was while doing blacksmith shit. <laughs> PS4 still kicks up during the blacksmith, which is... It's alright, I mean, whatever. Yeah, I think that oh does it to God. everyone now. Yeah. Oh, it just always flips them into the air, I guess. At least humans. Oh, what the fuck? What? You can soul match a soul core onto a weapon. Oh, I saw that in the freaking subreddit and I thought they were just memeing. Or that it was a glitch no, or something. No. Oh, so that's why they have the gold. stat with an orange thing. Oh my god. I... Cause I have one with an orange one and I didn't know, I thought it just only worked on soul cores. Gold earned yokai shift and I can put it onto my weapon. Mm. And then re-roll that gold earned yokai shift into something else that's actually good. Mm. Wow. Soul cores are crazy. So that's why they're worth their own item value. I can see why they're worth their own item value because of that. Oh shit. Oh. I'm paralyzed. In fact, you take this. You want to know how it works? How? It only works with corrupted weapons. Oh. You can't do it with a normal weapon that doesn't... It has to be a weapon that says imbue corruption on it. Corruption weapons you can soul match with soul cores, but you can't Because they're soul... Weapons. Yeah, because they're yeah. demon... Made from a yokai soul. Yeah. That makes sense, to be honest. Yeah. 
Can it be from any soul core or only like specific ones? It can be from any. Alright. <clears throat> can you just roll corruption on a weapon or is it only because they're freaking yokai weapons? I want to say that you can roll it on a weapon, too, because I've seen corruption on weapons that are not normally corrupted by themselves, but I don't know how rare that is, so hmm. I wouldn't guarantee it. Yeah. Maybe you have to hit the end of uh, Way of the Strong or whatever. Yeah, probably. That's probably when everything unlocks. Wow, putting in all those uh, all those benevolent benevolent graves has increased my um my glory by a lot. My glory gains by a lot. Mm hmm. Three hundred and three glory. Yes, sir. Let's see what my placing is. Ooh, 221. Sure, you can have all this garbage. Oh, the Mataza stuff is light armor? I give stock shit. Yeah, when it looks like heavy armor. Yeah. Same thing with the golden gourd. A lot of the light armor looks like heavy slash medium armor. I think the golden gourd at least looks like light armor. It doesn't have like shoulder pads or anything crazy on it. Like, to me, light armor is, like, bare minimum shoulder pads, bare minimum, like, layered, or, I can't remember what they call those, the, the pieces that are, oh, what the fuck. There's a specific name for those stitched plates in Japanese. Hmm. <laughs> it's like, ooh, done something. is even worth getting man all these other transformations are just disgusting <laughs> but I just get him just to get him yeah I need to change my appearance from this ugly ugly buckaroo Okuni has been my favorite one so far. The girl. The dancer, you mean? Yeah. Because I was going to say, Mumyo exists, you know. And Maria. And Fuku. Maria! Can you even transform into Fuku in this game? Yeah. She's just like a young version of herself. Fuku. I don't like her hat. Fuku me. <laughs> Are all 
will turn into Maria. Yeah, but in Japan it wouldn't be. Jeez. <laughs> you have a cup set up or anything? Yep. Yeah, Are you, you sure that's no him? Black teeth, dude. <laughs> no, yeah. I don't even want to see that shit. His armor is so disgusting. Just play as your own character and make your own set like me. I was like, I want to look like a Ronin. What's the most Ronin looking armor? Oh, here we go. There we go. That's my set. Hold on. I'll use my my actual character, matter of fact. Oh, I need to refashion her. Jeez. How much gold do I have? 98k. Should be enough for some tempering. Oh, I want a soul match too. Oh my god, I need gold. Give me gold. What, you, you don't have 5 million gold? Oh, of course not. What, you aren't a rich boy like me? <laughs> nah, I'm not. I'm like doing the H3, H3, double chin neck face like right now. Like, just like an absolute Ew. disgust of you not having 3.5 million gold to dump on reforging at any given time. <laughs> Just give me. I thought we were supposed 3. to be 9. on a. I thought we were supposed to be on a level playing field here. I wish I was. I wish I was. Come on, give me three point nine. Cell load, cell load, cell load. Disassemble load. Cell load, cell load, cell load, disassemble load. Well, the only things you mandatorily for. disassemble are divines. But then again, that probably won't matter when they make ethereals mm. and the revenants drop 400 divine fragments each. <laughs> Just make up a freaking Ronald Reagan four bajillion number. <laughs> yeah, hold on, I'm doing the. Uh, uh, I was eating. I was eating some rice, mate. Some rice. It's a mixed grain rice. No, I just wanna. I just wanna sell divines. Isn't there a thing just to sell divines? Yeah, it's called check everything that you want to save and then press R two. Oh, I do check everything that I want to save, but I don't, I want to like. All right, I'll sell some stuff first, and then I'll disassemble the rest. The only option that they do need. Oh shit, it did the thing again where it loaded me into some random dude's game. Hmm. Even though my password was on. Maybe you turned it off by accident or something. I mean, I was looking at it right as I clicked the button. Hmm. It's a simple. Oh, actually. I'll sell some more shit because I want to get like 150k. Whoops. I just, quote unquote, accidentally died by falling off of a ledge. Oops. You tried it. The game, the, 
the gays. The guy's name was Benjamini, <laughs> anyways. Jeez, do the, man. Do the, 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 the... Stay away Video. from me with this freaking naughty language. Away! 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 That was actually pretty good. For my end. Away! Away! Ooh, that one gives a key. You flagrant rat! That one gives a key as well, and that gives more key. I'll take this key. Alright, I should be joining now. I turned the password off and then turned it back on again. Does it say I'm joining? A visit Dark. has been detected. Fucking. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> wow. That's my favorite way to burp is to just be talking a normal sentence and then just half of a word is just. Bruh. Disgusting. You are just like, is, is this guy serious? Absolute fucking disgust. Absolute tank. Ba -ba -da -da. What an absolute Chad. Ew. Whoa. Oh, you died. Uh oh. See, I wanted to say what an absolute Chad, but the bird didn't come out at the right time. <laughs> Good. You can talk to Mumyo if you want. Mumyo. <laughs> what you do is you put the arrow in her nose hole. What about in the other holes? I mean... It's your oh. personal arrow, though. That's what I mean. Yeah, your, your, your Cupid's arrow into her buttocks. Yep. Oh my god, I'm out of gold already. I just started reforging. Or tempering, or whatever the fuck it's called. Ah, uh, give me more gold! I wish frickin' some of this... What do you call it? Accessories... Could be, uh, sold. Oh, wait, no, they can't... Wait, can they? Yeah, they can be sold for money. They can't be disassembled. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll go sell those real quick. The accessories. Yeah. Like the dragon whistle and the abacus and stuff like that. Those have to be sold. There you go. I have They're enough for one more. Good money. One more reforge. Oh, wait. Let's reinforce. Why are you doing that? Okay. Yeah. That's because plus one basically means it's ten levels higher. Mm, roughly. It's crazy, man. Crazy. Absolute madness, man. So a plus five is like 50 levels higher. Oh, right, hold on. Stop. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. I need to fucking my, fall asleep soon. My level 160 glaive plus 3 has 1,414 attack, and my axe plus 3 has 1,429. Or 27. Nice! So my glaive is almost as strong as my axe. Oh, this M4A3, sure. EZ8. What the f He's a tank. Is that from World E8. of Tanks, actually? M4A3 E8 or something? Yeah. Uh. <sighs> I'm gonna oh, need more Reese's. I think it's M4 E2 E8. Nope. Yeah, but you have to remember, most of the community are nerds that do fucking shuriken builds and go, he <laughs> Oh no. If you start doing a shuriken build, I will not be a visitor in your game anymore. <laughs> oh, 
Oh no, don't be that guy either. <laughs> Once I min-max this character, I'll make a new one. And then I'll frickin' cheese it. Only okay, helmet. Open it, open it, open it. Oh, I didn't even re... re I didn't have enough gold to... To re, uh, whatever. I thought you were supposed to be a female character, Hyro. I am. Oh, I just, you are. I just have bad armor. I haven't... Yeah, I didn't refasten it. Yeah, you both have the same armor on. Oh, he uses the Yuriki stuff as well? Yeah. I mean, it's good. Yeah. He's good. God damn it, I thought that was gonna parry. Revs are ridiculous in this game with key. Unless you have dual swords. With sign of, I mean, uh, God of Wind. That shit is just melting. <laughs> Sometimes. I just feel like deleting you from existence. You know what? Today's that day. I wish they kept the the key the same as they had it in the first game, man. The new key system feels like you're not doing anything for key. That's only because the way to build your character in Neo 1 was to have 99 heart at all times, and you get used to having a ridiculous P-bar. There's a Kodama here. <coughs> I had to uh, rip my mic away before I coughed into the mic. Gord. Shave the meat. Ew. <laughs> That's literally what everybody fucking uses. It's an insane. If it's not the flying Kato set, it's the um, it's just Tatanashi, full Tatanashi. That's it. Or Those are the two sets. Giga Ninja. That. Which one's that one? It's the Ega Ninja one, it's the one that Hanzo uses. Hmm. What does that give as a bonus, though? Ninjutsu power, if I remember correctly. Ninjutsu builds are the best builds. Mess with the wrong super armor. <laughs> yeah. To be honest, that's why I have them as my secondary. Well, it's also with the axe. The game expects you to buff with rage and the other thing. And how really? Do that. I'll buff. I mean. I guess. You mean the Teco? Oh my god. 
I didn't hear Kanye East. Kanye of the East. It's Kevin Hart. Oh, it was that guy? That's who it was. Yeah. You can call it the Teco. <laughs> I can't bother with words. <laughs> they waste my time. It's not even how he speaks. <laughs> Sound like no, a freaking. What do you call that shit? Uh. What are those? A pimp. Dynamite! I'm a pimp. Oh, like from the Norbit thing that I was showing you before? Yeah. Greasy. You're about to Greasy. die, man. No, I'm not. I'm not about to die. Only because I'm here being an absolute Chad. Chad? <laughs> My name is Chad. <laughs> It's so weird knowing a person. Yes, it's so weird knowing a person who's actually named Chad, put like pre that meme. Oh shit! Because now it's like all Chads have a like standard to live up to. It's like if they're not Chad-like, they're gone. They're not a true Chad. <laughs> This way to victory. Actually, wait, that's the wrong way. Either. It's actually up here, but I was just memeing yeah, down it's there. Actually, up here. actually yeah, you can yeah. eat my turtle. Wait, don't, don't, don't click on it yet. Why do you think we're buffing, nerd? Fuck. I think this says loser, bro, Tendo. Come on, ready up, man. Got a squad waiting. I think this is Georgia. Georgia. Holy shit, you can just go through that. I enjoy it when the boss opens with that bullshit. Oh, this shit? We're dead, bud. We're dead. We're absolutely dead. Did no one put water on him? He would have been dead even faster if someone put water on him. Yeah. I like how he shreds into pieces over time. Hmm. Even though he's my least favorite boss, he's I actually found the out. Coolest. Yeah, I actually found out that um, you can throw little water bar barrels on him in his boss boss room. You didn't know that? Yeah. No, yeah. I didn't know that until uh, like a day ago or so. Yeah, on automatically puts the water on him and does like massive key damage. Yeah. You know, you, you you'll want to go down there. That's a shortcut. Okay, don't fall down like I did. <laughs> Ouch. But I love you long time, long time. What are you doing, Hyrule? Where the fuck did you go in the game? I'm putting in an upgrade. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh. <laughs> what? Nah, I just have more health. Say so yeah, I heal for more. Why did you land, like, with face-down body splat? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I didn't. I rolled when I hit the ground. I should have done that emo as soon as I landed. That would have been great. <laughs> oh. Stop. <coughs> you can climb faster by pressing X, you know. Oh. I'm just trolling. Oh my god, my ears. Hey, this was you. Uh, I just that. Uh, okay. Oh, jeez.
No. Uh, yeah. That was good. I give that a 3 out of 5 rating. Wow. What, uh, you think it was higher? It's like, why not even, why, why even rate it if you're just gonna give him half the rating system that you just artificially created on the spot for him? <laughs> it's like, eh, I'm gonna create a rating system of 1 to 5, but you're a 3. Because I know you can do better. <laughs> that is true. Hyro, I'm supposed to be the realist here. Are you really you real though? I'm a realist. You can fake become a realist and then you seem real, but you're really fake. No, I don't mean that as in, I mean that as in the state of mind. I don't mean realist as in like, oh, I'm the realist on the track with the name Dizza or, or whatever. I'm not. Main I mean like Jizzer? What the fuck did you just say? I don't know, I was just saying some dumb, like, 90s rap bullshit. <laughs> Slap the thigh, ride the wave in, brother. Fuck out of here with that. <laughs> what do you mean? That's like one of the best lines ever. Sure. it's not even a rhyme. Slap the I give thigh, that ride a, the wave in. a 1 out of 5 rating. <laughs> No, that's from an actual rap song, so if you're giving it a 1 out of 5 rating, you're giving they like a good suck. rap a 1 out of 5 rating. Yeah, their name is You Suck! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you wanna know what my favorite band is? You're an idiot! <laughs> I don't even know how to fucking start. I don't listen to dubstep. Ear, ear, ear. You listen Boom. to trap. Just be the trap god. Same difference. I hate when people say that. Like, it sounds so weird. With less. Wallet. And more. <laughs> weird, like, skippy noises and crap like that. What the fuck is that thing called? Is that an 808 or hi no? Hat. I know hi hat. There we go. Fucking hi hats. Those shits are beautiful. No trap music is garbage. I will not agree. I mean, I will not disagree, but I like it. Trap music became the lowest form of music, just like TikTok and Vine are the lowest form of entertainment. It doesn't matter if it's a good platform. It's like... That kind of shit boiled down to nothing. It's like those five minute craft videos that were actually like... Three... Thirty second long videos... That don't even tell you how to make anything useful. It's like... Stick a spoon to a toothbrush and then stick it to your bathroom wall so when you walk in the room it automatically brushes your teeth for you. <laughs> it's like, who the fuck wants that? <laughs> Stop, bro. I can't breathe. Sometimes I just do be dying of laughter. Because you're a fucking joke, mate. Whoa. Excuse me. <laughs> oh my god. That deserves a 4 Should out of 5 I rating. Down. Do you like actually practice that? Like practice beatboxing? Yeah. He does. How do you think he does that? Wait, you think he just pulled that out of his ass? Oh, of course. I do all the time. <laughs> See, it's right here. Now have a mental image of that happening in your head. <laughs> Jesus. My freaking back of my neck is hurting from you doing those noises.
Uh, excuse me, sir. We have a professional alert. A professional's in the building. Fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Snoop doggy dog. Eat a hot dog. You're messing with the D O double G. La da 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 da. Can you do that song? La da da da. <laughs> Can't copy and like. Can you do like the the? Oh, never mind. It's hard to do piano with beatboxing, isn't it? Like the oh, what the fuck? What the fuck is the name of that Dre song? The one that's like dun 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 That they have still living, still living, I think, still living by Dr. Dre. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I don't know if you could do that, like, because there's like one of my. One of my favorite videos is the video of Tom and Jerry trying, or it's Tom from Tom and Jerry trying to play the piano, but it's that song keeps cutting in every time he touches the key, the keys on the piano, <laughs> and then he has this like evil demon face as he's like playing the song on the piano. <laughs> mm. <coughs> Just, just look up like Tom plays Dre piano or something like that. Chewy, 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 chew, 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 chew. Nah, you're good, man. No, but you gotta say chewy while we do that. No, I cannot. Yeah. The only thing that I can do well that I've already showed Hyro before is hum whistling. But that's a different talent in and of itself. Mm. Although most beatboxers know how to hum whistle. No, I mean, it's when you hum and whistle at the same time to create a different sound. Like that. <laughs> now you, you drifted in the duck noise. What the? What <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Sounds like a Germa sound. <laughs> oh, it's a guy that I watch occasionally. He does oh, I like just... this. Like noise with his mouth, it's like ridiculous. I don't know how he does it. I just realized well, it's freaking like beeps on a fucking like old, com like a 1980s version of a futuristic computer. It's like <laughs> it's like ridiculous. <laughs> Trizzy's was it, um, Eli? Yeah, it was Eli, right? Elijah, but I called you Eli. Cause I'm a G like Eli, but Elijah, no, I'll call you Elijah. I'll remember. I'll remember. Oh, just in the middle. I'm following you. Look out. Scary. Oh shit. How did you oh, walk you. there, but I get caught? Like, come on. It is so ridiculous. Alright, fucker. 
Yep. He doesn't want it anymore. Seriously. I'm gonna die. Possibly. Kuroku. What is this absolute mania C brain cannot understand? <laughs> they know she's such a shitty enemy, that's why they added that. Just to make it even this is salt the wound. Salt the wound. Stop. Nice. Stop. I only get like audio through one ear. Oh, that's horrible. When you do shit like that, yes. Just gotta walk forward, I think. Maybe. Oh, we gotta, gotta kill the rock. Yeah, so weird. Forward, You're freaking. Stamina is on top of your HP bar now. Maybe we can drop down here. Yep. Just get that weak sauce out of here, man. You can come back for the chest later. Well, we're already doing it, so. That was it. Drop down, so I can get some more magic. I'm 16,000 away from finally being able to use instant cast. Do you have insta cast yet, Dustin? I could get it. I uh, just haven't done the mission yet. Are you waiting for on stream? Just... Yeah. I don't really care that much that I need it. It doesn't bother me that much. <laughs> I'll notice a big difference. I'll be able to buff a lot faster, which I like. Mm, cool. Right. <laughs> it feels more fluent like that. That's, that's why I like it. I have to just stand still and throw a little paper on the ground. There's a purple guy behind the pillar here. The fucking coolest emote, man. It's the only one that has something that stays. It's the only one that makes a little note flourish when it's done, too. It goes like... Doo -doo -doo. Get it, Hyro. I will indeed get it. Uh, please, man. I only get it in one ear. I already get headaches enough from the uneven audio of only having one ear, bud. Ugh. And it's amplified even worse when people do music shit through the ear, bud. I always give Hyro crap for it. Cause he constantly listens to fucking random bullshit. <laughs> Or he used to, anyways. I used I to, yeah. I don't do it anymore because of goobers. Well, also, I just don't want to get. Had some... You get also strike. had someone do it to you for a while, and that. Who? I know Emil still does it, but like, I don't know. He never really listens, anyways. Regardless of if I tell him to stop. Brandon was the worst. <laughs> Ha 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 
Brandon is the only person I know that can make everyone I know consistently mad. Regardless He's just a generally terrible fucking person. <laughs> when you give that much of a fuck about shoes, you're just inherently a douchebag. Oh god, I just walked. Says that as he falls into a hole. Douchebag. Man, this stream has been going on for a while. Oh, and... Yeah, it has. It's probably gonna hit 12 hours soon and then it won't save... ...the rest of it. It sucks I... It works like that. Can't make anything longer than 12 hours. <clears throat> Imagine how many videos are uploaded a day all over the world. Hmm. Insane. Are we trying to go to the boss or what? No, nah, I'm just following. Are... I was following. You've been going in the same circle. <sighs> what do you mean, the one that's up here? This map is very... very crazy. I don't even know what... Ninjutsu to go for anymore. I'm just putting points into freaking kunai just because I have the points. Here's the Kodama right there. Oh, are these the one person ones? <coughs> no, there's multiple. I think after this mission, I'm gonna go to sleep. Mm -hmm. Alright. That's all. Oh, shoot. Alright, let's go. They have the best boss music. Yeah, for me, the those guys are the best bosses in the game, to be honest. They're the most fun to fight. I like, I just like their music the best. Mm. Or in, in Mida, also, he's, he's the most fun human. There's only like 30 bosses in this game, which is like, really surprising. It's not like it was supposed to be double the size of Neo 1. Hmm. But even Neo 1 has way more, like, boss missions compared to this. It's like not dual really. boss. Dual boss encounters. Well, yeah, but that shit was added post patch. Hmm. Post release. Oh, so those are just yep. free updates? Yeah, patch 1.06 is the thing that ad that added, like, Marobashi and all of those, like, harder oh, missions. Okay. 
Hopefully those they add the those. Game. They will add something similar. Okay. If they're not already in Way of the Strong and stuff like that, but then again... Those I were missions it. that were high level that you could only unlock later on in regions, so... There's another boss we miss, if you want to go back. Yeah, there's a boss next to the boss. There's a room next to this one, there's another boss. Yep. There's one over there, as soon as we cross. Oh shit, I almost fell. On my screen, you did. I'm ready. Yeah. I think this is the last boss. Oh no, no it's not, no it's not, no it's not. This one is, I'm pretty sure. I think at least. Not that it's like underground. No, but you know, there's a shortcut. Yeah. Wait, did you get all the Kodava? Oh wait, no, it's in this room. It's in that corner. I think, at least. I don't remember too well, to be honest. Oh, yep, I found it.
<laughs> yep. Should be the last one. You got really lazy right here, and you'll see why. Yeah. What is this scene like? Yeah, I wonder. Wonder what boss it's gonna be. <laughs> yeah. Fucking most laziest shit I've ever seen. It's Yamato no Orochi V2. So I said Neo 2 feels like it's lacking in bosses. Is it spamming? Just fucking get down. Thank you. Wow, really? Oh, it has one freaking pip of stamina, of course. Yeah, I think it's broken. That's all they get for being fucking lazy. Shoot him in the eye, I think that'll knock its stamina. No. Nope. Well, we can kill it with the bow and arrow. We might not have enough ammo though. Such a fucking joke of a boss, man. Oh, there we go. That's funny that we glitched it out in multiplayer literally first time on the boss. It's the Yamata no Orochi style glitch that used to happen where it became uncompletable. Except ah. in this, you can actually shoot the boss. This is what's actually supposed to happen. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and now you gotta walk up and press triangle. Or square, or whatever the fuck it is. Yeah, no, it's triangle. Wait, walk up, you can be in the cutscene too! Look! I'm here! Ooh. Yay! <laughs> Oh, that's weird. It actually makes us watch this cutscene in this game. In the first game, it would just 
automatically teleport you the second. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Our two items combined. <laughs> By our powers combined. Now Kith. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Now Kith. <laughs> Smack the fuck out of my headset. <laughs> Disconnected it immediately while I was doing the meme laugh or whatever I was doing. I don't even remember. My brain is super fried. Fried like some rice. You can talk there and she'll give you an item. Pretty sure she gives you an item at least. Oh. Get la, 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 la. It's ha 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 have you never watched the actual like original video for that where the guy is singing? Uh uh. What is that even from? It's like a German. Yeah, it's like a German guy. You're singing for like the equivalent of like the Today Show or some shit. For Germany? Or something like that. It was like some TV shit back in the day. Yeah. Alright, man. I'm gonna head out. I'm super, super tired. Yeah. Have a good one. Thank you. Peace out. Send me a message if the the Twilight missions change and it's an actual good one. Why wow, <sighs> we're gonna play tomorrow anyways? Yeah. Oh right, I forgot that they don't reset. Yeah, they reset at two o'clock every morning if you're. Mm. Because in Japan it's a completely different time. <laughs> yeah, it's probably like. I don't even know In what Japan, it's there. actually synced up with their day and night cycle. So when the Twilight missions change, it's actually Twilight out in Japan. Wow. Which is cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is indeed true. Yep. <laughs>